Here we are, it's Miller & Miller Auctions and the Canadiana and Folk Art Sale. Absolutely, happy to be back here and happy to be selling some Canadian treasures, some great pieces in the auction today coming from some stellar collections here uh, in Ontario. Yes, we've got the Lawrence and Linda Lang collection. Lawrence and Linda Lang, serious collectors of folk art who traveled the country from one side to the other. They'd leave with an empty vehicle and they could never resist but to buy pieces of folk art, particularly from the Maritimes. Neat stuff there. And of course, Susan Murray, fabulous curator of folk art as well, with a number of her items in the sale. Jim Fleming, we've been so happy to work with the family selling his collection over the last few years, last couple of years. And of course, the famous Marty Osler, the name obviously, it, it's become sort of a brand. We've, we've, uh, we were talking about that the other day. Some excellent pieces in the sale today. We keep going back and keep bringing out more. You never know what you're going to find there. And it's evident in the quality that Marty's eye was a great one. <laughs> yeah, it's amazing. There's a collection of Maude Lewis paintings as well in this sale. Now, when I say a collection, I mean all from individual estates. Julie LeBlanc and her aunt, that story's been all over the country, the discovery of those paintings, as well as a number, a number of Maud's. We actually have a Maude Lewis hand-colored letter with some rare information. In fact, it's one of the few letters that's ever been found with Maude Lewis. These are all coming from primary sources, and I should also say that everything that we sell is 100% guaranteed. So you can buy with confidence today knowing that everything that you're purchasing is 100% authentic with full provenance. It's exciting stuff. It's been exciting for us and it's been exciting for everybody that we work with to see paintings like yeah. this come out that literally have not seen the light of day. They've been in homes since they were purchased directly from Maude Lewis and we're at the forefront of this movement that's happening right now with Maritimes art. It's really, really exciting to see. Certainly. A shout out to Joe and Sally Tour, who right now are in Ottawa doing a pickup. Joe and Sally were the consignment directors for this sale, and a lot of the toil and work that went on to put this sale together was through their hands. And of course, a shout out, of course, to Jackson and Tim as well that are taking your bids today. To Ben Lennox, who took a red eye flight from the other side of the world to get to this sale. He's on two hours of sleep. You talk about dedication. What an incredible guy. We've got an all-star team here with Ballinran Productions, Aiden and Andre give you the salute there with Craig as well. And then, of course, John Finley and Candace as well. What a lineup of people. It's Miller & Miller Auctions. We're going to have some fun today, and we can't wait to get started. Thanks, Ethan. We'll get started right away with lot number one. It's the pair of ring neck ducks by Merle Franklin, and we're currently advanced to 150, asking 175. I've got the bid here, 150, then 175, and 150, 175 on the pair of ring neck ducks by Merle Franklin. Thank you. Yes, now 200. 175, asking two. I've got 175, and then two. Is that it? Is that all? And fair warning, at 175 or 200, sold it there. 175, moving along to lot number two. Another pair of Greater Scop Ducks by Merle Franklin at 250 for the pair. Now 275. I've got 250 here, then 275. Anybody else? At just 250, then 275. Do you have it? At 250, then 275. Are we all done? Last chance and fair warning, 250, 275. Sold those at 250. Moving on, lot number three, the ice fishing duck decoy by Tom Martindale of Wolf Island, Ontario. 275, now 300. 275, a relatively scarce uh, fishing duck decoy at 325, thank you, 350. 325 is bid, now 350. I'm at 325 and now three and a half. I got the bid here, 325, now 350. Are we all done? Last chance at 325, 350. Sold that, sold it's gone at lot number four, the Norfolk County Redhead Decoy here. Interesting piece by an unknown maker, 75 only. Now 100, is that it? At just 75 and then one. And 75 and then one, nice duck for the money. At 75 and then one, I got a bit 75 here, and then 100, is that it? Is that all? At just 75 and then one. Sold it at 75, moving along to lot number five. It's the Black Duck Decoys by Cliff Avon at 275. You got two ducks there at now 300, 275, and now three. I'm at 275, and then three. You got a bit two, thank you, 300, then 325. I'm at 300, then 325. I got a bit 300 here, then 325. And I got a bit 300, then 325. Is that it? Is that all? At 300, 325, fair warning. Sold those 300 moving along to lot number eight. Six and seven have been withdrawn. 
eight is the painted sheet metal goose decoys here, and we're at 175 and now 200. 175, I got the bit here, now 175 and then two. At just 175 and then two, is that it? At 175 and then two, we'll sell it today. Last chance and fair warning, 175 and 200. Sold right there, some great decoys in the sale today. This is my favorite lot for decoys. It's the case set of Plover Shorebird decoys here. Interestingly dated, patented, October 27th, 1874, a cased set, ladies and gentlemen. Fabulous condition here. I can't imagine these were used, if at all. There's eight of them in their box at 1100. Thank you. Yes, now 1200. 1100 is bid, now 12. You've got to be 1200. We have 1100 here. At 1100, then 12, at a bid 11, then 12, at a bid 11 on the set of Plover Shorebird decoys from 1874. They're patent dated, ladies and gentlemen. At 1100, then 12. At 11, then 12, at a bid 11 here, then 1200. 11, then 12, at a bid 11, then 12, but we must move along. At 1100, yes, now 1200, you're thinking. At 11, then 12, at a bid 11, then 12 on the case Plover Shorebird decoys, last chance and final call. 11, 1200. Sold them at 1100. Well done. Great set. Nice buy. Moving right along to lot number 10. It's the patent model of a hay wagon. Judging by the quality and size, we're, we're, make, we're thinking this is a patent model. It's at 100 only. Now 125. 100 than 125 on the well detailed, articulated, functional model. 100 now 125. It'd have been 100 here than 125. I'm at 100 now 125. Last chance and fair warning. Thank you. 125 on the telephone and now 150. 125 and then one and a half. I'll give you one last chance. At 125 and then one and a half. I got the bid on the phone. At 125 and then 150. Fair warning. All through and done. Sold it. And what's his paddle number? Ben. Thank you. Moving along to lot number 11. A nicely carved horse-drawn maple sap barrel sled. Doesn't get more Canadian than that. And what do you say at 325? Got it, yes, now 350. At 325 and then three and a half, it'd be 325 and then 350. I'm at 325 and then three and a half, it'd be 325 and then 350. Go 350, 325 and then three and a half. At 325 and then 350, are we all done? Last chance and fair warning. Sold it right there at 325. Lot number 12, the model of a horse-drawn rock puller here. What do you say on this one from Western Ontario? 125, have one and a half, now 175, Ben. At 150, thank you, 175. At a bit 150, then 175. At a bit 150, then 175. And 175, got it, then 200. 175 and then two, you're out. At 175 and then two, to bid 175 and then 200, you got two. Thank you on the telephone, and now 225. At 200, then 225 on the rock puller model. At 225, 250, and 275, thank you. At 250 on the telephone, then 275, at a bit 275, and 300. At 275 and then three, he's got it, yes, now 325. At 300 and 325, it'd be 300 and 325 and 350, 350, 350, 325 and the three and a half. Are we all done? At 325 and the 350, last chance and fair warning. One final chance. Okay, yes, then 375. At 350, then 375, back to you. And 400, he's right there. At 375 and then four, not much time to think. At 375 and then 400. Sold it there, 375, moving along to lot number 13. The working steam engine model by Murray DeGear. Maker marked here from 1946, a nice wartime piece at 375, and then 400 from Toronto, Ontario. 375, and then four, I've got a bit 375, and then 400. At 375, and then four, and a bit 375, and then four, and a bit 375, and then 400. On the horizontal throttling steam engine at 375, and then four, but is that it? Is that all? We will sell it at 375, and then 400. At 375, four, fair warning, all through and done. Sold it there, 375, sold it at 375. Moving along to lot number 14, the hay rake. You're buying two models here and the model of a horse-drawn stump puller. That one we know is by Walter Stansel. What do you say to start 75? Yes, okay, now 100. You're buying both models here. One of them, we know the maker at 75 and then one. We know the artist at 75 and then one. It had been 75 and then 100. At 75 and then one, it had been 75 and then one. It had been 75 and then one, two Canadian models here. Ladies and gentlemen, 75 and then one, is that it? Is that all? Fair warning, 75 and then 100. So those right there. Moving along to lot number 15, a model of a mechanical stump puller. This one by Walter Stansel who crafted all of the machines he remembered in his youth, made some great models at 50, 75. 
50, then 75 on this stencil. At 50, then 75, it'd have been 50 here, then 75, it'd have been 50, then 75. I could have been 50, then 75, at 50, 75, at 50, 75, at 50, 75. Is that it? Is that all? Fair warning. <laughs> Sold at 50, lot number 16. Another Walter stencil. This one, the stump pulling scene. And how much to start? 225, yes, of course. Now 250. 225 and then two and a half, and then 225 and then 250. At 225, an interesting scene here. Just 225. Wow, what a bargain. It's the morning, ladies and gentlemen. 225 and then 250. This is where you get the deals. At 225 and then 250, a bargain. Last chance and then final call. It's a Wal Walter Stansel. Last chance, all through and done. Sold it at just 225. Moving along to lot number 17, another Walter Stansel. You've actually got a pair of them. They're two men raking, two working gentlemen in the field at 150, 175, 150, then 175, at 150, 175. You're buying two models here, two carvings at 150, then 175, at a bit 150 here, and then 175. Is that it? At just 150, then 175. We'll sell them today, all through and done. Sold them 150. Well done. Lot number 18, another Walter Stansel, a horse drawn hay wagon. Great models he made from his memories of his youth. 225, 250, 275, thank you, 300. A fabulous, take a look at the size, a fabulous model here at 325. You can see the motion at 325 and then 350. 325, three and a half, 375, thank you, 400 and 425 and then 450, right to you at 425 and then four and a half. At just 425, it's one of his great ones. 425 and then 450, get 425 and then 450, 50, 50, 50, 425 and then 450, 475. At 450, then 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 450, then 75. What a bargain here, far below what we were anticipating. At 450, then 475 and 500. Back to you at 475 and then five. On the Walter Stanzel, it's a horse drawn hay wagon. 475 and then 500, a great example of his work. At 475 and then 500, 475 and then 5 and 475, you've got the horses and the figure. At 475 and then 5, but are we all done? Last chance, fair warning, last call to bid. Sold it at 475, moving along to lot number 19, another Walter Stansel. This one, the horse drawn pumper tank at 225, 250, 225. Man, he made some great detailed carvings 225 and then two and a half i'm at 225 and then 250 to go 250 thank you 275 right back to you at 250 then 275 and a bit 250 here now 275 and 300 275 and then three i'm at 275 and then three got a bit 275 here with the 300 at 275 three then 325 300 then 325 and a bit three here then 325 on the stencil horse drawn pumper tank at 325 then 350 325 and then three and a half i'm at 325 and then 350 go 325 and the three and a half are we all done at just 325 and 350 fair warning the telephone no yes 325 350 all through all done thank you 50 75 you gotta be quick 350 then 375 i'll give you one chance at 350 then 375 he's saying no sold it right there 350 moving along to lot number 20 getting into some of the great ontario stoneware in the sale today a big bad three gallon stoneware jug from eberhardt in toronto an 1870s, it's an early salt glazed jug at 125 only, now 150, 125, and then one and a half. I got a bit 125, 150, then 175, 150, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 150, then 175. Are we all done? 150, then 175 on the decorated Toronto jug. Sold it right there at 150. Moving along to lot number 21, particularly rare. Guelph Mark, Peter Anderson. It's an Ontario four gallon stoneware crock. What do you say on this one? Circa 1885, 225, now 250. I have 225, I'm asking two and a half, and then yes, now 275. 250, then 275, it's right back to you at M&M. At 250, then 275, and 300. 275, three, yes, got it, now 325. 300 on the telephone, and then 325. I'm at 300, then 325, I have a 300 here, then 325, I got a 300 on the telephone. Now 325 on the Peter Anderson, you're out now 350. At 325, 350, 375. 350, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75 on the four gallon. Stoneware crock, now 400. 
375 and then 4. Yes, of course. Now 425. 400, then 425. It'd be 400, then 425 from Wyndham Street. 450, right back to you. Yes, now 475. 450, then 75 and 50, 75 and 450, then 475 on the Peter Anderson four gallon stoneware crock at 450, then 475. Last chance and fair warning. Selling to the telephone all through and done. 475 and then 500 right back to you. At 475, you gotta be quick. At 475 and then 5, thank you, 550. 5 and then 550. 5 and then 550. 500, then 5 and a half. It'd be 500, then 5 and a half. I can't give you much time here. At 500, then 550 all through and done. Last ch call. Sold it right there at 500. Well done. Sold to the telephone. Moving on to lot number 22 from Michi and Company. It's the Toronto five gallon stoneware jug. A nice big five gallon piece. What an impact. What a statement. 275. Thank you. 300. At 275 and then three. A flowered Toronto jug at this kind of money. A five gallon, everybody. Pay attention. 300, 325. At 300, then 325. I got 300 here, then 325 and 350. 325 and then three and a half. Thank you. 375. At 350. 50, then 375, I got 350 here, then 375. At 350, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, all through and done. 350, now 375, last chance. Sold it there, 350. Moving along, 23 from James Burns in Toronto. It's a three gallon stoneware jug at 200 only, 225. 200, then 225. It'd be 200 here, then 225. At 200, then 225, it's marked wine and liquor merchant. 225 and 250. I'm at 225 and the two and a half, and thank you, 275 now. At 250, then 275. It'd be 250, then 275. I get 250 here, then 275 and 300. 300, it's over to you now. At 300, 325. 300, then 325. I got the bid 300, then 325. Are we all done? 325, 350. 25 and 50. 50.75 at 3.50, then 75, and 50.75, and 50.75 on the James Burns three gallon at 3.50, 3.75. Thank you, 400, 400, gotta be quick. At 3.75, four, thank you, 4.25, right back to you. At 400, then 4.25, I gotta bid 400, then 4.25, but are we all done? At 400, then 4.25, fair warning. Last chance and final call, 400, 4.25. Sold it there, 400. Well done, nice buy. 24 is up next from Cleverton and Combe, Toronto. It's a one gallon stoneware storage jar. A mark you don't often see, circa 1885, 175, thank you, 200. At 175, now two. I've got a bid 175 and then two, got a bid 175 and then two, got a bid 175 and 200. I'm at 175 and then two, got a bid 175, two on the Cleverton and Comb. A mark you do not see often, 175, here's a bargain. At just 175, asking 200, you have it? Thank you, 225, now 250. 225 and then two and a half. I'm at 225 and then 250, go 250, 225 and then two and a half, we gotta go. At 225 and 250, fair warning. Last chance, final call, all through and done. Sold it right there, 225, well done, nice buy. 25's up next, Robert Jackson. It's a two gallon merchant stoneware jug. Brantford stoneware, of course, nice decorated piece. At 325, 350, 325, now three and a half. 325 and the 350, you have it. At 325 and the 350, go 350, 325 and the three and a half. I'm at 325 and the 350, go 350, 325 and the three and a half. Are we all done? 325 and 350, fair warning. Sold it there, 325. Moving along to lot number 26 from Queeton Street in George and Company in Toronto. It's a three gallon stoneware jug. What do you say on this one? Nice early one here. 200, 225. 200 than 225, great historical pieces. Stoneware makes such a great piece. What a story behind each one of them. 200, 225, it's amazing they survive. 225, thank you, 250. 225 and the two and a half, I gotta be 225 and the 250. I'm at 225 and the two and a half, I gotta be 225 and the 250. Nice form on this one. 225 and the two and a half, I got 225 here, the 250. At 225 and the two and a half, but are we all done? 225 and the 250, last chance of fair warning on this three gallon Toronto piece. Thank you, 250, then 275, just under the gun. At 250, the 275, 300, right back to you, 275 and then three, but we gotta run. At just 275 and 300, fair warning, all through, all done. Hammers up, coming down. Sold it at 275, thank you very much. Lot number 27 from Gray and Glass in Tilsonburg, a two gallon stoneware storage jar. Currently advanced to 700, asking eight, or sorry, 750 now, asking 800. 
At 750, then 8, it could have been 750, then 800. At 750, then 8, it had been 750, then 8, it had been 750, then 8. It's a rare one, everybody. Gray and glass, a short partnership. 750, 800. And it could have been 750, then 8, it had been 750, then 8, it had been 750, 800. Much of their stoneware was lost in the fire that completely demolished their plant. And he, we have a great example here. 750, now 800 at 7.5, and, and then 8, last chance. Seven and a half, eight hundred. Fair warning. All through, all done. Last chance and final call. So seven fifty. Well done. Nice buy. And here we are at lot number twenty-eight. The pair of beautiful stoneware spaniels attributed to Handley in Picton, virtually identical to the pair pictured in the book. A fabulous pair of spaniels. A rare a rare form for Ontario pottery, and happy to have these two in the sale today. What do you say to start? We've got the references in the book there. They're as pictured. It's got that sort of, as they call it in the trade, coleslaw hair, applied hair to a mold-made piece. At 2,000, thank you, yes, now 22 and a half. I have 2,000 bid, now 22.50. 2,000's bid online, I'm asking 22 and a half on the telephone. 2,000, then 22 and a half. I got up at 2,000 here, then 22.50. I'm at 2,000, then 22 and a half. I got up at 2,000, then 22.50. At 2,000, then 22 and a half. Are we all done there? We will sell the pair today at 2,000, asking 22.50 on the fabulous pair of stoneware spaniels, each never separated from the other during their entire life, from the Pecton maker, Handley, at 2,000, 22 and a half, are we all done? Fair warning, last chance and final call on the Hanley Spaniels, all through. Sold them right there, 2,000, thank you very much. Moving along, one of my favorite pieces of, of earthenware in the sale today, it's the Lion Doorstop, it's signed, everybody. It's signed by W.B. Schuler. that's Wendland B. Schuler in Tavistock. Yes, associated with the Henry Schuler of Paris that's so well known in pottery in Ontario. So rare to find a piece, a very rare form for Ontario. Uh, I go so far as to say there is not another one known. And it's signed, and it's associated with one of the big names in Ontario pottery. What do you say to start here? Where are we at? 800, thank you. Eight and a half, then 900, right back to you. 850, then nine on the Lion doorstop from Tavistock, Ontario, circa 1878 to 1885. So rare to find a piece signed that you can link it directly to a potter. 900, thank you, 950, and 1,000. 950, then 1,000, right back to you. 950, then 1,000. I've got 950 already, you've gotta be 1,000. At 950, then one, it'd be 950, then one, it'd be 950, then 1,000. Thank you, now 1,100. 1,000 on the telephone, now 1,100 and 1,200. 11, then 1,200, gotta be 12. I'm at 11, then 12, it'd be 11, then 12, it'd be 11, then 1,200. I'm at 11 here, and then 1,200 on the W.B. Schuler. It's a signed piece, thank you. Yes, now 1,213, right back to you, then 1,400. He's right there, of course. What's there to think about for this rare Canadian piece? A doorstop. A figural doorstop from W.B. Schuler in Tavistock. 13, 14, thank you, 1,500. New man in at 14, then 1,500, 1,600. 15, then 1,600. At 15, then 16, it'd have been 15, then 16. So happy to have the history on a piece like this. If it wasn't signed, you'd wonder where it was from, but now we know. 15, 1,600. I'm at 15, now 1,600. Thank you, 17, right back to you. 16, then 1,700. I've got the bid 16, 17, it'd have been 16, then 17, and the W.B. Schuler Tavistock earthenware, Lion Door stop, now 1,800, 1,800. At 17 and then 18, the research is done. 17 and then 1,800, 17 and then 18. At 17 and then 18, it'd have been 17, then 1,800. At 17 and then 18, the brother of Henry Schuler of Paris, Ontario. 17, 1,800. Until now, there are very, very few, if not any, known pieces from Wendland B. Schuler, and here it is, 17, now 1800. 17, 1800. Thank you, 17, now 1800. 
at 17 and then 18, and if it's 17, then 1800, at 17 and then 18, so rare, 18, thank you, 1900, 18, then 1900. There shouldn't be anything to think about at this level. 19, thank you, 2000, right back to you. 19 and then 2000. I'm at 19 and then two, it'd have been 19, then two, it'd have been 19, then two, but we gotta run, we must move along at 19 and then 2000, and make no mistake, it is selling today. I have 1900 with you, now 2000. Are we all done? Last chance to bid. 19, now 2,000, fair warning. Hammer's coming down at 19, 2,000. Are we all done? Sold it at 1,900. Sold for 19, moving along to lot number 30, The Buffalo Hunter by Joe Lloyd of Brantford, Ontario. What a carving here at 50, now 75. I've got the bid 50 here, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. And I got the bid 50, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. Are we all done? At 50, then 75, and fair warning. Last chance, final call. Sold it at 50. Moving along, lot number 31, the carving of Queen Elizabeth II on horseback, circa 1963. 150, now 175, got it 200, right back to you. At 175, and then two. And I got the bid 175 at the two, 175 at the two, 175 at the 200, and 225. At 200, then 225, I got the bid 200, then 225, and 200, 225. Are we all done? Last chance, fair warning, 200, 225. Thank you, 225, 250. 225, and then two and a half, you gotta be quick. 225, and then 250, 50, 50, 225, and two and a half. Thank you, 275. 250, then 75, 50 and 75 for the Queen Elizabeth II, yes, now 300, 275 and then three, I took it, yes, now 300, 275 and then three, you got a bit 275 and 300, 325, 300, 325 and then 325 and then 325 and then 325, fair warning, all through and done, last chance and final call. 325, 350, 325 and then three and a half. We gotta move along here at 353, 75 and 353, 75 and 353, 75, all through final call. Sold at 350, well done. 32's up next, the man on horseback by Arthur Gallant from New Brunswick, from Dieppe, New Brunswick. 125, yes, now 150. 125 and then 150. It's marked on the top of the base, that's how we know where it's from and who made it. At 150, 175. 150, then 175. And I got the bid 150, then 175. I bid 150, 175. I bid 150 here, then 175. And I got the bid 150, then 175. Are we all done? 150, 175, and then fair warning. Thank you, 175 and 200. 175 and the two, get a bit 175 and the two, you gotta be quick. At 175 and the two, get a bit 175 and the two, all last chance and final call, 175 and 200. Sold it there, 175, lot number 33. Here's a great one, the articulated carved native figure from Nova Scotia, carved in softwood. At 125, now 150. 125, and then one and a half, now 175. At 150, then 175, it's a nice one. At 150, then 175, I get a bit 150 here, then 175, and a bit 150, then 175. I'm at 150, then 175, I get a bit 150, then 175. Fair warning, last chance, final call at just 150, 175, all through. Sold it right there, 150, moving along, lot number 34. It's the Dairy Cows and the Farmer by Andre Laporte of Napierville, uh, Napierville Quebec, circa 1975, 325, 350. Yes, 325, 350, of course. At 325 and then three and a half, I got the bit 325 and then 350. At 325 and then 350, go 325 and then three and a half. Last chance, final call, 325, 350. Sold it there, 325, moving along to lot number 35. It's The Loghead by George Cocaine. And we all know George's works. We all know how he started making them. His barn door was flapping in the wind when he saw a piece of wood on the floor and he propped the door open with the piece of wood and it looked like a lady's torso, so he later carved and dressed it and it never stopped from there. He made a lot of these log head sculptures later on. A fabulous piece at 125, yes, and then 150, made from found materials. 125 and then 150. I'm at 125 and then one and a half. I got a bid 125 and then 150. 125 and then 150, it's signed at 125. At 125 and then 150, go 125 and then one and a half. Are we all done? Just 120, thank you, 150, 175, right back to you. 150 and then 175, I'd have been 150 here, then 175. I've got 150, yes, now 175, last chance, and 200.
Back to you at 175 and then two on the George Cocaine. 175 and then 200. At 175 and then two, gotta bid 175 and then 200. Last chance and fair warning. Sold it right there at 175. Moving along to lot number 36, a pair of creatures by George Cocaine. At 125, now 150. 125 and then 150. 125 and then 150. Nice marble eyes on these. Set them off. 125 and then one and a half. Got to bid 125 and then 150. Go 125 and then one and a half. 125 and then 150. Go 150. 125 and then one and a half. Are we all done? At just 125 on the pair of creatures by George Cocaine. Last chance. Final call. 125. 150. Sold them right there. 125. Lot number 37, it's The Great Grey Owl by Rosario Gauthier of Lac Saint-Jean, Quebec, circa 1980. 400, yes, of course, now 450. 425, now four and a half. I'm at 425, I've already got it. Yes, now 450. 425 and then four and a half on The Great Grey Owl. At 425 and then 450, go 450, 425 and then four and a half. Thank you, 475, right back to you. And 500, not much to think about. At 475 and then five, I got a bit 475 and then 500. 475 and then five and 475 and then 500. You got 500 at 475, thank you, 500 and 550. 550, 600. 550, 600 and then six and a half. 600 then six and a half. Rosario Gauthier at 600, six and a half, now 700. Six and a half and then seven, thank you, 750, of course. 700, then 750. I'm at 700, then seven and a half. I'd have been 700 here, then 750. Why stop now? At 700, then seven and a half, are we all done? Last chance and fair warning on the Gauthier. 750, 800, 800, eight and a half. Thank you for the quick bid there. Very quick, very nice. 800, eight and a half. At 800, then eight and a half. At a bit 800, then 850. Are we all done? 800, then eight and a half. Last chance, fair warning. 800, 850, all through and done. Sold it there. 800, well done. Great buy. Moving along to lot number 38. It's the Armed Sheriff by Sidney Howard of Cape Breton, Nova Scotia, Albert Bridge. 225, thank you, 250. What a look on this one, the armed sheriff. At 225, 250, thank you, now 275. 250 on the telephone, now 275. 250, 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. I've got a bit 250, the 275, and 300. Thank you, 325. 300, then 325. I got a bit 300, then 325. 300 on the telephone now, 325. I got a bit 300 here, then 325. I got a bit 325, and the 350. Thank you, 375. 350, the 375, and 375, and 375, and 350, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. The bids on the floor, on the telephone at 350. Now, 375. I got a bit 350, the 375. Are we all done? Last chance, fair warning, at 350, 375 hammers in the air, fair warning. Sold it right there, and what's his telephone number? Or sorry, what's his bidder number, rather? <laughs> Moving along to lot number 39, thank you very much. At, it's The Birdhouse by Amon Chatagnier. It's a collage. You've seen his works before. Have another one here from St. Isidore, Quebec, circa 1970. You can recognize these from across the room. They littered his property at 700, now seven and a half, and he never sold during his life. He never sold them. Didn't do this for the money. 800, thank you, eight and a half, of course. Now 900, we've sold these for five figures. 900, then nine and a half. I'm at 900, then 950, thank you, 1,000. 950, 1,000, then 1,100, right back to you. 1,000, then 1,100. I'm at 1,000, yes, I've got 1,000. I'm asking 1,100 on the Birdhouse Collage by Edmond Chatagnier at 1,000, now 1,100. At 1,000, then 11, at 1,000, then 11, at 1,000, then 11, at 1,000, then 11. Had a style that you could recognize readily. 1,100, now back to you at 12. What's to think about? At 1,100, then 1,200. I'm at 11, then 12, at 1,200, then 13. 12, and then 13. At 12, and then 13, got a bit 12, 1,300 on the Chatagnier. At 12, and then 13, got a bit 12, 13, 12, and 1,300. 12, now 1,300, still far below what we were expecting. What an opportunity here in this Chatagnier. 1,200, 13. You've seen what we've sold them uh, for before. At 1,200, 1,300. At 12, and then 13, care to try it one more time? At 1213 on the Birdhouse Collage, last chance. I've got to move along. At 1200, we'll sell it today or 13. Fair warning. One more chance at 121300, all through and done. 
Sold it right there, 1,200, well done. Moving along, a Minden, Ontario oil on board by Nicholas Horniansky. And what a stunning, stunning landscape here. Of course, his works are in the National Gallery, in the, in, uh, the Royal Ontario Museum, Horniansky's works are 275, thank you, 300. 275 and 300. At 275, three, thank you, 325. I've got a bit 300 than 325 on this Minden landscape. 350, thank you, 325. 350, 375, and 400. 375 and then 400. Go 375 and then 400. At 375 and then 400, the location is identified, which is, as you know, so important with pieces like this. 375 and 400. I'm at 375. I've got it already. You must be four on the Horniansky. At 375 and then four. We're going to be 375 and then 400. 375 and then four. Are we all done? Last chance. Fair warning. Hammers up at 375 and 400. Thank you. Then 425, just under the gun. 400, then 425. I've got the bid 400, then 425. And a bid 400 here, then 425. Anybody else? At 400, then 425. Fair warning. 425, 450. 425, and then four and a half. Got to be quick. At 425, and then 450, all through and done. Sold it there. 425. Moving along to lot number 41. It's the Quebec Cabin in Winter by Graham. Norwell, another great Canadian artist here. This one from Kingston, Ontario at 150, now 175. At 150, then 175, the artist, of course, from Kingston, Ontario. The scene, a Quebec cabin in winter. 150, just 150, asking 175 for a very well-known, very important Canadian artist. At 175 and 200. 175, two, got it, 225. At 200, then 225, I got the bit 200, then 225. At 200, then 225 on this great Quebec cabin in winter scene. 200, 225, what a bargain here. Pay attention, everybody. 225 and then 250, look them up. At 225 and then 250, go 225 and then 250, 275. At 250, then 275, a favorite subject of this artist is the Quebec cabin in winter. 250, 275. I have 250, yes, now 275. It'd have been 250, 275, and 300. At 275, and then 300. 275, and then 3. It'd have been 275, and then 3. 275, and then 300. At 275, and then 3. Anybody else? At 275, and then 3. Are we all done? Last chance, fair warning. Thank you. 300, now 325. At 300, then 325. I got a bit 300 here, then 325. Anybody else? At 300, then 325, 350. 325, and then 350. Shouldn't be much to think about at all. 350, 375. At 350, then 375. I got to be 350, 375, and 350, 375. Fair warning. All through, all done. 75 and 400. 375 and 400. Got to move quick. At 400, then 425. 400, then 425 on the Graham Norwell. At 400, then 425. I got to be 400 here, then 425. At 400, 425. All through and done. 450, 450, 425 at the four and a half. 425 and then four and a half. I got a bit 425. We got to move along. 425 and 450. Sold it there. 425. Moving along to lot number 42. The Seated Child in Meadow by Frederick Challoner. Challoner did a lot of large murals for different government buildings and offices. A well known Canadian artist, an early artist, circa 1897. This piece, it's signed and dated at 1200. What a great, great oil on canvas. 1,213. Got to bid 1,200, then 13. It'd have been 1,213, 100. 1,200, then 13. It'd have been 1,200, then 13, 100. I got 12 here, then 13, and 12, and then 13. You got to bid 12, and then 13 on the Challoner. At 1,213, are we all done? Just 1,213. We'll offer one last chance. Final call, 1,213. All through and done. Sold it right there, 1,200. Well done. Moving along, lot number 43, another important Canadian artist, Joseph Julius Hume, the woodland burial plot, oil on canvas, six and a half, six and a half, now 700 we're asking, of course, on the telephone, now 750, 800, 800, 850, 900, 900, 900, 950, 1,000, we've got 1,000 here, now 1,100, you've got to be 1,100, Ben, 1,100. I'm at 1,000 here, you've got to be 11. I'm at a thousand, bit eleven, bit thousand, then eleven, bit thousand, then eleven hundred. I'm at a twelve, and eleven, then twelve. And, sorry, yep. thousand, eleven. Thank you, twelve hundred. Eleven now, twelve hundred. Back to the computer. At eleven now, twelve hundred. I'm at eleven, then twelve. At a bit eleven, then twelve. At a bit eleven, then twelve. At a bit eleven, then twelve hundred. 
I'm at 11, now 12, at a bid 11, then 12, at a bid 11, 100 is bid, now 12. The bid's on the telephone at 11, asking 1,200. Back to you, 11, 12, are we all done? Last chance, fair warning, hammers up, all through and done. Sold it, and what's his bidder number, Ben? His bidder number. Thank you very much. Moving along, lot number 44. Action between Shannon and Chesapeake. It's a war of 1812. Reverse glass painting. What do you say to start on this? Asking 1,400. I've got 13 here. I've got 13 here. 13, then 1,400. At 13, and then 14. It'd have been 13, then 1,400. 13, an important Canadian scene here on glass at 13, 1,400. At 13, and then 14. It'd have been 13, and then 14. It'd have been 13, 1,400. I've got 13, now 14. It'd have been 13, and then 14. 13, and 1,400. Are we all done? 13 and then 1400, fair warning. Last chance, final call at 13, 1400. Thank you, now 1500. 14 we have, now 1500. We had it here. We had it left. You must be 15. We had it left. At 14, then 1500. 14, now 15, if you'd like it. At 14, then 1500. I've got to bid 14 here, now 15. Last chance to bid, fair warning, 14 or 15 on action between Shannon and Chesapeake. The War of 1812 reverse glass painting all through and done. Just under the gun, I'll take it. Yes, now 1600. That was close. 15, then 1600. At 15, then 16. Got a bit 15 here, then 1600. One chance to answer back. Are we all done? Last chance and fair warning. So there, 1500. Well done. Playing with fire. Moving along to lot number 45. Currently advanced to... 2,500, asking 2,750. We have 25 here, now 27 and a half. I've got 25 and then 27 and a half. On the 1858 Royal Canadian Yacht Club Regatta by Robert Whale. It's a whale, ladies and gentlemen. Does it get any better? At 2,750, 3,000, thank you. 3,000, now 32 and a half. Yes, 3,000, then 32 and a half. Thank you, 3,500. So rare to find a piece like this, so historic, so Canadian, from the inaugural Royal Canadian Yacht Club Regatta. 3250, now 3500, back to you. At 32 and a half, yes, now 35. I've got 32 and a half and then 35, it'd be 32 and a half. The Scarborough Bluffs. 32 and a half, historically significant work of art here by Robert Whale. His works, of course, in all the galleries, it doesn't get any more. Canadian and historically significant. It's circa 1859 here. It's an early work. 32 and a half, now 3,500. 32 and a half is bid, now 35. 32 and a half, now 35. I got a bid 32 and a half and then 35. The Royal Canadian Yacht Club. How's that for subject? Dated, 35. Thank you, now 37 and a half. I'm at 35, now 37 and a half. 37 and a half and now 4,000. 37 and a half is bid, now 4,000 on the Royal Canadian Yacht Club Regatta by Robert Whale, dated, we know the location, so rare to have all these factors in an early work like this by such an iconic Canadian artist, Robert Whale, so happy to have this piece in the sale today. 37.50 is bid, I'll ask 4,000. We have 3750 already. You must be 4000 if you'd like to bid at 37 and a half and now 4000. I've got 3750 then 4, got to bid 3750 then 4000. I've got to move along at 3750. Care to give it one more try? It might be your day at 3750 4000 on the Royal Canadian Yacht Club Regatta by Robert Whale 1858, a dated piece, a fabulous piece by Canada's Robert Whale. At 37.50, 4,000, 37 and a half and then 4,000. Is there any further bidding? I'll put the hammer in the air. At 37.50, 4,000. Are we all done? We're gonna sell it today. At 37.50, we will be selling the work today at 37.50. 37 and a half and then 4,000. Selling today, last chance and final call to bid on the Robert Whale, hammers in the air and coming down, 37 dollars Any further bidding? 
sold it right there at 37 and a half. Sold that at 37.50. Thank you very much. Lot number 46, the carved beaver. Signed G. Williamson at 325, now 350. 325 and then three and a half, again 325 and then 350. I'm at 325 and then three and a half, again 325 and then 350, 50, 50, 50, 325 and then three and a half. Last chance, fair warning at 320, thank you, 350, 375. A cute carved beaver signed at 350, then 375. At 350, 375, and last chance, 350, 375. Very well done, all through and done. Sold it right there, 350. Well done, moving right along to lot number 47. Lot number 47 is the, what do we got coming up next here? Then another carved beaver, this one from Clement Dubay at 350, 375. 350, then 375 on this carved beaver by Clement Dubay at 350, 375. Thank you, 400, then 425. I've got a bit 425, and then 450. 425, and then four and a half. And a bit 425, and then four and a half. Got a bit 425, the iconic Canadian beaver at 450, 475. Sign piece, 450, 475, and the 500. 475 at the 5, and 475 at the 5, and 475 at the 500. I've got a bit 475 at the 5, and 475 at the 550. 500, then 550. Got a bit 500, then 550. 500, then 5 and a half, and a bit 500, then 5 and a half. Are we all done? 500, 550 on the carved beaver by Clement Dubay. Hammers in the air all through and done. Sold it right there. 500, well done. Moving along, lot number 48. A pair of carved painted robins here, each in their own style from Ontario and Quebec. 400, what a great looking pair. Now 425. 400 then 425, thank you. 450, 475 and then 500, got it, then 550. 500 is bid, now five and a half. Five and then five and a half, and a bid 500 here, then five and a half on your buying the pair. What a great look. 500 then five and a half, and 500 then five and a half. One of them's marked it by its location in Kamaraska, which is a, a town in Quebec. At 600, now six and a half. 600 is bid, now six and a half. It'd have been 600, then 650 on the pair of carved robins. 600, then six and a half, carved and painted. 600, 650, are we all done? Last chance, fair warning, 600, 650. Sold them, 600, well done. Moving along, lot number 49, the carved grouse by Kaz Kizik of Clinton, Ontario. Great carving here, 250, now 275. Signed and location marked. 250, now 275. I get 250 here, then 275. I get 250. Anybody else? 250, then 275 on the car of Grouse. 300, thank you. 325. You've got to be 325. You've met our bid at 300, then 325. I got to be 300 here, then 325. At 300, then 325. You've got to be 325. They left 300 all through at 300, 325. Fair warning. Sold it right there. 300. Well done, moving along, lot number 50. Another carving by Kaz Kizik, this one, the Holstein Cow, circa 1960. 325, now 350. 325 and then three and a half. I've got the bid 325 and then 350, go 325 and then three and a half. A carved Holstein Cow at 325, 350, 325 and then three and a half. Are we all done? 325 and then 350. Last chance, fair warning on the cow. Hammers up. Sold it at 325, moving along to lot number 51. A grazing buffalo by Robert Wiley, stylized buffalo here, from Thomasburg, Ontario, circa 1980. Currently asking 425, I bid 400, thank you, 450 now. 425 is the bid, now four and a half. I've got a bid 425 and then 450. At 425 and then four and a half. At a bid 425 and then 450, 50, 50, 50, 425 and then four and a half. At just 425 and then 450. Are we all done? Thank you. 50, now 75. 450 then 475, I took it. Yes, 475 and then 500, right back to you. At 475 and then five and 475 and then five and 475 and then 500 on the stylized grazing buffalo by Robert Wiley, a relatively rare form and size for his work. At 475 and 500, last chance. 475 and then five, are we all done? Fair warning. Sold it at 475 and moving on to lot number 52. And what do we have? The Prowling Cat, the Cat in Motion by Albert Hoto of Dunville, Ontario. What a great look to this one. 
225 and then 250. A big cat. 250 then 275. I'm at 250 then 275. I'd have 250 here then 275 and 300, 325. And that bids with LA at 325 and then 350, 375. Sorry, 325 and 350. Got ahead of myself. Now 375. 350 then 375. I got a bit 350 then 375. I'd have 350 here then 375. I'm at 350 then 375. I'd have 350 then 375. Is that it? Is that all? You've got it? Yes, now 400. 375 and then 4. And 4. 425. 400 than 425. At 400 than 425. I got a bit 400 than 425, of course. Now 450. 450. Right back to you, Eminem. At 425 and then four and a half. At a bit 425 and then 450. 50, 50, 50, 425 and then four and a half. And 475. 450 then 475 on the Prowling Cat by Albert Hoto. At 450, 475 and 475 and 475 and 475, of course, and 500. 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 500. At 550. Right back to you. At 500 then 5 and a half. I'm at 500, then 550, go 500, then 555, 55, 50, 600. At 550, then 600. Five and a half, and then 600. And I get the bit five and a half, and then six, and a bit five and a half, and then six, and a bit five and a half, and then six, and 600, 650. 600, then six and a half. Sorry, 600, then six and a half. At 600, then six and a half, at a bit 600, then 650. Are we all done? At fair warning, last chance and final call. Sold it right there at 650. Or sorry, 600, thank you. At lot number 53 now, the carving of a Clydesdale horse and cow. So you're buying two carvings by Albert Hoto again. Currently advanced to 150 for this pair. Now 175. At 150, then 175. It'd have been 150 here, then 175. By the Niagara Peninsula carver, Albert Hoto. 200, thank you, 225. You're buying a pair of his works. 200, then 225. I gotta be 200 here, then 225. At 200, then 225. I gotta be 200, then 225. I gotta be 225. I gotta be 200, then 225. Thank you, 250. 225, and then two and a half. At 225, and then 250, go 250, 225, and then two and a half. 225 is bid, yes, now 250 at 225 and then two and a half. Fair warning, last chance, final call on this pair of carvings by Albert Hoto, all through and done. Thank you, 250, 275. At 250, 275, you gotta be quick. 250, then 275 and 75 and 75 and 75 and all through and done. Sold them right there, 250. Moving along, lot number 54. It's the cowboy on horseback by Percy Besenson of Brickton, Nova Scotia, a great Maritimes carver circa 1930 and earlier work at 125, now 150. 125 and then one and a half. 125 and then one, Vitigo 125 and then one and a half. Could you believe this was carved using only a jackknife? Think of that. At 150, 175 and 200, I would think so. At 175 and then two, got a bit 175 here and then 200, go 225. At 200, then 225, and a bit 200, then 225. At 200, then 225, and a bit 200, then 225. I got a bit 200 here, then 225, and go 250. 225 and then two and a half. Do you have two and a half? I'm at 225 already. Now 250, thank you, 275. 250, then 275, and then 75, and then 75, and 250, then 275 on the cowboy on horseback by Percy Besenson. At 250, now 275. At 250, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. Is that it? Is that all? 75 and 300, 75 and 3, at 275 and then 3, you got a bit 275 and then 3, have at 275 and then 300, fair warning, all through, all done at 275 and 300 on the Basinson, last chance. Sold it right there, 275, moving along to lot number 55, the performing seal by Alcee Saint Germain of Saint Antoine Ab, Quebec, at 400 for this performing seal carving. At 400, then 425. 400, then 425. It'd have been 400, then 425. The color and the quality is second to none in this work. 400, 425, of course. Now 450. 450. 425. Now 450. Only a few word, uh, works by Alcide Saint Germain in the auction today. We've sold many before. Two, uh, 425, 450. 425 and then four and a half. Thank you, 475. At 450, 475. It'd have been 450, then 475. It'd have been 450, 475. At 450, now 475, and then 450, 475. This, among the upper tier of his works, the color, the form, everything here is a great one. 450, then 475 and 500. 475 and then 500. I'm at 475 and then five, thank you, 550. Five and then 550. At 500, then 550, go five and a half, it'd be 500, then five and a half. At 500, then 550, go 550, 500, then five and a half. Are we all done there? 
At 500, then five and a half, we gotta run. 500, 550, thank you, now 600. 600, gotta be quick. At 556, thank you, six and a half, right back to you. 600, then six and a half, it'd have been 600 here, then 650. I'm at 600, then six and a half. Hammers up and coming down at 600, then 650, fair warning. Sold it right there, 600, well done. Moving along to lot number 56, the articulated wooden figure by Alcide Saint Germain. 450, now 475 from Saint Antoine Abbe in Quebec. At 475 and then 500, thank you 500, 550. A fabulous example of his work. At 500, 550 only, far below what we were thinking for this fabulous, exceptional example of Alcide Saint Germain's work. Thank you, five and a half, now 600. Five and a half, 600, then six and a half, right back to you. At 600, then six and a half, now 700 on the articulated wooden figure, seated, of course. At 700, then 750. 700, then seven and a half, it had been 700, then seven and a half, it had been 700 here, then 750. I'm at 700, then 750, 800. Seven and a half and then eight, thank you, 850. 800, then eight and a half, it'd have been 800 here, then 850. 850, 900. 850, then 900. 900, then nine and a half. I'm at 900, then nine and a half, it'd have been 900, then nine and a half, it'd have been 900, then nine and a half on this fabulous example of L.C. Saint Germain's work. 900, 950, thank you, 1,000. At 950, then 1,000, and 1,100. 11, then 1,200. 11, then 1,200. I'm at 11, then 12, it'd have been 11 here, 1,200, then 13. Right back to you at 13, do you have it? At 1,200, then 13, and 1,400. 13, and then 1,400. At 14, now 1,500. At 14, and then 15, it'd have been 14, and then 1,500. If you have any of his works, if you've looked at his catalog of works, see how this one stacks up, and I think you'll agree it's worth the money. 14, now 1,500. At 14, and then 15, it'd have been 14, then 1,500. Care to try it one more time? 14 and then 15, we must move along. At just 14 and 1500, last chance and fair warning, I've got the hammer in the air and it's coming down at 14 or 1500, fair warning. Sold it there, 1400, well done, great piece, nice buy. Moving along, lot number 57, it's the Weary Traveler and Fishing Boy, a pair of works by Hazel Kinney, a pair of American folk works at 100 then 125. Got a bit 100 here, then 125. I got a bit 1, then 125. And I got a bit 100, then 125. Fun scenes, 100, then 125. You got an opportunity to purchase two of them at 100, then 125. Thank you, 150. 125, and then one and a half. I'm at 125, and then 150, and 150, 175. 150, then 175. I got the bid 150, then 175, and then 175, and then 175. I'm at one and a half, and then 175, and fair warning. Last chance, thank you. 200, 175, and then 200. At 175, and then two, got a bid 175, and then two, to be 175, and then 200. 175, and then two, last chance. 175, and then two, fair warning. All, thank you, 200, then 225. 200, then 225, to be 200. The 225 at the 225 at the 225, all through and done. Sold them there at 200. Well done. Lot number 58. The Evolutionary Pen Drawing by Steve Such of Branford, Ontario, circa 1970. A signed piece. 100, 125. 100, then 125. A creative powerhouse. Look at the imagination. 100, then 125, I got a bit 100, then 125 on the pen drawing by Steve Such. At 100, 125, I got a bit 100 here, then 125, it had been 100, then 125. A fine example of his imagination here at just 100, now 125, fair warning. All through, all done, hammers up. Sold it at 100, thank you. Lot number 59, another drawing, this one of two hairy men, a pen drawing by Steve Such of Brantford. This one as well, circa 1970, asking just 100, now 125. 100, then 125, got it, then 150. 125, and then one and a half, I got a bit 125, and then 150, go 150, 125, and then one and a half. I'm at 125, yes, I have it. Now 150, you're in. At 125, and then 150, fair warning. 125, one and a half, all through, all done sold it right there at 125 moving along lot number 60 the habitant man, habitant man carrying pails by octave henri julian 
by Octave Henri Julian. Octave Henri at 150. Thank you. 175. 150 here. Now 175. I've got a bid 150, then 175. I've got a bid 150 here, then 175. Thank you. 200. 175, and now two. You're in. Yes, at 175, now 200. At 175, two, then 225. Yes, 225. I'm at 200, then 225, now 250. 225, and then two and a half, and then 225, and then two and a half, and then 225, and then two and a half. Similar to many of his works. This one at 250, 275. At 250, then 275. It's got the embossed stamp that you want to see in the lower left at 275 and 300. 275 and then three. You got a bit 275 and then 300. At 275, a nice graphite drawing here. At 300, then 325. 300, then 325. You got a bit 300, then 325. At a bit 300 here, then 325. At a bit 325, at a bit 320. You got it? At 300, then 325. Is that it? Is that all? 325, 350. Thank you. At 325 and then three and a half, we've got you in. Yes, thank you. Now 350, 375, but you're out again. At 350, then 375. At 350, then 375, and then 400. 375, and then 400. Here we go. At 375, and then four. Got a bit 375, and then four. And a bit 375, 400, then 425. On the Habitant Man carrying pails by Octave Henri Julien. At 400, then 425. At a bit three, 400, then 425. Are we all done? Last chance, fair warning. Hammered, thank you, 425, just under the gun, then 450. 425 and then four and a half, you have it. 425 and then four and a half. 425 and then four and a half, at a bit 425 and then 450, 450, 475. 450 then 475. At 450 then 475, it's a little bit slow, isn't it? At 450 then 475, at a bit 450 then 475, at the 475, at the 475. Anybody else in fair warning? Last chance, final call at 450, 475 on this. Sold it right there. Thank you very much. I'm going to pass the gavel over to my brother, Ethan, for lot number 61. Thank you, Justin. Lot number 61 moving along here, Canadiana and folk art. Here we go with the Cyril Hurdle piece here. A bit of Lunenburg art for you here. 600, now 600. 50, 600, now six and a half, now 700, 650 here, 700 where, 650 now seven, at six and a half and 700, 700, thank you, 750 now, at 700, 750 now, at 700, 750 now, seven here, 750 where, 700 now, seven and a half, at seven now, 750, fair warning then, all in and done, 758, 758, 758, fair warning, eight, thank you, 850, at eight, now 850, eight, now 850, now nine, 850 here, 900, 859. Anybody else? 900, thank you, 950 where? Hammers up, 950, 1000. 951 at 951 now 1100 uh, 1100 1000 1100 at 1000 11 now 12 please thank you took it 1100 1200 now took it 1300 12 1300 I have 1200 13 thank you now 1400 13 1400 13 1400 anybody else are we all in and done is that it 13 14 thank you 1500 14 1500 took Took at 1600 now. At 1500, 1600 on you. 1500, 1600 now. Took at 1700, 1617. Took at 1800 now. 1700, 1800 now. At 1700 here, 1800 where? Fair warning then. Hammers in the air. All in and done. 1700, 1800 now. <laughs> Sold. Gone. 1762, the decorated dog, Howard Finster, bit of outsider art for you here. I have 550 and 600, 550, now 600, five and a half, now 600, your turn at 556, 556, Marty Osler collection, 550, 600, where? Six took at 650, 600 now, 650, where? At 600 now, 650, thank you, 700, where? 650, 700 now, at 650 here, 700, where? 650, 700, is that all? Are we in and done? 650, 700, last chance and final call. I have the 650 here, 700 where? Sold at 650. Sold it at 650. We have 63. This, the Moses Tolliver man with walking sticks here. There's an unusual one. 125, 150, 125, 50. 
at 125, 50, 425, 400 now, 425 on this one at 425, at 425, properly signed, 450, 475 now. 475, 500, Marty Osler collection, 550, 600 where? At five and a half, 600 where? Marty Osler collection, 550, 600 where? I have 550, 600 where? Took it, 600, 650 now. At 650, 700, 650, 700. I have 650, 700. Is that all? At 657, took it 750 now. It's on you. 800 now. 758. You're out. 758. You are out. 750 and 800. Fair warning then. 758. Final call. 750. 800. 758. Sold at 750. Moving along to 64. 64. This one, the wedding scene by Shields Landon Jones. What do you say on this one? Absentee at 150, 175, 200, 175, 2. At 175, 2. A buy and a bargain here, 75, 225. 25, 50 now. At 250 now, 75. Sleeper, 75. 50, 75, 300 now. At 75, 325, 50 now. 25, 50. At 325, is that all? 350, 25, 50. 2550, yes, now 75. 350, now 75. Now 400, please. 75, 400 now. At 75, 400. Bids in then. 75, 4, get them in. Is that fair warning? 75, 400, fair warning. 75, 4, 300, 75, 400, 75, 4, now 100. <laughs> Sold it right there. And then 65, the T Rex, Howard Finster. Here again. What do you say on this? Yes, 475, 500 now. 475, 5. 475, 500, 475, now 5. 475, 500 here, 475, now 5. 475, 575, now 5. Properly signed, 1999, 475, 5. 75, 500, is that all? 475 here, 500 where? At 475, 500, 475, 500, 475, now 575, 5. <laughs> Sold, gone. 66. This is the portrait. Lee Godey, fabulous Chicago artist, 20th century, 550 here, 650 now, 700. It's a great one. One of her great ones, 650, 700. 650, 700. 650 now, 700. 100, 750, 800, 750, 800, 750 here, 8, one of her great ones, 850, strongly graphic, 850, 800 here, now 850, took it, 900, one of her great ones, 950 then, 950, at 950, now 1,000, took it, 1,100, 1,100, 1,000, 1,100, 1,100, one of the great ones. 1,100 then, hammers up. 1,200, 11, now 12. Took it, 1,300 on you. 12, 1,300 please. 12, now 1,300, 12, yes. Now 1,300 please. 1,200, 1,300, hammers in the air. Fair warning. At 1,200, 1,300, 1,200 now. 1,300 where? 12, now 13, took it, 14 on you. 1314 took it 1500 thank you 14 1500 thank you at 1400 here 1500 where i have the 14 here 15 where is that all is that it 1400 1500 where 1400 here now 1500 last chance final call and 1600 15 1600 yes took it 1700 back to you worth it 16 1700 back to you 16, 1700, hammers in the air, fair warning then, final call at 1600, 1700, last chance final, 1800 now, back to you, it's a great one, 1900 please, 1819, fair warning, final call, is that it, are we all in and done, 18, 1900, 1800, 1900, 1819, last chance and final call, 1800, 1900, <laughs> sold it, gone, 67, Stucco Dwelling by Jimmy Lee Suddeth. 
275, 300 only. 275, 3 on this famed outsider artist. 325, 325, 325, and 2550, at 2550, at 25 and 50, now 75, 350, now 75 on you, 50, now 75. 75, 75, 50 now, 75, at 50 now, 75, 400, 75, 400, at 75, 4, 75, 400, 75, 4, at 75, 400, 75, 4, I have 300, 75, 400, now 25 on you, at 425, 25, 425, 25, a striking image at 425, 450, 25, now 50, please. At 25, 50, please. At 25, 50, please on you. 25, 50, is that all? Are we in and done? Is that it? At 450, now 75, a buy and a bargain at 450, now 75, it's on you. 450, 75 on you. 450, 755, thank you. 755, 75, 500. At 475.5, it's on you. 475.5, fair warning. 75.500, 75.500, 75.00, now 5. <laughs> Sold. 68. Moving along to lot number 68. This one, another, by Jimmy Lee Suddeth. At only 250, 207.5. The portrait, 250.75. At 257.5, 257.5. Seven, at 250, now 75, 250, 75, 300, please, 300, please, 25. At 25, 325, at 300, now 25. At 300, now 25. And now 25, now 350, 25 here, 50 where? At 325, 350 where? 325, 350 where? Fair warning, 325, 350, last chance and final call. And 75, 50, 75. Five. Fair warning. At 350, 375, 400 then on you. At 75, 4, 75, 400, 75, 4, 25. At 425, is that all? Are we done and through? 425, 400 now 25, and then 400 now 425, 50. At 25 now 50. At 425, 50, fair warning. 425, 450 and 25, 50 now 75. At 75, 50 now, 75, last chance and final call, 50 now, 75, <laughs> gone. 69, we move along to lot number 69. This, the girl with the yellow hat, Jimmy Lee Suddeth, a great one, a great one here, 750, 800. 750 now, 8. 800, took it, thank you. 850 now, 859, classic. 859, great one. 850 now, 900, where? I have 850, you're in. 900, thank you. 950, where? 900, 950, where? At 900, 950, 900, 950, where? And 1,000, thank you. And 1,100 now. At 1,000, 1,100, 1,200. Great one. 1,100, 1,200 now. 1,100 here, 1,200 where? Took it. 1,300 now. Took it. 1,400 now. Took it 1500 now. At 1415, took it 1600 now. At 151600. At 1500, 1600, 1516. I have 1516 now, 17 on you. 1600, 17 on you. 16, 1700 on you. And 17, 1800 back to you. 1700, 1800, a great one. 1800, 1900, a great one. 1800, now 1900. 18, now 19. Took it. 2000 now. Yes, now 22 and a half. Don't lose it. 22 and a half. 2000, 2250. Don't lose this deal. At 2,000, 2,250, I have it there. Fair warning then. At 2,000, 22 and a half. And 2,500, 22 and a half. 2,500 took it. And 2,750, 25, 2,750. Back to you. Fair warning. Are you sure? 2,500, 2,750. A great one. 25, 2,750. 25, 27, 50. Fair warning. 25, now 27, 50. Last chance. Final call. Sold it right there at 2,500. 70, Alpha Chemical Co. Berlin. This, the shoe blacking box. 
225, 250, 25, now 50. I have the 225, 250, where? 25, 50, took it, 7, 5, 325, 350. At 50, at 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 75, 400, rare, 75, 400, 75, 400. At 75, 400, 75, 400, 75, 400, is that all? At 300, 75, 425, and then 450. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, now 50, fair warning. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, now 50. Sold it right there. 71. We move along to the McLean Brothers advertising display. This one, the hanging mirror clothes hanger. 20753. 20753. At 20753. Price is right. 20753. 20753. 25. Nice piece. 25. At 25. 325 and then 325. Fair warning. 300 now. 325 and then 325. Sold it right there. And then we move along to 72. 72. Folks, get your bids in. There is no point in thinking you lose the deal, you miss the deal. We are moving along to lot 72. This one, Ganong Chocolates, Carnival Barker Megaphone, a neat one. 650 here, 700 where? 650, 700 where? I have 650 here, 700 where? Is that all? Thank you. 750, 800 now. I have 750. Now where's the 800? 750, 8. 750 online. 800 where? 750, 8. Fair warning. My hammer is in the air. 750, 8. Fair warning. 750, 8. 750 now. 800, 750, 8. Sold it right there. And then 73. This the Glass Brothers McWillie's Maple Syrup Stoneware Jar. 450, 475, 450, 475, 75, yes, 500, yes, 550 now. 551, do you want to give it a try at 550? Fair warning. 500, 550, at 500, five and a half. Sold it right there. 74, O'Kell and Morris, Victoria, BC fruit jar. 125, a rare bear this one is. 300, 325 now. 325, yes, took it, 350 now, at 2550. 25 on the telephone with Ben, 350, fair warning, 325 now, 350 where? <laughs> Sold it right there. Thank you, Ben, thank you, Jackson. 75, beaver, right, facing, pint, fruit, jar. It's a nice one, 425, 400 now, 425, a nice one. 400, 425, 425. At 425, 425, fair warning, 400 now, 425 where? 400 now, 425. <laughs> Sold it right there. And then 76, moving along to more fruit jars, left facing beaver pint fruit jar. And this, a spectacular example of the left facing beaver pint with that strong embossing. 22 and a half, 2,500, not an easy jar to find, 2,250, 25. No Canadiana co collection is complete without the left-facing pint, and a fine example this is. 2,250, yes, I have it, 2,500 where, a great one. Almost three-dimensional, the beaver is. 2,750, 3,000, almost three-dimensional, almost an illusion to the eye, 2750-3000. Pretty nice with the whittled glass as well. Those milk glass swirls distinguish this pint from the others. 2750-3000, 2750-3000. I have 2750, it's on you for the 3000. It's those milky swirls that distinguish this left-facing pint. 2750-3000. 2753. I have 2753 thousand. I'll put my hammer in the air, folks. Thank you. 33250. You're out again. You're out once again. At 33250. It's a rare jar, and it has that milky swirl that distinguishes this left facing beaver from any other that you'll find. I have 3000. 
3250, I think you're safe and sound at 3000, 3250. It's on you at 3000, 3250. I'll put my hammer in the air. This is not one to let go. 3000, 3250, 3000, 3250. Are you certain? Are you sure? 3000, 3250. Last chance and final call on the left facing pint, 3,000, 3,250, 3,032 and a half. Sold it at 3,000. 77. This one requires a mention. We have identified a three quarter inch. It is underneath the glass, likely in the making, but it also could be a fracture. It is beneath the glass, and it is something that we suspect was likely related to the annealing process. Again, not identifiable by your thumbnail. Beneath the glass, it does need to be mentioned. It's an update to the condition report on this jar. And I currently have 1,800, and now 1,900. 1,800, 1,900. I have 1,800, now 1,900. 18 here, 19 where? At 1,800 now, 1,900, 1,819 on the amber beaver, and quite frankly, the right tone of amber, 18, 1,900, is that all? At 1,800, 1,900, I have 18, 1,900, 18, 1,900, fair warning then. At 1,800, 1,900, 18, now 19, last chance and final call, <laughs> sold at 18. And then 77, 78, we move along to the beehive half gallon, a rare jar indeed. If you're going for the trio of beehives, the half gallon is difficult to find. We have 450, 475, and it's a great example. 450, 475, 500, a great example. I have 475 with Gen 500, 475, 5, 475, 500. At 475, 500 took it, 550 now. 550 now. We're in court territory. 550, 600 where? At 550, 600. Five and a half now, 600. 556. It's the rare half gallon. We've sold courts for this. 556. You're the boss. 556. What do you say? 550 now, 600. 100 where and took it 650 now it's a nice one you'll be happy with this one at 600 650 600 650 what do you think 550 600 550 6 pardon me 600 took it 650 then 600 650 is that all we're beneath our estimate 550 600 650 fair warning 600 now 650 where last chance and final call and 657 back to you 657 a buy and a bargain at 657 fair warning 657 took it 750 now back to you 700 750 back to you 700 750 at 7 7 and a half 700 750 it's back to you what do you say 750 a buy and a bargain my hammer's in the air i have to run 700 750 7 7 and a half <laughs> sold it 700 then we move along to lot 79 oh yes we held this one back to the end it's the rare the exceedingly rare beehive pint fruit jar, a fabulous example, nicely embossed, clear beehive pint jar with the aqua lid. It's a great example, a fabulous example. I only have 1,200, now 1,300, considered to be by many the holy grail as far as the beehive jars are concerned. 1,200, 1,300 on this one, 12, 13, took it, 1,400. That is a rare jar, folks. It's not too good to be true, it's there. 1,300, 14, took it, 1,500, nice example as well. 1,400, old, old collection this came from. 1,400 and now 1,500, 14, 1,500. Yes, it's as nice as it looks. 14, 1,500, you'll be pleased with the jar. At 1,400 now, 1,500 where? 14 now, 1,500. 
1,400, 14, 15. You'll be thrilled with this jar. 1,400, 15 took it, 1,600. It's a nice one, 15, 16. It's the beehive pint, for heaven's sake. 1,500, 1,600 at 15, 1,600 on the beehive pint. Find me another one, 1,500, 1,600. I don't know of one, 1,500, 1,600. Hammer's in the air then at 1,500, 1,600. It's up to you, 15, 1,600. Fair warning, all in and done. Is that it? 1,500, 1,600, 15, and 1,600, 1,500, 1,600. Now, sold it right there. 70, pardon me, 80. We work on the clockwork spit next. It is the spit jack for the fireplace. 300, 200, 753, 200, 753. Took it, 325, 350 where? At 325, 350. At 25, 50, 75, 400, neat piece. 75, 400, 75, 4. And 25 and 50. At 25 and 50, 25, 50, 25. Now 450, 425, 50. Is that all? 425, 450, neat piece. 425, 450. Is that all? Are we in and done? At 425, now 450, where? Sold it, gone. 81, we move along to the forged iron revolving toaster here. The revolving toaster, a nice one, great one. Early 19th century iron toaster here. 75, 100, a great one, 75, 1. At 75, 100, 75, 1 is all I'm bid. 75, 100, 75, 1. At 75, 100, 75, 1. I have 75, 100, 75, 1. Anyone else? At 75, 100, 75, 1. 75, 100 now. And 75, 1. 75, 100, 75, 1. <laughs> Sold at 75. And then we move along to 82. This one, the forged iron adjustable spit rack at 75, 100, 75, 1. 75, 100, 75, 1, 125, 150, it's right as rain, 125, 150, right as rain, 125, 150, at 25, 50, where? At 25, 50, where? 125, 150, anyone else? 125 now, 150, where? 125 now, 125, 50, <laughs> sold it, 125. 83, the Grand Trunk Railway System Lantern, 300 now, 325. 300 now, 325. At 25, took it, 50, thank you. 325, 350 now. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 325 now, 350 where? At 325 now, 350 where? Fair warning, 325 now, 350 where? Fair warning, last chance and final call. <laughs> Sold at 325. 84, we move along, 84 to the dark green skater's lamp, a great one, late 19th century miniature there, at 325, 350, 25, 50, at 325 now, 350 where, 325, 350 where, 325 now, 350 where, fair warning, I took it here, at 325, 350, 325 and 350 now, <laughs> sold it right there, 80, Five. We move along. Capus casing, World War I, prisoner of war carved, painted frame. 150, 175, 200 now. At 175, 2, 175, 2, 25. At 225, 250, where? 25, 50, where? 25, 50, where? 25, 50, where? Fair warning. And now 75. At 250, now 75, 250, 75, 300, 75, 300, now 325. At 325, 325, and then 300. Now 25, now 50, now where? At 25, 50, now where? Now 75, 50, now 75, where? 350, now 375, where? At 75, 400, where? 75, 400, 300, 75, 400, 75, 400, 25, now. At, at 400, 25, and 400, 25, and 400, 25, and 400, 25, 50. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 400, 25, 400, 50. Last chance and final call. Sold at 25. 86. 86.
Kispu BC, the miniature decorated canoe paddle, 100, 125, 125, took it 150, 25, 50, where? At 125, 150, where? 125, 150, where? 125, now 150, where? At 125, 150, 25, 50, fair warning, 125, 150, where? 125, now 150, where? Sold it right there. 87, 87, we move along to the miniature decorated souvenir canoe paddles there. All from the Jim Fleming collection here. 150, 175, 150, 175, 150, 175. Anyone else? 175, 2. Thank you. Took it. 175, 2. 100, 75, 2. 100, 75, 2. Anybody else? At 100, 75, 225. And in 225, 50. 25, 50. 25, 50. Anybody else? At 25, 50. 25, 50. 225, 250. And 25. Now half. Sold it right there. And then 88, moving along to the canoe cups there. A pair of them, 325. I have 300 here, 25 on the pair, 25, 325. At 325 on the pair, 25, and then 25, and then 25, and then 25. At 325, and then 325. Anybody else? At 325, and then 325, and then 300. Now 325. Sold it right there, 89. Moving along to the Niagara Falls Merchant Trout Match Holder. Neat one there at 275, 3, 275, 3, 275, 375, 300, 275, 3, at 275, 3, at 275, 375, now 3. Sold it right there. 90. Moving along to the Jenkins family, Newfoundland Powder Horn there. A great one, a great one with exuberant decoration there, a fabulous piece, a neat piece to offer today, including the First Nations hunter, as well as the exotic fish, horse, everything you see. In fact, it's a fabulous example of one of these, and we're selling it here at 3032 on the Jenkins family Newfoundland powder horn, 3032 50 and 35 100, 3250, 3500, 3250, 3500, 3250 now, and 3500. It's your turn. Where would you find such a thing? Early Canadian, 1850, and a great example with all of the narrative there. 3250, 35. It tells a story, and it's an early Canadian story. 3250, 3500. It's a great example at 3250, 3500. A great Canadian story here is told. 3250, 35. 3250, 35. At 3250, 3500. 3250, 35. I have 3250 on the fabulous Jenkins family, Newfoundland. Powder horn, 3,500, one of the stars of the show, and my hammer is in the air. What an exciting moment here, 3,250. I took it, 35. I knew you were thinking. 35, now 3,750, 3,500, 3,750. Don't lose this deal. 3,500, 3,750, you're out. 3,500, 3,750, you are out. Click twice to bid. 35,750. Fair warning. 3,500 here. 3,750. Took it. 4,000. Where would you find such a thing? Early Canadian history here. 1850. It doesn't get a whole lot earlier. 3,750. 4,000. Jenkins family. At 3750, 4,000, it doesn't get much earlier than that. The alligator, the serpent, the squid. We're talking 1850. Wow, 3750, 4000 on the powder horn. 3754, 3754. At 3754,000, my hammer's in the air. Fair warning, 3754, took it. And 4250, 4000, 4250. At 4000, 4250, wow, what folk art, must I say? 4,000, 4,250, 4,000, 4,250, thank you, 4,500, great folk art, 4,500, at 42 and a half, 4,500, early Canadian folk art, 4,250, 4,500, it tells a story, and it's the story of the Jenkins family, 4,250, 4,500, folks, these were the founding families of Canada, 4,250, 4,500, 
4250, 4500, a museum piece, absolutely. 4250, 45, fair warning, 4250, 4500, last chance. And final call, I have 4250 here and 4500 where? Sold it at 4250. Thank you. 91 Windmill and Geese by Albert DeRoy. What do you say on this? At 100, 125, 125, now 150 on you. At 125, 150, 175, 150, 175, and then 150, now 175. 175, 2. 175, 2. It's folk art, folks. At 225, and then 225, and then 225, and then 200, now 25. Fair warning. At 225, at 225, and then 250, at 225 now, 250, yes, took it, 75, 250 now, 75, fair warning, 300 now, 753, at 75, 300 now, 25, and then 300 now, 25 where, at 25, and then 50 where, at 50 now, 75, and then 50 now, 75, 400 where, at 300, 75, 400, your turn, 75, 400, a buy and a bargain for 300, 75, 400. 400 on you, 300, 754, don't lose this deal, 300, 754, fair warning, 300, 75, 400, 75, 4, took it 25, at 425, at 425, and then 425, fair warning, 400, now 25, and then 400, now 25, and 50, and 25, and 50, and 25, now 50, back to you, I've got to run, 25, 50, last chance and final call, 25, and then half, Sold it, 425, gone. And then 92, we get into more Albert DeRoy. This one, the canvas back duck, a great one. These, what he was known for. 275, 300, 275, 3, at 275, 3, 275, 300, 275, 3, 275, 3, 275, 375, 3, fair warning, 275, now 300. Sold it, 94. Great stuff. Again, same artist. What do you say here? At 175, 2, 25, and then 250. At 25, 50, 25, 50 now, 75, and then 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 325. Spotted duck, 325, and 300 now, 25, and then 300 now, 325, and then 300 now, 25, now 50 where? At 25, 50 where? At 325 now, 350 where? 25, 50 where? Fair warning. Are you sure? At 25, 50, 25, 50, yes, now 7, 5, took it, 7, 5, took it, 7, 5, bargain. At 75, 400, where? At 300, 7, 5, 400, 300, 7, 5, 400, anybody else? At 300, 75, 400, 300, 7, 5, 400, 300, 7, 5, 400, fair warning, 300, 7, 5, now 4. Sold it right there, 375. We move along to 94, this one, the Charles Norris Lower prospect, what do you say on this one at 225? 225, bit of maritime folk art for you here today at 225, 200 now, 225, and then 225, now 50, 25, 50, 25, now half, at 25, 50, 25, half, 25, 50, 25, half, 25, 50, fair warning, 25, half, at 25, 50, now 25, and then 50, fair warning, 25, 50, Sold it right there. 95, we move along to the Brown Neck Duck. This is by Eddie Mandagio. What do you say on this? 125, 150, 125, 150, 125, 150, 125, 150 on you. 25, 50, 25, and then 50. At 25, 50, properly signed, 175, 200. At 175, 200, 175, 200, 175, 2. At 175, 225, it's an investment. 25, and then 50, pardon me, 200, now 225. At 200, now 25, it's on you. 225, fair warning. Are you sure? At 225, at 225, and then 200, now 25. Sold at 200. Moving along to 96, the Standing Rooster, also by Eddie Mendagio. What do you say on this? 
325, 350 took it. Nice one, great one. A piece of distinction for sure at 350, 3754. 4. This one speaks, 425, it crows. At 400, 350 now, 450 now, 75. At 400, 75, and then 400, 75. 450 now, 75, where took it? 75, 500 now. At full 75, 500 now. Full 75, 500, 75, 500. Full 75 now, 5. 500 where and took it 500 now 550 where 500 now 550 where and fair warning 500 550 500 now 550 where my hammers up bids in 500 now 550 where all in and done 500 now five and a half and then five 550 500 now 550 sold it at 500. Moving along to 97, this one, a lineup of Rents's in fact. This one was Rents's own painted yard bird, Ewald Rents, that famous prospector from Beardmore, Ontario. Here we have 300 on this one, 325, 325. This graced his front yard for years, 300 now 25, 300 now 25, 300 now 325, and then 350, 25, 50, 25, 50, at 25, 50 where? At 25, 50, 50 now, 75, 75, 350 now, 75, it's the one to own, 350 now, 75 where? Is that all, is that it? 350 now, 375 where? And 400 now, at 375, 400, 375, 400, 375, 75 for fair warning at 400 now 425 where 400 now 425 where what do you say 400 now 425 where 400 now 25 fair warning 425 at 400 now 25 where 400 now 25 sold at 498 we move along to the spotted blue goose by ewald rents here a great one 200 now 225 2 now 225 and then 250 at 225 250 now 75 where 75 where at 250 200 75 300 at 200 75 3 nice one 200 75 3 and 325 and then 325 and then 325 classic rents 2550 2550, 32550, anybody else? Fair warning then at 325 and 350 at 2550. Last chance and final call now 75, 50 now 75. Back to you, 50 now 75 and 400. It's a great one, 400 at 375, 4, 75, 4, 75, 400, 300, 75, 4, anybody else? At 300, 75, 400, 300, 75, 25, full 25. Is that all? At 425, fair warning, hammers in the air, 400 now 50. At 25, 50, 25 now 50, fair warning, hammers in the air. At 425, 450, 25, and then 50, 25 now 450. Sold at 425, hammers down. 99, Prospector by Ewald Rents. Rents was a prospector himself, perhaps modeled after himself. This one from circa 1980 at 175 2, 175 200. Classic Canadian folk art. Great Canadian folk art by one of the great Canadian folk artists for sure. 225, 250, 250, 200, 75, 300, 200, 75, 325, 25. 25. It's an investment as well as a decorative piece at 325, 325, at 325, and then 325. A good store of value, 325, at 325. Is that all? Is that it? 325, and then 325. Hammers in the air at 300 now, 325 where? 300 now, 325. <laughs> Sold it, gone. 100. A hundred. Centennial man. Centennial man. Centennial man. Is it any coincidence this is lot number 100? Awesome. 175, 200. 175, 2. The grand 1967 centennial. The Canadian centennial man by Ewald Rents at 225. 
at 225, at 225, and in 225, and in 200 here, 25 where? At 200 and 225, anybody else? 250, Mr. Canada, 250, now 275. At 250 now, 275, Mr. Canada, at 250, 275, anybody else? 250 now, and 275, and in 50 now, 75, and in 50 now, 75, last chance and final call. Sold at 250 and 101. Breaking, here we are with the rents pair, long nosed men, classic rents, caricature ish figures here. Wickedly suggestive humor, obviously suggesting two people of the same family. You can't help but laugh. <laughs> 250, 275. Father and son, 250, 275. 250, 275. At 275, 300. You have to laugh. At 325. At 325. At 325. At 300 now, 325. And then 300 now, 325. Where? Classic rents here. At 325. Fair warning, 325. And then 300 now, 25. Took it. 350. Where? At 50 now, 75. Thanks for the quick bid. 75. Got to run. 350 now, 75. Where? And 400. On this humorous pair, 425. 425. Have a sense of humor. Click twice. 425. At 425. 450 now, 75. Just laugh a bit at 450 now 475 you love it 450 now 475 at 450 475 fair warning at 450 475 500 there's not enough humor in the world today 475 5 475 500 475 500 475 5 make a statement 550 550 550 500 now 550 500 now 550 at 500 now 550 fair warning and 600 550, 600 on the relatives. 550, 600, 550, 6, 5 and a half, 600 at 556, 550, 600, 5 and a half, 6, fair warning. 550, 600 now. And 650 at 650 at 600, 650. Click twice at 600, 650, or kiss it goodbye. 600 now, 600. 50, 600, 650, 700 now, 657, I know they're irresistible, 657, gotta run, 657, last chance final call at 650, 700, six and a half now, seven, sold it right there, 650, and then 102, we move along to the painted pine clock shelf, 125, 150, 125, 150, 125, 150, square nail, 150, 175, 2, at 175, 200, at 175, 200, nice with the arched profile, 175, 2, at 175, 2, is that all? At 175, 200, 175, 200, 175, 200, 175, 2, sold, gone, 103, moving along, Quebec architectural clock shelf, now there's a great one. There's a great one, 1700, 1800 at 1700. Not a good one, this is a great one. 1800, 1900, I took 1900, 2000 please, 2000 please. Doesn't get any better than this. 2000, 2250, took it on the phone, 2500 now please. On the phone with Finley at 22 and a half, 2500, 2750 John. 25 and 2750, fair warning. Took it here, you have to be 3,000. Missed an opportunity. 2750, 3,000. 2753, fair warning. Took it on the phone. No problem on this end. 3,000, 32 and a half. 3,000, 32 and a half. 3,000, 3250. Anybody else? Not a good one. It's a great one, 32 and a half, 3,500 please. 3,250, 3,500 please. At 3,500, 3,750. At 3,500, 3,750. It's not good, it's great. 3,500, 3,750. At 35, 3,750. At 3,500, 3,750. 35, 37 and a half. At 3,500, 750. Fair warning, my hammer is in the air. At 3,500, 3,750, 4,000. Whatever you put on this shelf, you've just increased its value. 4,000, 4,250. 4,000, now 4,250. It's not good, it's great. 4,000, 4,250. 
4,042.50. 4,000 now, 42.50. Quebec architectural clock shelf. It's a great one. What clock will you select? 4,042.50. The price just went up. 4,042 and a half, then fair warning at 4,042 50. Last chance and final call at 4,000 here, 4250. Where? <laughs> Sold it, 4,000. 104, fret cut hanging clock case. Very interesting. Jim Fleming collection, 2753. Where is it? 300 at 2753. Unique, unusual at 2075 325 with the pierced fretwork. What do you say on this? At 325, 350, at 325, 350. Neat with the jumping four legged animal. Certainly puts this in a category of its own. 325, 350, where? At 2550, 2550, 2550, 325, 350, where? At 2550, 2550, 325, 350, where? Fair warning, hammers up, bids in at 325 and 350. Now, Sold it right there. And then 105, decorated carpenter box. What do you say on this? Could well have been someone by the name of carpenter, not necessarily something for tools. We don't know. A neat conversation piece at 225, 250. You have to love the sponge painted overall finish. 225, 250, now 75. It's a great one, 250, 75. A buy and a bargain, 250 now, 75, 250 now, 75. At 250, 200, 75, 300. At 75, 300, and 25, and 25, and then 325, 300, now 25. That, I have 300 here, 25 where? At 325, and then 350. Carpenter, 325, 350. Sponge painted, 325. 350, fair warning, and 75, fair warning. Morning, 357.5. Is that all? Are we in and done? 350 now and 75.4. 75.4. 75, 75, 75 400. 75, 400. Anybody else? 375.4. 75, 400. At 75, 400. 75, 400. 75, 400. 75 now. Four. Last chance and final call. 75, 4. <laughs> Sold right there. 400, folks. Click twice to bid. 106. Prince Edward County Pine Pale Bench here. 200 now 225 on this one 200 now 225 200 now 225 200 now 225 on this one at 200 now 25 anybody else at 200 now 225 fair warning at 200 only 2550 now 75 get your bids in at 300 get your bids in 325 at 25 and then 25 and then 25 300 now 25 350 at 25 50 25 50 25 50 25 now 50 fair warning at 325 350 and 25 half now 25 50 and 25 25 half and 2550 last chance and final call 25 half <laughs> sold it right there 107 then we move along to the New England flame birch blanket box at 225 on you 250 nice one 225 250 at 25 50 25 50 25 50 now 75 50 now 75 50 now 75 fair warning 75 300 at 75 300 200 75 3 75 300 75 300 at 200 75 3 last chance and final call 75 300 75 now 3 <laughs> sold it right there 108 moving along to the Cape Breton Island pine blanket box here I have 75 1 75 100 75 1 at 75 100 75 1 at 75 125 sorry you're out 25 please 150 now 150 now 125 150 buy in a bargain at 125 150 125 50 now 75 on you 75 2 on you 75 200 on you 175 225 at 225 and then 225 and then 225 and then 225 fair warning at 50 now at 50 now have to run 225 250 last chance and final call 225 25 now, 250 where? And 75, and 75, 50 now, 75, 50 now, 75. Anybody else? Hammers in the air, bids in at 250, 200, 75, and then 250 now, 200, 75, and then 250 now, 200, 75. 
sold at 250. Moving along to 109, the Maritimes painted pine transitional chest. What do you say on this one? I have 325 in the hand, 350 now. 325, 350 where? It's a nice one, 325, 350, 25, 50, nice early one at 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, now 754, 754, 25, 25, 425, 450, 25, 50, 25, 50, is that all? At 425, 450, hammers in the air then, at 425, 450, 25, 50, 25, 50, a buy and a bargain at 425, 50, now 75. 75, 75, 50 now, 75, 500, 75 now, 500, 75, 500, 75, 500, 75, 5, fair warning, 75, 500, last chance and final call, 75, 500, 75 now, 5, sold it right there, and then 110, that's 110, it's the Leonard, Leonard, pardon me, Leonard, <laughs> Leonard Cruteau here, the carved Rose Bloom at 225, 250 now, 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 3. At 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300, fair warning, 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, now your turn, 300. Sold it right there at 275. Get your bids in, folks. No chance if you wait. 111, that's 111, it's the military guard by... Basil Levy, what do you say on this? I only have 75-1 on this one, 75-1. Now there's a bargain, 75-1, 75-100, At 75-100, 75-1, 75-100 is all. It's your turn at 100, 75-100, 75-1, one, and 25, and 50, and 25, and 50. You're out again, 25, 50, you're out again. 125, 50, fair warning now, 75, you're out again. 150, 75, you're out. 15175, don't lose this deal. 15175, 15175, hammers in the air. 15175, 15075. Sold it right there. 112, we move along to the carved and painted pointer at 751. It has a look, doesn't it? 751, 751, undeniably so. 125, 125, 150 on you, and 15175 has a look. 15175 on the pointer. 15175, is that all? 15175, anybody else? 15175, and then 150 now. 175, 200. 175, 2. 175, Two. Anybody else? 175, 225 at 225 at 225 and then 225 and then 225 and then 225 and then 200 now. 225 where? 200 now. 225. <laughs> Sold it right there. 113. Moving along to the obedient dog by Larry Fancy there. Certainly an obedient dog. What do you say on this little guy here at 150, 175? Irresistible at 1752, 1752, 25, at 225, at 225, 250, 25 and a half, and now 75, 75, 75, at 75 and 75 and 75 and 75, at 250 now, 275, where? 300 now, at 75, 3, at 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 3. Fair warning, hammers in the air. Then at 200, 75, 300, 200, 75, 300, 200, 75, now three. Sold it. And by the way, a shout out to Chris Edgar and Phil Ross for helping us with the catalog of this sale. Not only helping us, but executing the catalog of this sale. Fabulous job, gentlemen. We appreciate everything that you do. Gentlemen, here is the ski racer by. Larry Fancy as well, 125, 150, 125, 150. I only have 175 on this, 200. At 175, I only have 225, 250. It's a great one, 225, 50, 75, 3. You're out. 75, 300, 75, 300. You're out. At 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300, 200, 75, now 300. Anybody else? Fair warning then. Hammers in the air on the skier at 200, 75, 3, 200. 2753 275 now 375 now 3753 sold it right there 115 Toronto Blue Jays cowboy uh, and cowboy this is the Gordon Cohen combination here at 75 100 on the pair 75 100 75 100 75 one is all at 75 100 on the pair 75 100 fair warning 
75 100 last chance and final call is all on these ones and 125 25 at 25 100 you're out again 25 at 100 125 on the pair fair warning then have to run 100 you're out by the way at 125 you are out 125 150 at 25 50 last chance and final call 125 150 25 50 now 75 now you're out 50 now 75 you're buying both for the same money for for both one money at 1752 fair warning 175 200 175 to 175 now 200 <laughs> sold at 150 what am i doing 116 is the Montreal Canadiens goalie by Andre Laporte here. The goalie, Montreal Canadiens, 250, 207, 5. 250, 207, 5. 250, 207, 5. Andre Laporte, Quebec, 250, 207, 5. Circa 1975 on this one. 250, 207, 5. Is that all? Is that it? At 250, 207, 5. It's your turn. 250, 207, 5. And then 250, 207, 5. Fair warning. At 250, 75, 300 then. At 75, 3. Took it. 300, 207, 5. 3. Fair warning. At 275, 375, 375, 375, 375, now 300. Sold at 275. And then 117, it's the draft horse by Andre Laporte, 275 on this one. And then 300, where? 300, where? 300, where? Two, 300, took it. 325, please. 25, you have to be. 25 and then 25 and then 25. And 325, hammers in the air. At 350, at 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 325, 350 where? 325 and 350 where? My hammer's in the air, 325 and 350, 25 half. Sold right there. 118. We move on to Wilford Richard, the parrot by Wilford Richard. There's a great one. 650, 700. 650, 700. 650, 700. Where is it? 650, 700. My hammer's in the air then at 750. 700 now, 7.5. At 7.5, 800 now. You're out. 750, 800 where? Yes, took it. 850 now. And now 900. 850 now, 9. 950 where? 900, 950 where? 900, 950, where? I've got 900, 950, now 1,000, please. 950, 1, 950, 1, 950, 1,000, 950, 1. Hammers in the air, fair warning, at 950, 1,000, and I took it, 1,100 now. 1,000, 1,100, 1,000, 1,100, you're out again at 1,000, 1,100, fair warning. My hammer's in the air at 1,000, 1,100, 1,000, 1,100, last chance and final call, 1,000, 1,100. Sold it right there. Pass it back to Justin. Perfect. Thank you, Ethan. Moving right along to lot number 119, the long neck bird by Felicien Levesque. And we're at 200 on it, 225. At 200 than 225 from Kakuna, Quebec, circa 1980. 225, thank you. Yes, now 250. 250 now, 275. And 275 go 300. At 275 and then three, you gotta be 275 here and then 300. I'm at 275 and then three on the long neck bird carving. At 275 and then three, are we all done? Last chance, fair warning. Thank you. And now 325, 350. 325 and 350, he's right there. He knows the hammer was coming down and he must move quickly. At 325 and then 350, are we all done? 350, then 375. I've got the bid 350 here, the 375, and the bid 350, the 375, and the 350, 375. Are we all done? Now 400. 375 at the 4, the bid 375 at the 400. I'm at 375 at the 4, the 375 at the 4, the 375 at the 400, all through and done. Fair warning, last chance and final call. Sold it right there, 375, moving right along to lot number 120. It's the Painted Bird, another one from Félicien Le Levesque. At 225, I have 250, thank you, now 75. At 250, then 75 and 300. I'm at 275 at the 3, the bit 300, the 325. 300, then 325, and right back to you. At 325 at the 3, 50 go 3, 50 go 3, 50, 325 at the 3 and a half. At 325 at the 3 and a half, at a bit 325 go 3, 50, 50, 50, 325 at the 3 and a half, and 375. At 350, then 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 350, now 75. I'm at 350, now 375, you gotta move quick, and now 400. At 375 at the 4, to bit 375 at the 4, and 375 at the 400. At 375 at the 4, to 375 at the 4, 
one at 375 at the four. Are we all done? Last chance and fair warning at just 375 and 400. Sold it there, 375, well done. Lot 121, another one from Felician Levesque. It's a Blue Angel at 350, now 375. A nice carving here at 350, then 75, and 350, then 75. Look at the size, a large carving at 375 and 400. At 375 and then 400, 375 and then 4. Lots of room left to go on this one. Thank you, 400, 425, of course, and 450. 425 and then 4.5 and, and 475. At 475 and then 500, then 550. 500, then five and a half, and 600. 600, then six and a half. Exceptionally large, exceptionally rare. 600, then 650. At 600, then six and a half. I got 600, then six and a half. And anybody else? At 600, then 650 on the Blue Angel by Felician Levesque. At 600, six and a half. We must move along. Last chance. We'll sell it today. 600, six and a half. Fair warning. All through and done. Thank you. Now 700, just under the gun. 650, then 700, but you got to be quick. And you are at 700, then 750. Right back to you. This time, I can't wait as long. 700, then seven and a half. Last chance and fair warning. Sold it there, 700. Well done. Lot 122, the Inuit fishernet, sh uh, sorry, Inuit Fisherman in a Loaded Canoe by Joseph Matot at 150, yes, no, 175, 175, at 150, then 175, I got 150 here, and then 175, at 175, and then 200, very well carved, at 175, and then 200, at just 175, and then two, got a bit 175 here, and then 200, 175, and then two, at 175, and then 200, I'm bit 175, and then two, got a bit 175, and then two, and a bit 175, two, on the Inuit fisherman in the loaded canoe at 200, thank you, 225. Lots of room to go here. Now 250, you're safe, I assure you. 225, 250. 225 and then two and a half. At 225 and then 250, go 250, 225. No mistakes can be made in this range. 250, then 275. At 250, 275, a great carving. At 250, then 275, and then 250, 275, and then 75, and 275, and three. At 275, back to you at three. Gotta be quick. At 275 and then three, gotta be 275 and then 300. At 275 and then three, to be 275 and then three for a master carving like this. Wow, at 275 and then three, are we all done? Okay, then 325, right back to you. 300, yes, now 325. At 300, then 325, and fair warning all through and done. Sold it there, 300, great deal. Nice buy, a bargain. Moving on, lot 123, a pair of quill decorated birch bark and ash splint covered baskets here. What do you say to start? 125 I have, yes, now 150. These have been attributed to Micmac. At 125, 150. 125 and then one and a half. I got a bit 125 and then 150. At 125 and then one and a half. You're buying the pair, of course. At 125 and then 150. At 125 and then 150. Are we all done? Thank you. 150, then 175. And 75, 200. 175 and two. And get 175 and then two. I'm at 175, two. Thank you. 225. Got a bit 200, then 225. And a bit 200 here, then 225. Are we all done? 200 is bid, yes, now 225, fair warning, last chance and final call. Sold the pair, 200, 124, and a pair of American native ash split potato stamped baskets, $100 bid, now 125. At 100, then 125, nicer than average, these pair, at 125, and now 150. At 125 and then 150 and 125 and then one and a half. I've got a bid 125 and then 150, 125 and then one and a half. At a bid 125 and then 150, 50, 50, 125 and one and a half. At 125 and then one and a half. Thank you. Now 175. Right back to you. At 150 then 175 on the pair of Native American ash splint potato stamp baskets. 150, 75 and 200. 175 of the two. I'm at 175 of the two. Gotta bit 175 of the two. Gotta bit 175 of the two, two, two. I'm at 175 of the two. Are we all done? 175 and the two. Fair warning. Last chance and final call at just 175 and 200. Sold them 175. Well done. Lot number 125. What a great lot this is. A rare pair of iron stone. Souvenir pictures for Clara and Willie, and there's a major story behind these Inuit exhibition souvenir pictures. A nice early pair. Read the story, and you can't help but bid. 
We're at 125 and 150. At 125 and 150 for this pair. At just 125 and then one and a half, and a bit 125 and then 150. At 125 and then one and a half, I got a bit 125 here, then 125, 150, 175, thank you, and then 200. 175 and then 200. I'm at 175 and then two, got a bit 175 and then 200, we'll go 225. At 200, then 225, and a bit 200 here, then 225, I got 200, yes, now you've got to be 225. I have it. Yes, 200, then 225, I got 200 here, then 225. I'm at 200, then 225, and 200, then 225. I'm at 200 only. Now, 225 on the pair of Inuit exhibition souvenir pictures featuring Clary and Willa, uh, sorry, Clara and Willie. At 200, now 225, we will sell them. And it's last chance and final call at just 200, 225. What a bargain here at 200, 225. Sold them right there at 200. Well done. Lot 126, a pair of Germanic Fractor drawings at 175, now 200. 175 and then two, I bid 175 and then two, got a bid 175 here in the 200, thank you, 425. A bid has come in from live auctioneers, now 450. At 425 and now 450. I'm at 425 and then four and a half, I got a bid 425 and then 450, but is that it, is that all? At just 425 and 450, we'll sell them today. Hammers up, last chance and final call. Sold them right there. Thank you very much. Lot number 127 is up next. It's the John Getty Nova Scotia tall case clock dial. Very important hand-painted clock dial from John Getty, an important Canadian clockmaker. What do you say on this one? From Pick2, Nova Scotia, 375 at 375 and then 400. 375, 400 then 425 at 400, then 425, and then 450. 425, and then 450. His clocks are extremely rare, featured, of course, in the early Canadian timekeeper's book. 450, 475. At 450, then 475. I got a bit 450, 475, and then 500. 475, and then 500. Very few known to have survived. 475 and 500, and if you've got the best part right here, the dial, at 475, 500, then 550. Right back to you. 550, then 600. 550, yes, I have 550. I have your 550 asking 600. Five and a half and then six on the John Getty Nova Scotia tall case clock dial. 550, 600. And I get the bit 550 here and then six. Hit a bit 550, then six. Hit a bit 550, then six. Canadian clocks from this era are extremely rare. At 550, 600, are we all done? At just 550, 600, last chance and fair warning. Thank you, 600, just under the gun, back to you at 650. 600, then six and a half, you're out. Now you're back in, thank you, now 700. 650, then 700, I'm, I cannot take that long this time. At 650, 700, last chance and fair warning, all through and done. 700, then seven and a half, right back to you. At 700, then seven and a half, it'd be 700, then 750, please be quick. 750, thank you. Now 800, 750, 800. I'm at seven and a half and then eight, it'd have been seven and a half and then eight, it'd have been seven and a half and then eight, but the hammer's in the air, all through and done. Sold it right there, 750, well done. Moving along, lot number 128. Nice hooked rug here featuring resting dogs, circa 1930. 450, thank you, now 475 and then 500. 475 and then five, it'd be 475 and then 500 and 550. 475 and 500, then 550. At 500, 550, then 600. 550, then 600. It's right back to you. At 550, 600, then six and a half. I'm at 600, now 650, 700. 650, 700. At six and a half, and then seven, it'd have been six and a half, and then 700. At six and a half, and then seven, it'd have been six and a half here, then 700. Anybody else? At 650, 700 on the resting dog's hooked rug. Last chance, fair warning, 650, 700 all through and done. Right under the gun, 750. 750, you gotta be quick if you'd like it. At 750, 800. 800. Seven and a half and then eight. I'm at seven and a half and then eight. It'd have been seven and a half and then eight. It'd have been seven and a half and then eight. Going once, twice, and for the third and final time. Sold at 750. Well done. 129. Another hooked mat here featuring two bull moose at four and a half. A beautiful hooked mat. Four and a half only. Now 475. 450, then 475. It'd have been 450 here, then 475. I'm at four and a half. Thank you. That's 475. Are we all done there? At 450, 475. Last chance. Thank you. 500. You must be 550. 
We had 500 left. You've got to be 550. Thank you. Now 600. Five and a half and then 600. I'm at 550, then 6, then 600, then 6.5. And, and you're out again at 600, then 6.5 on the two bull moose hooked mat. 600, 6.5. Six I got a bit 600 here, then 650. I'm at 600, then 6.5. Are we all done? And last chance, then fair warning, all through and done. 650, wow, that was close. Now 700, must be quick. 650, 700, 700, and now 750. 700, then 7.5. I cannot wait that long this time. Seven hundred than seven and a half. We must move along. Last chance and final call. <laughs> Sold it right there. Seven hundred. Well done. One thirty is up next. A fabulous American Centennial Eagle and Star Jackard cover coverlet from Pennsylvania, probably. We're at seventy-five and now one hundred. Seventy-five and then one hundred. Huh, got a 75, what a great look to this one. At 75 and then one, I got a bid 75 and then 100. Thank you, 125 from 1876. 125 is bid, now 150. 125 and then one and a half. At 125 and then 150, go 125 and then one and a half. I'm at 125 and then 150 on this American Jackard coverlet. At 125, thank you, 150 then 175. 150 then 175. I've got the bid 150 here then 175 and a bid 150 then 175. Anybody else? Last chance. Fair warning at 150. 175. <laughs> Sold it at 150. Moving right along to lot number 131. And what do we have next? The 16 foot massive early Canadian red ensign flag. Show them the size of this thing. You don't find them in this size. Must have been used at a government building or something like that. They just don't turn up this early and this large. And we have it here today at Miller & Miller Auctions. 475, thank you, now 500. A fabulous red ensign flag here, stitched panel at 475 and then 500. 475 and then 5. I got a bit 475 and then 500. At 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 500. Thank you. 550. 500 then 5 and a half. 500 then 5 and a half. It had been 5 and a half and 600. They're giving you an idea as to the size of this massive early Canadian red ensign flag. 550, 600. 550 then 600. And the condition is exactly how you'd want to find one. 550, 600, got a bit five and a half, and then 600. Stored properly at 600, then six and a half. At 600, then six and a half, got a bit 600 here. This early and this clean, not very often do they come to the market. 600, then six and a half. 600 is bid already. Yes, now six and a half on the red end sign. At 600, then six and a half, it's a 16 footer, everybody. You see the size at 600, then six and a half. Thank you, 700, right back to you. At six and a half, and then seven. At six and a half, and then seven, and a bit six and a half, and then seven, and a bit six and a half, and then 700, just six and a half, and then seven. I'm at six and a half, and then seven, but are we all done? We must move along. At 650, 700, last chance, and then fair warning on the massive Canadian red ensign flag. At 650, 700, fair warning. <laughs> Sold it right there, six and a half. Very nice buy. Moving on to 132, it's the new goddess ship's figurehead here. We're thinking this is European, a great architectural piece. 275 and now 300. Thank you, now 325, I've got 350, 375 and now 400. 375 and then 400. At 375 and then four, gonna be 375 here and then four, gonna be 375 and then 400. 375 and then four, gonna be 375 and then four, 375 and then 400. At 375, 400, but is that it? Is that all? Last chance and fair warning at 375, 400 on the nude goddess. Ships figure head all through and done. Sold it, thank you. 375 buys lot number 133. A detailed model of the sailing ship Helene. Excellent condition on this. Often these get really, really tattered and torn, stored improperly. This is a nice one, a very nice one, and it's Canadian. 375, yes, now 400. 375 and then four. I'm at 375 and then four to be 375 and then 400. At 375 and then four, gonna be 375 and then four, got 375 here. Yes, now 400 on the model of the sailing ship Helene. At 375 and four, 375 and four, 375 and then four. I've got 375 already. You must be 400. We'll sell it today. What a bargain here. Far below what we anticipated it would end up at. Thank you, 400, then 425. 400, then 450, 475. 
450, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. What a bargain. At 450, then 475, and then 450, then 475 on the model of the sailing ship Helene. At 450, 475, last chance. Fair warning, we'll sell it today at 450, asking 475 hammers in the air. Fair warning. Sold it right there, 450, well bought. Moving along, lot number 134. A nice Oil on Wallboard by Iris Webster. It's a hamlet in the valley. Circa 1950s American piece here, and we're at 75, 100. Got it, yes, now 125. That's the bit on the telephone. Now 125. At 100, then 125. I get 100 here, then 125. Assigned work. At 100, then 125. I got a bit 100 here, then 125. I'm at 100, then 125. Anybody else got it? Now 150. I'm at 125, and then one and a half. Of course, now 175. The bid's on the phone. At 150, then 175. A hamlet in the valley. 150, 175. I got a bit 150 here, then 175. 75 and 150 then 175 all through and done last chance and fair warning sold it well done moving along to lot number 134 it's la plage by lise la joie We're currently at 250 now 275 at 250 then 275, then 250, then 275, the lake. Yep. At 275, thank you. Now 300, 325, you're out. At 300, 325, 325, 350, now 75. 350, 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. I've got 350 here at 375. He's shaking his head on the phone. At just 350, 375, we'll give one final chance to the bidders on MNM and through live auctioneers. Thank you, 400, that's bid. Now 425, you're out again. At 400, then 425, it'd be 400, then 425. I've got 400. 400, then 425, it'd be 400 here, then 425, it'd be 400, then 425. Are we all done? At 400, then 425 on the work by Lise Lajoie. At 400, 425, fair warning, last chance, and final call. Are we all done? At 400, 425. Sold it at 400, well done. Lot number 136. Here Comes Daddy by E. Joyce Mikaminsky. What do you say to start? We're at 225, a great piece from Nova Scotia here. It's an oil on board. 225, now 250. Here comes Daddy. E. Joyce Mikamiski. 225 and then two and a half. I'm bit 225 and then two and a half. I'm a bit 250, 275. 250, yes, now 275. I'm bit 250, 275 and then 275 and then 275 and 300. At 275 and then three, you get a bit 275 here and then 300. At 275 and then three, you get 275 and then 300. 275 and then three. Anybody else? 275 is bid, 300 last chance, and then fair warning, 300, yes, I'll take it, now 325, 300, then 325, I got a bid 3, then 325, and the bid 300, 325, last chance, and final call, all through at 300, 325, sold at 300, sold at 300, 137, How We Wait by Janice Barnes, an acrylic on canvas, a humorous composition at 100 now 125 only 100 is bid yes now 125 what a bargain here at 100 and 125 i got a bit 100 than 125 i'm at 100 than 125 i got a bit 100 than 125 on how we wait 150, yes, of course, now 175. At 150, then 175, I got a bit 150 here, then 175, now 200. 175 at the two, got a bit 175 at the two, got a bit 175 at the 200. I'm at 175, you wanna be two? I've got 175 here, and 200, last chance, at just 175 or two, fair warning. 200 took it, yes, now 225, back to you. At 200, then 225, I got a bit two, then 225 and 250. 225 and then two and a half. 225 and then two and a half and then 275, right back to you. At 275, 250, then 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 250, then 75 and all through, done. 275, I'll take it, just under the gun, now 300. 275 and then three. At 275 and then three, got to be 275 and then 300. And 275, three, then 325. 300, then 325, it'll be 300, then 325, it'll be 300 here, now 325. I'm at 300, now 325, fair warning. 325, 350, 75, 50, 75, 50, 75, 50, 75, 50, 75. At 350, then 75 and 50, 75, all through and done. So there, 350. Moving along, lot number 138, the Saskatchewan Schoolhouse by Joseph Friesen at 175 from Hague, Saskatchewan, asking 200. 
175 and then two. Got 175 here, yes, now 200. 175, you're in, now two. 175 and then two, 175 and then two, 175 and 200. I'm at 175 here and then two, thank you, 225 now. 200 then 225, you're out. At 200 then 225, at a bit 200 then 225, 250, 250, 275. At 250 then 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 250 bid, now 75, 300. 275 and then three, and right back to you at 300. At 275, three, thank you, 325. I have 300 now, asking three, 25 only at 300 then 325 I get a bit 300 here then 325 I'm at 300 then 325 but are we all done last chance fair warning at 300 now 325 <laughs> sold at 300 well done moving along lot number 139 the scene of the cowboy bucked off horse in chip carved frame great naive painting here in a chip carved frame 175 what a look now 200 225 from Western Canada at 200, 225, and then 250. I've got 225, yes, now 250, thank you, 75. At 250, then 75, and 50, 75, and 300. 275, and 300. At 300, then 325, I get a bit 300 here, then 325, and 325, 350. 325, and then three and a half, at a bit 325, and then 350, 50, 50, 325, and then three and a half. Thank you, 75. 350, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 350, then 75. I'm at 350 here, now 375 on this great Western Canadian scene of a cowboy being bucked off of his horse in a great chip carved frame, last chance at 375. Thank you, 400, you gotta get your bids in at 375 because we must move along. I'm asking 400, last chance and final call. 375 and 400. Sold it there, 375, well done. Lot number 140 is coming up. And what do we have here? It's the Cabin in the Woods relief cut panel by Ewald Rents. He did very few of these. Most of his were carved sculptures but very few of these relief cut panels, and they are excellent when they come to the market from Ewald Rents of Beardmore, Ontario, at 600, now six and a half, now 700, six and a half, and then 700. 650, then seven, and a bit 700, then seven and a half. At 700, then seven and a half on the relief cut panel by Ewald Rents. 700 here, yes, now 750. I'm at 700, then seven and a half, at a bit 700, then 750. Go seven and a half. At 700, then seven and a half, at a bit 700, then 750, 50, 50, 700, then seven and a half. 700 is bid already. You must be 750 if you'd like it. At 700, now seven and a half on the relief cut panel. 800, right back to you. 800, thank you, eight and a half. 800, then eight and a half. I'm at 800, then eight and a half. I got a bit eight and then 850. All through and done. Last chance and final call on the Cabin in the Woods scene by Ewald Rents, 800, 850. Sold at 800, thank you. Well done, moving along. Lot number 141 from Hemingford, Quebec, circa 1970. A great oil on board of a campfire cookout near a railroad line by Bill Mail, and it's signed by Bill Mail in the lower right corner, 125 and one and a half, 125 and then 150. Lots going on in this one, 150 then 175, and the colors are great too, at 175 and 200. I'm at 175, two, thank you, 225. 200, then 225, I got a bit 200, then 225, I got a bit 200 here, now 225. At 200, then 225, 250. 225, and then two and a half. 225, and then 250, go 225, and then two and a half. I'm at 225, and then 250, you have 250? I'm at 225, asking 250 on this campfire cookout scene. Two and a half, thank you, 75, now 300. 275 and then three, you're out. At 275 and then three, you got bid 275 and then 300, go 325. At 300 then 325, do you like it? At 300 then 325, what's another bid? At 300 then 325, I got a bid 300 here, then 325, last chance. On the Quebec campfire cookout scene near the railroad featuring the locomotive in the back, is that it? Is that all? We'll sell it today, 300 asking 325, fair warning. Sold it, thank you very much. Moving along to lot number 142. Currently bid 400, asking 425 on the dancing sh scene by Brody Shear. Take a look, the motion in this image, a fabulous piece. And we're currently advanced to 500, asking 550. I have 500, yes now five and a half, 600. Five and a half is bid now 600. 
five and a half, and then six on the dancing scene. 600, 650, now 700. 650, then 700. 700, now seven and a half. Thank you. 700, then seven and a half. The whimsical scene, the dancing scene by Brody Shear. 750, 800. Thank you. Now 850, 900. 850, then 900. Huh? I'm at 850, then 900. Thank you. 850, then 900. 850, then 900. Huh? I'm at 850, then 9. What a fabulous scene here. At 850, then 900. Got a bit 850, then 9. At a bit 850, then 9. At a bit 850, then 900. 900, 950. Yes, now 1,000. 950 is bid, now 1,000. I'm at 950 here on this Montreal, Quebec dancing scene from the 60s. A fabulous, colorful, Lots of motions, 950, 1,000, and I got the bid 950 here and 1,000. Thank you. Then 1,100, of course. Now 1,200. 1,100 is bid, and then 1,200. I have 1,100. Yes, now 12. And I got the bid 1,100, then 12, and a bid 11, then 12 on the dancing scene. At 11, then 12, and a bid 11, then 12, and a bid 11, then 12. But are we all done? Because we've got to move along at 11, and we'll sell it today. We're at 11, then 1,200. Fair. Thank you. 1,200, of course. Now 13. Right back to you. 1,200 is bid, now 13. You've got to be 13 if you'd like it, and you've got to be quick. At 12 and then 13. At 12 and then 13, got to be 1,200 here, then 13. It'll be 1,200, then 13. Got to be 12 and then 13 all through. 12 and then 13, last chance, final call on the dancing scene by Brody Shear at 1,200, 13, 1,400. 13, 1,400. 13 is bid, yes, now 1,400. I don't have much time though. At 13, no, 14, it'd have been 13, then 1400. At 13, then 14, last chance. At 13, 1400, final call, all through and done. 14, yes, now 1500. 14, then 1500. I'll bring it right back to you, but we don't have much time to think here. At 14, then 1500 on this fabulous dancing scene. At 14, then 1500. What a great look. At 14, then 15, 15. Thank you. Now 1600. Shouldn't be much to think about. We're just getting into the range of what we were expecting. 15, now 1600. At 15, then 16. Got a bit 15 here, then 1600. I'm at 15, then 16. Got a bit 15, then 16. But are we all done? At 15, 1600. Fair warning. Last chance and final call. 16, 1700, 16, then 17, right back to you at 16, then 17 on this boisterous dancing scene, 16, 1700, at 16, then 17, it'd have been 16, then 1700, 16, and then 17, it'd have been 16, then 1700, and 1800, now 1800, 17 is bid here, 1800 you must be. 17, now 18. I'm at 17 and then 18, it'd have been 17 and then 18, it'd have been 17 and then 18. Are we all done? At 17 and then 18, thank you, now 1900. 18, then 1900. I'm at 18, then 19, it'd have been 18, then 19, it'd have been 18. Here, then 1900, thank you, 2000. 19 and 2000. At 19 and then 2, it'd have been 19, then 2, it'd have been 19, then 2. You can see the motion in this Montreal, Quebec piece. 19, now 2000, 19 and then 2. It's only money at just 19, now 2,000. And fair warning, we must move along. 19, 2,000 all through and done. Last chance and final call. 2,000, 22 and a half. You gotta be quick. At 2,000, 22, 50. 2,000, then 22 and a half. I have 2,000 already. You must be 22 and a half. I'll give you one final chance. All through and done. 2,000, now 22 and a half. Fair warning. Sold it right there at 2,000. Well done. Great buy. A special piece moving into some of the spruce gum boxes. Lot number 143, an Eastern Canadian pair here at 600. Now six and a half. I'm at 600, then six and a half. I'd have been 600, then 650. At 600, then six and a half. I'd have been 600, then 650 on the pair of Eastern Canadian spruce gum boxes. Are we all done at 600, then six and a half? Fair warning. Sold those. Moving along to lot number 144, another pair of Eastern Canadian spruce gum boxes at 125 only, asking 150. 125 and then one and a half. I got a bid 125 and then 150. 125 and then one and a half. I got a bid 125 and then 150. 125 and then one and a half. Thank you. 175 and 200. You're out. I have 175 here. You must be 200. It was a left bid at 175 and then two. At 175 and then two. Got a bid 175 and then two. Are we all done? At just 175 and 200. The bargain of the day 200 and 225. At 200 than 225, it'll be 200 than 225. At 200 than 225, it'll be 200 than 225. Are we all done? 144, we're at. At 200 than 225, last chance, final call, 200, 225. Sold those, sold those as we move along to lot number 145.
There's three Boer War prisoner of war carved trick boxes. Buying three of them here. Lots of history in this trio. 550, yes, of course, now 600. 550, then 600. Five and a half and then six. I got a bit five and a half and then six as the telephone bidders walk up on stage. 550, 600. And I get the bid 550, then six. And a bit 550 here and then 600. At 550, then six. And a bit 550, then 600. 550, then six. Are we all done? Last chance. Final call. Sold them at 550. Moving along to lot number 146. And what do we have here? The chip carve spruce gum box. A fabulous example again. We're at five and a half asking 600. I have five and a half here, 600, 650, thank you, now 700. At 650, 700, thank you, 700, now 750. The bid was on here, you've got to be 750, John, it didn't take yours. I have 700 here, seven and a half, you've got to be. At 700, then seven and a half, it'd be 700, thank you, seven and, a, seven and a half on the phone, now 800, you're out again, 850, back to you. 850, back to you. At 800 and 850, thank you, 900. The bid's on the phone, now at 850, now 900. 850, then nine. And I get a bit 850, then nine. 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 John, you're in. At 850, then 900. Make no mistake, we've got the telephone bidder in at 850. At 850, now 900. Thank you, nine and a half. Back to you. 900, then nine and a half. Do you want to be nine and a half? Of course. Yes, thank you. 950. Now 1,000. 950 on the telephone. Now 1,000, I'm asking back to Eminem. At 950, we've got on the phone 1,000. On this fine spruce gum box, a thousand bid. Yes, now eleven hundred. Now eleven hundred. A thousand and eleven and a bit. Thousand and eleven and a bit. Thank you. Now eleven hundred with John. Now twelve hundred. Eleven hundred is bid. Then twelve. I'm at eleven. Then twelve. At a bit eleven. Then twelve. At a bit eleven. Then twelve. At a twelve hundred. Then thirteen. 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 You got to think quick. At a bit twelve hundred. Then thirteen. I get bid with Eminem at twelve hundred. Now thirteen. The telephone bidder's out. Last chance at twelve hundred. Thirteen hundred. Fair warning. Are we all done? Thank you. Thirteen. Fourteen hundred. Thirteen. Then fourteen hundred. And you got to make your mind up here at thirteen. Then fourteen on this fabulous chip carved spruce gum box. At thirteen. Then fourteen hundred. Fourteen. Then fifteen hundred. At fourteen. And then fifteen. Got a bit. 14 and then 15, and a bit 14, then 1500. He's out. I've got my hammer up. We're at 1400. He says no. I say sold. 1400. Eminem. Moving along. Lot number 147. Another spruce gum box. This one Eastern Canadian as well from the late 19th century. Gotta love these book form slide lid spruce gum boxes. At just 425, asking 450 for 147. We're at 425 online, asking four and a half. Got 425, 450 on the phone. Thank you, Ben. At 450, 475, you're out. Back to you at 500. 500. 475, 500, then 550 you need. Yes, 500, then 550. Thank you. Yes, now 600. 550 on the telephone. Now 6 back to you, M&M. At 550, then 6. At a bit 550, then 6. At a bit 550, then 6. At a bit 550, then 600. The bid's on the phone. At 550, now 600. And I get a bit 5.5, and, and then 6. At a bit 5.5, and, and then 600. We'll sell it today. 550, 600, last chance, final call, are we all done, last chance and fair warning. Sold it there to the telephone, what's his number? Thank you, sir. Moving along, lot number 148, and I believe it's another spruce gum box, this one from Wiscasset, Maine, found in Wiscasset, Maine, we got the provenance from this. Currently at 425, a nice decorated spruce gum box, at 425 asking 450. Thank you. Now 75 and 500. 475 and 500, then 550, 600. 550, 600. 550, then 600. I'm at five and a half, and then six, and a bit five and a half, and then six, and then five and a half. 600 on the Wiscasset Main Spruce Gum Box. 600 is bid, but we've got a left bid at six. You've got to be 650 if you'd like it. At 600, now six and a half. 600, then six and a half. You've got to be six and a half if you'd like it. You're out. Thank you. 650, now 700. 650, then 700. 700, then 750. 700, then 7.5. It'd have been 700, then 750. I'm at 700, then 7.5. It'd have been 700, then 750. Go 50, 700, then 7.5. Are we all done? 700, then 7.5. Last chance. Got it? Yes. Now 800. You're in. 7263's in. At 750, then 800. Seven and a half and then eight on the Wiscasset Main decorated spruce gum box. 750, 800. Last chance, final call. Are we all done? Any further bidding? Sold it right there at 750. And the hall is a buzz as we move along to lot number 149, the Eastern Canadian spruce 
gum box with anticipation of what's to come. It's been advanced now to 650, asking 700. I have 650 already, now 700. Six and a half and then seven, got a bit six and a half and then 700. 1908, a dated example and signed, I might add. 700, I'm asking. 700, I'm asking. I have six and a half already, now 700 on this fabulous Eastern Canadian spruce gum box. 650, then seven, got a bit 650 here and then 700. Dated and signed. 650, 700, got a bit six and a half and then seven. Care to give it one more try? Thank you. 750, 800. Seven and a half and then 800. You're out again. 750, then eight. Again, 750 here, then 800. I'm at seven and a half and then eight. Got a bit seven and a half and then eight. One more time. 750, then 800. I got to run. 750, 800. Last chance on 149. Are we all done? All through. Hammers up. Sold it there. 750. Well done. Well done. 150, a fabulous trick box titled Tony Pastor's Dream, an Eastern Canadian trip, uh, trick box here with the life of Adam and Eve on the back. What a fabulous piece here. Carved, decorated, whimsical. 600, now six and a half. It's kind of it's kind of got everything you want in one of these. 600, then six and a half. I have 600 already. I have 600. We've been advanced to 600 in the pre-bidding. I'm asking 650 now on the telephone. Yes, now 700. 650 on the phone. Now 700. You're out. At 650, 700, then seven and a half. Right back to you. 700, then seven and a half. I need seven and a half. Ethan, thank you. Now 800. Seven and a half on the telephone. Now 800. Now eight and a half. Right back to you. 800, then eight and a half. I got a bit 800 here, then eight and a half. And 800, then eight and a half. Thank you. 900. Eight and a half, and then 900. Eight and a half and then 900. Yep. I'm at 900 then 950, right back to you. 900 then nine and a half, it'd be 900 then nine and a half. Thank you, now 1,000. Nine and a half and then 1,000. The bid's on the telephone yep. at 950, 1,000. He's right there, back to you at 1,100. 1,000 then 1,100. And I get a bit 1,000 then 1,100, 1,000 then 1,000, 1,100, dollars here, 1,100. Thank you, 1,200. The bid's on the phone at 1,100. 1,200, right back to you. At 11, now yep. 1,200. And they're right there, 1,300 on Tony Pastor's dream. 1300, I'm asking Ethan. At 1200, then 13. What are they saying? Yes, now 1400. 13. Now 1400. Ethan's on at 13. Now 1400. What are, what are they yep. saying? Yes, they're right there, of course. Now 1500. 15. Now 1600. A bid online has come in. A new man in at 1500 asking 16. It's up to either of yep. you. 16. Thank you. 1700. The bid's with LA. At 16, then 17, and then 1800. The online bidder's back. 1800 now. I'm at 17, and then 18. It could have been 17 here, and then 1800. Anybody else? At 17, and then 18 on Tony Pastor's dream. The bid's with MM. 7245. You're on. At 17 asking 1800. What are they saying, Ethan? Do they want to try it one more time at 1800? 1800 we've got 17 asking 1800 thank you yes on the phone ethan's in ethan's man is in at 1800 now you're out again 19 2000 not soon after they bid again at 1900 with m&m now 2000 we've got to keep it moving along here though at 1900 then 2000 got to be 19 then two and he's walking away which signifies to me that he's done he's tapping out but we've got other bidders here. At 1,900 with M&M, now 2,000, are we all done? Last chance and fair warning, at 1,900, 2,000 hammers in the air. They're out, they're out, everyone's out. 1,900, 2,000. Sold it right there at 1,900, well done. What a great piece. Here's the one that everyone's been talking about, that everyone's been waiting for from Lunenburg County in Nova Scotia, a dated 1896 Nova Scotia carved spruce gum box, that fabulous book form. It has everything that you want in a great, great piece of Canadian history and a great spruce gum box, currently advanced to 2,000. Need 22 and a half. Yep. Thank you. Ben's in at 22 and a half. Ben's man is in. At 22.50, we got it on the telephone. 22 and a half asking 2,500. I'm at 22 and a half right here. 25, thank you. Now 27.50. Candace is in. 25 and 27 yep. and a half. Thank you. Now 3,000. 27 and a half and 3,000. Ben's in. At 27 and a half and 3,000. Thank you. 3,000 and 32 and a half. At 3,000 and 32 and a half. And at yep. 3,000, 32, 50, go 35. I'm at 32, 50, go 35. And then 35 and 35. Thank you. 37, 50. 35 with Candace. Now 37.50 yep. and 4,000. Back to you. 37.50. Right here, yep. now 4,000, of course, 42 and a half. At 4,000, then 42 and a half on the fabulous Nova yep. Scotia carved spruce gum box, of course, now 4,500. Yep. 45 and then 47 and a half. 47.50. 47 and a half, we're asking, Ben. Yep. Thank you. Now 5,000. 47 and a half and then 5,000. Yep. 
Of course, 5,500. Back to you. 5,000, then 55, get 5, and then 55, and then 5, and then 5,500. Yes. Thank you. Now 5,500, 6,000 to you. 5,500, then 6,000. She's shaking her head at 5,500 with Ben, now 6,000. We still do have another telephone bidder listening along, shaking his head. 5,500. The bid's with Ben at 55. Now it's still open online if you'd like to participate at this point. The phone bidders are slowly thinking. I'll give them one more opportunity, Candace, if they'd like to consider 6,000. We do have 55 on the other telephone bidder. 55, 6,000. Thank you. Of course, now 65. You almost had it. 6,000, then 6,500. I'm at 6,000. And now it's Candace's bidder that's in. 65, he's right back. Now 7,000. 65 and then 7,000. Why stop now? Why stop now on a fabulous, fabulous spruce gum box? One of the nicest ones I've seen. It has literally everything you would want to see in one of these decorated, carved, known date. 7,000. Candace, what do you say? 7,000. Yeah. Thank you. Now 7,500. 7,000 and 7,500. It shouldn't take much thinking, given how fabulous it is. At 7,000, now it's between the two telephone bidders, but yeah. it is still open online. Thank you, Ben. 7,500, now 8,000. 7,500, then 8,000. Shouldn't take much convincing. At 7,500 with Ben, now 8,000. I'm at 7,500, then 8,000. I'll give them one last chance, Candace, if they'd like to try it one more time. We have 7,500 with Ben. Give it one more try. Why wouldn't you? You've come this far. It's within your grasp. At 7,500 with Ben on the telephone, 8,000, give it a try. Of course, yes, 8,000, then 8,500. 8,000, then 8,500. I'm at 8,000 here, now 8,500. Candace's bidder is in on the telephone. It's a back and forth battle at 75, 8,000, then 8,500, asking 85, Ben. That's museum quality? Absolutely. It is museum quality, Ben. At 8,000, 8,500. Yes! Of course. Now 9,000. 8,500 here. Now 9,000. I'm at 85 and then 9, got a bit 85 and then 9,000. I'm at 85 and then 9, got a bit 85 and then 9. This may just be the bid that takes it home. 8,500, 9,000. It shouldn't take much convincing at 8,500, given what we're talking about here. 9,000, of course. Now 9,500. It's within your grasp. 9,000, 9,500. At 9,000, then 95. It'd be 9,000, then 95. Maybe they should just try 10,000. That always seems to work before. At 9,000, 9,500. At 9,000, then 95. The bid's with Candace at 9,000 on the fabulous Nova Scotia carved spruce gum box asking 9,500 and probably giving them more time to think than I should because we've got to move along and I'm putting my hammer up in the air at 9,000. Do you care to give it one more try? Ask him very kindly if I could have 9,500. Otherwise, I must sell to Candace's bidder at 9,000, 9,500. Are we all done? Last chance and fair warning. Sold it right there, 9,000, well done. And she'll pass along the bidder number. What a fabulous piece that we're so happy to have sold today. Moving right along to lot number 152. And we are not done yet, everybody. It's the New Brunswick carved spruce gum box. Another gorgeous piece from 1897. 1,500, 1,600 you must be if you'd like to bid. John, 16. You're in? Good. Yes, now 1,700. We've got the tele... Now you're out again. 17 and then 1,800 if you'd like it. At 17 and then 18. You've got to bid 17 and then 1,800. I'm at 17 and then 18. Thank you. Now 1,900. 18 on the phone and then 1,900 back to you. At 18 and then 19. At a bit 18 and then 19. At a bit 18 and then 1,900. 19 and then 2,000. John, you're out again. At 19 and then 2,000. Thank you. Now 22 and a half. 22 and a half and then 25. Sorry, we got ahead of ourselves there. We're at 2,000 asking 22 and a half. 2,000, 22 and a half. Do you want to be 22 and a half, John? We have 2,000 here, now 22 and a half. 2,000, then 22 and a half. It'll be 2,000 here, then 2,250. And we got it online already. Thank you. 2,250, now 25. That's what happens when you hesitate. Someone else jumps in, of course. 2,250, then 2,500. At 22 and a half, and then 25. And the bid's online, 25, and then 27 and a half. I've got 25, and then 27 and a half. It'll be 25, and then 2,750. 25, and then 27 and a half. Yep. Thank you. Now 3,000. 27 and a half on the phone and then three. I'm at 27 and a half and then three. Thank you. 32 and a half. Back to you, John. At 3,000 and 32 and a half. We've got to be 3,000 and 32. 50. 3,000 and 32 and a half. It'd be 30,000 and 32 and a half. It'd be 3,000 here. 32. 50. 
3,000 and 32 and a half. 3,000 here, then 32 and a half. If we wait long enough, it'll be 3,500 because someone else online, of course, will jump in at 3,000 asking 32 and a half if you'd like it. John? Care to give it one more try? We're at 3,032 and a half. We must move along. It's our last, thank you, 32 and a half, now 3,500. 32 and a half and then 35 on this gorgeous New Brunswick 1897 carved spruce gum box. The bid's with a telephone at 32 and a half. We must move along. I've got my hammer in the air at 32.50, now 35. Thank you, 37 and a half. 35 and then 37.50. 35 and then 37 and a half. What do they say? At 35 and then 37 and a half and then 37 and a half and then 37 and a half. Are we all done? He's shaking his head. At 35 and then 37.50. Give him one more try. All through and done. Sold 3,500. Sold it at 3,500. Moving along to lot number 153. A horse drawn covered wagon and sleigh. Western Ontario. 75 only. Now 100. I'm at 75 and then one. Got to be 75 and then one. Got to be 75 and then one. Got to be 75 and then 100. Last chance. Fair warning. All through and done. Sold it right there. Just 75. Moving along to lot number 154. It's the ox drawn stone boat by Jacob Roth from Waterloo County, Ontario. And this doesn't get much more Waterloo County, a, an ox-drawn stone boat, 175 only. Now 200 at 175 and then two. I bid 175 and then two, got a bid 175, 200 and 225. Yes, I'll take that. And 225, go 250, 225 and then two and a half, two and a half and then 275. Gotta love these sculptures by Jacob Roth at 275, 325 now, 300 is bid, 325, 350, 325 and then three and a half, and 325 and then three, 50, 50, 50, 325 and then three and a half, I'm at 325 and then 350, but is that it, is that all at just 325, 350, 375, at 350, 375 and then 375 and 400, 375 and then 400, at 375 and then four, you gotta be four if you'd like it, at 375 and then four, I've got 375 and then 400, is that it, is that all? Fair warning, last chance and final call. Sold it at 375. Well done. Lot number 155. Another one from Jacob Roth. It's the Mennonite couple in the horse drawn buggy, a, a, a subject he loved to sculpt. This one at 275 only. Now 300. 275 only from mixed materials here at 275, 300, then 325. 325. I'm at 300, then 325. I got to be 300, then 325. I got to be 300 here. 325. At 300, then 325. I got to be 300, 325. Last chance, 325. Okay, yes, now 350. 325, and then three and a half. I'm at 325 and then 350, go 325 and then three and a half. At 325 and then 350, 375. 350, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 350. Now 75, fair warning. Last chance and final call at 350, 375. Sold at 350, well done. Lot number 156, another one by Jacob Roth. It's the Mennonite couple in the horse-drawn sleigh this time. At 150, 175. At 150, then 75. At 50, 75. And 150, then 75. At 150, then 175. I got a bit 150 here, then 175. The detail is excellent in these nostalgic carvings. 200, then 225. At 200 bid, then 225. Go 250. 225, and then 250. I'm at 225, and then two and a half. I got the bit here. 225, 250. 225, and then two and a half. I got a bit 225, and then 250, 50, 50, 225, and then two and a half. Are we all done? At just 225, now 250. What a bargain here, far below what we were anticipating, just 225, 250. We're selling it today, all through, all done. Sold it at 225. Moving along to lot number 157. It's another Jacob Roth, this one a horse-drawn log sleigh. 275 only, now 300. Yes, 325, go 350, 75 and 400. 375 and 400. At 375 and then four, got to be 375 here and then 400. At 375, 400 and 425, thank you, 450, of course. At 425 and then four and a half, I got to be 425 and then four and a half. This is the one I'd be going for at 425, 450. At 425, 450, 475 and then 500. 475 and then five, I got 475 and then 500. You got it? This 550, now 600. 550, then 600. 550, then 600, you're out. At 550, then six, at a bit 550, then six, care to get another kick? At 550, 600, is that it? Is that all? At just 550, now 600, and fair warning, hammers up, last chance, and final call. 
sold it at 550. Well done. Lot number 158, the horse drawn wagon. Another one from Jacob Roth at 250, 275, 300, 325, 350, now 375. I have 350. It was left. You must be 375. There it is. Now 400. 400 then. 425. Got a bit 400 here, now 425. And I got the bit four, the 425. I got a bit 425, and then 450. 425, and then four and a half. And a bit 425, and then 450, 50, 50, 425, and then four and a half. Are we all done? 450, 475. At 450, 475, and then 75, and then 75, and 450, 475, and then 500. 475, and then five. I'm at 475, and then five, and 475, and then 500. 475, and then five, and 475, and then 500. Go 550. At 500, then 550. I'm at 500, then five and a half, and then 600. Five and a half and then 600 at 550 bid yes now 600 please 550 then 6 at a bit 550 then 6 at a bit 550 then 6 at a bit 550 then 600 all through and done last chance fair warning 550 600 sold at 550 well done well bought great piece 159 another one from Jacob Roth these are fabulous this one the horse drawn Conestoga wagon 225 yes now 250 275 250 then 75 at 275 at 300 300 then 325 at 300 then 325 at a bit 300 then 325 at a bit 325 and 350 350 375 a great story here of course the Conestoga wagons were used when the ancestors our ancestors braved the wilds on the Conestoga trail 475 and 500 to settle in Ontario history does it get any more Canadian than that 550 600 600 then six and a half at 600 then six and a half at a bit 600 then 650 650 700 now 700 750 700 then seven and a half at a bit 700 here though 750 700 then seven and a half at a bit 700 then 750 I've got 700 already if you'd like to be 750 though we can work with you at 700 then seven and a half is that it is that all Last, thank you, 750, 800, 8 and a half. He's right there at 800, then 8 and a half. At a bit 800, then 850. 800, then 8 and a half. Last chance and fair warning. 800, then 850. Final call. Any further bidding? Sold at 800. Well done. Great piece. And we're not done with the Jacob Ross yet. The horse drawn milk wagon is up now. Lot number 160. Currently bid to 250, asking 275. I'm at 250, 275, and 300. Thank you, 300, then 325. I've got the bid 300 here. Yes, you're in. 300, 325. Now you're out. 350, 375. Love it. At 350, 375. I'm get 350, 375. I'm get 350, 375. And then 400. 400, then 425. At 400, then 425. I'm get 400, then 425. And go 450. 450, 475. At 450, then 75. And 50, 75. And 50, 75. And 4, 50, 75. And 450, 475. And then 500, then 550. 500, then 5 and a half. At 500, then 5 and a half. I'm get 500, then 5 and a half. And then 600. The horse drawn. Milk wagon 650 asking at 600 than six and a half. At 600 than six and a half, there shouldn't be much to think about given we expected this to sell between 12 and 1600. 700 than 750 and 700 than 750. At 700 than 750, 700 than seven and a half. I'm at 700 than seven and a half and 800. 800 than 850. I'm at 800 than eight and a half. At 800 than 850, go 850, 800, eight and a half. I'm at 800 than eight and a half are we all done at just 800 now 850 i've got my hammer up because we must move along and we'll sell it today at 800 or 850 any further bids sold at 800 well done lot 161 the auction scene by jacob roth here we are right now got our own auction scene going on 350 now 375 but the auction scene such a part of Ontario history of Canadian culture, 350, 375. At 350, 375, now 400. 400, then 425. I love this one. At 400, then 425. At a bit 400, then 425. One of my favorites of the Jacob Ross that we've sold today and in the past, 425, 450. Lots going on here. A lively, 
lively sculpture. 450, then 475, now 500. 475, and then 5, you got to be 500, then 550. 550, 600. I'm at 5 and a half, and then 6, you got to be 550, 600. 550, now 6, got to be 550 here, and then 6, and a bit 550. Anybody else? At 550, then 6, get 550 here, then 650, 500, six, uh, sorry, 550, 600. 550, then 6, 600, then 6 and a half. I'm at 600, then 6 and a half, now 700. Now 700. 6 and a half, and then 7, and a bit 6 and a half, and then 7. On the auction scene by Jacob Roth at six and a half, seven hundred. I'm at six and a half, and then seven, got a bit six and a half, and then seven hundred. At six and a half, and then seven, and a bit six and a half here, then seven hundred. Anybody else? Last chance at six and a half, seven hundred. What a bargain here at six fifty, seven hundred. Fair warning, all through and done. Sold it right there, 650. Moving along to lot number 162. It's the Child's Sheraton armchair. The Child's Sheraton armchair. And what do we say on this one? How much? We're at 100 only. Now 125. 100, then 125. It'd have been 100, then 125. I got a bit 125 here, and then 150. 125, and then 150. Yes, now 175. 150, then 175. I got a bit 150, then 175. Thank you, 200. 175, and then two. All reupholstered, ready to use here. That would have come at a cost, I'm sure. It's an 1830s leg, everybody. In well done in modern upholstery, 250, yes, 275. At 250, then 275, I got a bit 250 here, then 275 on the child's Sheraton armchair. At 250, 275, and 300. 275, and then three, you got a bit 275, and then three, you got a bit 275, and then 300. At 275, and then three, you could even come close to reupholstering this for this kind of money. At 300, and you wouldn't even have the chair. At 300, then 325. Got a bit 300 here, then 325. Got a bit 300, then 325. Nice clean piece, 300, 325. Are we all done? Last chance and fair warning. Hammers up and coming down at 300, 325. Sold it right there at 300. Moving right along to lot number 163, a piece that comes from where we are today in New Hamburg, Ontario, circa 1860. A great painted pine footstool. What do you say to start? 225. We have now 250. Thank you. At 225, asking two and a half. At 225 and then 250, go 225, excellent. Double mortise construction wedged through the top. 225 and then 250, a well-made stool. At 225 and then two and a half, got up at 225 and then 250, got 250, thank you. 275 and then 300. At 275 and then 300. At 275 and then three, got 275 and then three, got 275 and three. Fair warning, all through and done. Last chance and final call. Sold her there, 275, well done. Lot number 164, it's the painted hanging knife and pumice box, a wall-mounted knife and pumice box here, circa 1880. We're thinking it's pine or poplar, a softwood at the very least. 125, thank you. Yes, now 150. Nice surface on this. Good, honest wear from use. 125 and then 150. A 150, thank you, 175. The bids with that, hey, 150, then 175. I got the bid 150, then 175. I got a bid 150 here, then 175. Anybody else? Got it, yes, now 200. 175 at the two, got a bid 175. The surface exactly the way you want to find them. 200, then 225. At 200, then 225. The man's in here. At 200, then 225. I got a bid 200, then 225. But are we all done? At 200, then 225. Fair warning. Last chance and final call on the knife and pumice box. Sold it at 200. Moving along to lot number 165. Another painted pine wall box. This one mid 19th century. Good, nice early look to this one. At 225, then 250. 225, the feature, the scrolled backboard, of course, of course, making the look on this one. 225, there it is. 250, then 75. Thank you. 325, 350. I have 325 here. You've got to be 350 if you'd like it. At 325, and then 350, go 325, and then three and a half. I'm at 325, and then 350, go 350, 325, and then 350. Are we all done? At 325, and then 350, last chance. Fair warning. All through and done. 350, just under the gun. At 375, 350 then 375, we'll give them one more chance. At 350, 375, fair warning, all through and done. Sold it there, 350. I'm going to pass the gavel over to Ethan uh, for lot number 166. Thank you, Justin. Lot 166, we have the painted oval pantry box. 
Nice little oval splint box there with root sewn seams. Makes the box for sure. 750, 800 now at seven and a half, 800. I have your 750, 800 now. Don't lose this one. Take a look at the size. 750, 800, very unusual. 750, 800, nice one. 758, I have your 750, 800 where? Hammers in the air at 758, fair warning, 758, 750 now, 800 where? Sold 750, and thank you. 167, this is the Quebec slide top candle box. 150, 175 where? 150 here, yes, I have you, 175. 150, 175, and then 150 now, 175. At only 175, 225 only. At 2550, at 2550, at 2550. Nice early one, 57.5, 57.5, 57.5, 57 57.5. That's two and a half now, 75. Fair warning then, at 75, 300. Bids in at 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 3. Fair warning, hammers in the air. At 325, then on you, 25 and then 25 and then 25. Don't lose this deal. 25 and then 25 and then 25. Fair warning. At 300 now, 25. 300 now, 25 and then 300 now, 25 and then 300 now, 325 and then 325. Sold right there. And then 168, moving along the painted dome top document box there. A great one for sure. Early, early, early. At 400 now, 425 only. Look at the surface, 25, 50. Spectacular, 425, 450. At 25 and then 50. At 25, 50, 25, 50. That's only 25 and then 450. Now 75. You have to be 75. You're out. At 450 now, 75 and then 75 and then 75 only. At 75 and then 500 only. At 475, 500 only. 475, 500. 475, 500. You're out. 400, 75, 500. Don't lose this deal. Take a look at the surface. 500, 550. At 500, 5 and a half. 500, 550. 500, 5 and a half and then 500, 550. My hammer's up. Bids in. 500, 5 and a half and then 550. Now 600. Your turn. 5 and a half, 6. You're out. Five and a half, six, you're out. Five and a half, six, fair warning. Hammers in the air. Five, fifty, six, hundred. Five and a half, six, hundred. Five and a half, now six. Took it, six, fifty, now. Back to you. Six hundred, don't lose it. Six hundred, now. Six, fifty, fair warning. Hammers in the air. Is that all? Six hundred, six hundred, fifty. Last chance and final call. Six hundred, six and a half. <laughs> Sold right there. Six hundred, that's gone. One, six, nine. This, the Ontario inlaid document box dating to the late 19th century there. Walnut with mixed hardwoods, yep. 425. Took it 50, 75, 75, yep. 75, 5, 550 now. 550, 550, yes, 600, took it 650, please. Yep. Yes, 650, 700. I have 650 on the telephone with Ben. 650, 750, please. Yes, yes 800 now. 758 fair warning at 750 800 hammers in the air is that all are we in and done at 758 last chance and final call at 750 800 dollars 758 170 that's 170 it's the ontario caller back Windsor chair. Now there's a good honest chair. What do you say on this? 125, 150 where? Nice honest example. 125, 50. 125, 50. 125, 50. Yes, 75. 75, 75, 50, 75. Honest chair. 200, please. 175, 2. Nice one. Yep. 175, 225. Honest, 225. Honest, 225. And then 225 on the telephone. 225 is all I'm bid. 225, 225, 225. Fair warning. And 50. 225 50 fair warning 25 and an evident 25 50 sold at 225 171 the american windsor armchair there there's a nice chair i only have 225 
250 now, please. At 225, 250. A buy and a bargain. 75, 300 then. Nice form on this. 75, 3. 75, 300. 75, 325, 50 now. At 25, at 25. At 300 now, 25. And then 300 now, 25, 50. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 25. Now 50, please. At 325, 350. Nice form. 325, 50. Fair warning. And 75, 50, 75. Set 50, 75 then. At 50. Now seven five where at fifty now seven five seven five seven five now four hundred seventy five four hundred seventy five four hundred seventy five four where at seventy five four hundred last chance and final call at three seventy five four hundred three seventy five now four <laughs> sold gone one seven two moving along Niagara Peninsula country couch <laughs> now there's a nice one. There's a diamond in the rough as far as I'm concerned. Pine and hardwood, circa 1840, and it is exactly that. At 250, 275. At 250, 275. Niagara Peninsula, 250 now, 275, 325. That's a buy and a bargain. At two and a half, 275, three and a half, 375, 400 now. 400 now. I should think so. Four, 400, 375, 425. A buy and a bargain. 425. At full, full 25 and then full 50. At 25, 50, 25, 50. Now 75. Now 75. Now 500. Worth every nickel. At full 75, 500. Full 75, 500, full 75, 500, full 75, 5. Is that all? At 500, 550. At 500, 550. Yes, now 600. Now 600. Five and a half. Now 600. At 556. Buy. Bargain. 550. 600. Hammer is in the air. Final call. Five and a half, six. Five and a half, 600. 550. Now 600. Your turn. <laughs> Sold right there. 550. 173 is the Hamel. Levy, Quebec, one gallon stoneware jug. 325 here, 350 where? 325, 350, I took it here. 75, thank you, Ben, 400, well done. 75, four. 75, 400, 75, 400, 75, 400, you're out. 75, 400, 75, 400, Ben is in. 75, 400 on the telephone with Ben at 375, 400, last chance and final call. 375, 400 and 25, so close. Yep. Yes, now 50, please. 25, 50. At 25, 50, 25 and a half. 25, 50, 25, half. On the telephone with Ben at 425, 50. Last chance and final call. <laughs> Sold right there, 425. 174 as we move along here. This St. John's, Quebec, one gallon stoneware jug. 175, two. At 175, 200. 100, 75, 2, 100, 75, 200, 175, 200, 175, 2. Anybody else? I have 175, 2, and you're out 225 now. At 225, you're out. 225, you are out. 25 and 25, 200 now, 225. At 225 and 225 and 200 here, 225 where? Fair warning, 225. Sold it right there at 200 out the door, 175. It's the W.E. Welding, Brantford 5 and 6 gallon pair there. Nice pair at 325 and then 350. 25, 50 on that pair, 25 and then 50. At 325, 350, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50. Last chance and final call at 325 and 350 on the pair. Sold at 325, 176. Moving along to more stoneware. This one, a single welding jug, five gallon, 150, 175, 200. 175, two, 175, two, 175, 200, 175, two. Fair warning. My hammer's up, bids in. 175, 200, 175 on this one, 200, 175. Now two. Sold right there like that. And then 177, it's the Robert McCormick Kingston Canada West two gallon stoneware jug at 150, 175. At only 150 on this one, 175. Canada West, 150, 175. Take a look, 150, 175. Worth it, 150, 175. Take a close look at the Robert McCormick jug. I have your 175. I have your 200. You have to be 225. How badly do you want it? 225 at 225 and 225 and 200. Now 225, fair warning. At 225, took at 250 then. And 275 at 275, you're out again. 
again, 250-275, out again, 250-275, out again, 250. Now 275, fair warning, you're out, 250, 275, 2575, <laughs> sold right there. 178, 178, it's the Leisure Picton Canada West six gallon stoneware jug. This one with G.I. George, as we call him, Leisure. What do you say on this one here? 150, 175, 200, 225, 225 and 250, at 225 and 250, 225, 50 now, 75, 250 now, 75, fair warning, at 275, I think we're wrong on this one, 275, 325, at 325, at 325 and 325 and 325, 350, 25, 50, at 25, 50 now, 50 and 25, 50 is all I'm bid on this one. The bird, come on folks, 57.5 at 350 now, 75, fair warning then, at 357.5, fair warning, 350, 3.75, 400, I should think so, 400, 375, 4, 75, 4, 75, 400, 75, 400, 75, 425, 425 and 4, 425 and 425, at 425 and 425, 450, at 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, Fair warning, last chance and final call, 425 and 450. <laughs> Sold it right there, 179. Moving along to the churn, yes. The churn, the bird churn, what do you say on this? Same thing, leisure, 700, 800, 850 now, 800, 850, yes, 900, took it on the churn, 859, 859, 900, 950 then, your turn, your turn on the churn, 900, 950, 900, 950, 900, 950, is that all? Are we in and done? 900, 950, last chance, and 950, one, 950, 1,000, 950, 1,000, 950, one, 1,000 took it, 1,100 now on you. 1,000 here, 1,100 on you. 1,000 here, 1,100 on you. Fair warning, 1,000, 1,100. Last chance, final call, 1,000, 1,100 now. <laughs> Sold, 1,000, gone. 180, Hart Brothers and Leisure Bay of Quinty Works, four gallon stoneware jug. And this one with the unusual inscription, what are we saying on this one? Inscribed Mary above the swirled decoration, potentially a family member. You do the, the reading. Bottom line is it's a fabulous piece, a customized piece, a, a unique and rare piece of decorated stoneware by Hart Brothers and Leisure Bay of Quinty Works. 550 here, 600 wear. 550 only, 600 wear. 550, 600 is what I'm bid. I'm only bid 550, 600, 556, 556. Another example bearing the inscription Martha Deer was made by George Lazier. It's found in the early Ontario pottery book. This one's only bid to 550, 600. Are you sure you can resist at that level? I'm only at 550, 600 where? 550, 600. Only 550, 600 took it, 650, 700. I should think so. That's no brainer territory. 650, 700. 650, 700. 650, 700. Folks were in floral territory here at 650, 700. But guess what? My hammer's in the air. We have to run. 650, 700. 700, 750 then. 750, 700, 750. You're out. You're out. 700, 750. Mary, it's inscribed. 700, 750. 700, seven and a half. Fair warning then. Is that all? I have 700, 750 where? 7750. Last chance and final call. 700 here. 750 where? Sold at 700, 181. We move along to certainly the moment we've been waiting for. The Leisure picked in Canada West, four gallon stoneware crock. Of course, a very rare piece, circa 1870s, salt glazed piece. Where do you find them inscribed with, or pardon me, in cobalt oxide decorated with the animal? In this case, the horse. Absolutely fresh to the market and absolutely proud to be offering this piece here. We're already at 5,500, 6,000, please. 55, 6 at 55 and 6,000. Very exciting piece. In fact, certainly a piece worthy of any book at 5,500 here. 
6,000 where? At 5,500 on the board, gentlemen on the phones, I need 6,000. 55. Wow, I'll tell you what a piece it truly is to find a, dec a horse decorated, laser picked in Canada West. Hits on all levels, doesn't it? Hits on all levels. At 5,500, 6,000. I salute the winning bidder. Let me tell you what a victory indeed it would be at the 5,500 level. 6,000. Fabulous early piece in the stoneware department. I have 5,500 and I'm asking 6,000 or forever hold your peace. My gavel's in the air. It's the fair warning mark at 5,500, 6,000. Are you certain? Are you sure? 5,500. Yep. Ben says six on the telephone, 6,500 now on line. 7,000, please. 7,000. I have 6,500. 7,000 now is the ask. Okay. 8,000. I love the way you work, Ben. 8,000. 8,500 now. I love the style. Ooh, answers back. Looks like a 10,000, Ben. Eighty-five hundred. I have in the hand. Ben's bidder is contemplating the next move. Okay, ten thousand. I love your style, Ben. Ten thousand here. Eleven thousand. What do you say online? I have ten thousand on the telephone with Ben. It might have done it. It's an important piece here. A very important piece. Where would you ever find another one in Canada West? I have 10,000, and that might have done it. That tactic, that, that leap bidding might have done it at 10,000. I see value in this at 11,000, but you're the judge. At 10,000, 11,000, unlocked by a long-time collector here at 10,000, 11,000, it's up to you. Did that do it? Is that it? Is that all? Are you finished? 10,000, asking 11,000. Ben's on the telephone at 10. He's locked in at 10. 11,000 to you. Are you sure we're finished? Gentlemen, put 10,5 on the board just for fun. 10,000, 10,5. 10,000, 10,5. Just in case there's some thinking. And that sometimes does it. 11, Ben. 12, I bet, would do it. You sure? I bet you 12. I, I honestly think one more kick does it. It's only a $500 kick. At 10, 5, 11, where would you find another horse? Where would you find another horse? At 10, 5, 11, yeah. yes, thank you, Ben. 11, 5 now. These, these $500 increments are fun. 11,000, 11, 5. 11,000, 11, 5. At 11,000, 11, 5, we're selling one of the scarcest stoneware pieces to have surfaced recently. In Canada, at 11,000, 11, I have the 11 on the phone and 11, online. Are you sure? Are you finished? Are you done? All in and done? At 11,000, 11, fair warning, 11,000, 11, sold it at 11. Well done, gentlemen. Well done, Ben. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And then we move to the sandwich, Washington cut overlay lamp. 375, 400. These part of the pit collection. They're all a part of the same longtime collection, maritime collection. 300, 754, 300, 754. Fair warning. 300, 75, and then 400. 300, 754. 300, 75, 400. 300, 754. Sold it right there. Nice clean lamps. A great clean offering. 300, 754 on the sandwich cut overlay star and quatrefoil lamp. 300, 75, 4 on you. 300, 75, 4 on you. 300, 75, 4. Fair warning. 300, 75, 4. 300, 75, 4. 100, 75, 4. Now, sold it right there. 184. Cut overlay quatrefoil. Punties and Panels Lamp, 20753. Thank you, Gwen and Michael, by the way, for the fabulous descriptions here. You can buy with confidence, folks. They're the best. 20753, 20753, 20753, and then 20753, 20753, fair warning, and 20753. Last chance and final call. Sold it right there. 185, moving along to the cut overlay sunflower vine and punties lamp. I have. 450, 475 on you. 
450-475, your turn. At 450-475, that's 450-475. Anybody else? 450, 475, 450 now 75 on you. Sold it right there. And then 186, we move along to more of the pit collection. This one, the cut overlay punties and floral spray, spray lamp. 225, 250. 250 is all I'm bid. 225, 5753 then. Nice clean lamps, by the way, as a part of this collection. Fresh to the market. 20753, 20753, 2550 then. 32550. Nice, nice overlays at 325, 350, fair warning, 2550. Last chance and final call at 325. Are you sure? 25 and 50, 25 half. Sold it right there. And then 187, it's the cut double overlay punty and vines lamp here, part of the pit collection. 225, 250 at 2550. 2550. Pardon me. 200 now 225 is better. At 200 225. We're at 250. Now we have it 2075. Now we have it 250 2075. Your turn. Are you sure this is a nice one? 2753 2753. What do you say at the 2753 2753? It's on you. 75300 2753. At 2753, you are out by the way. At 2075, you have to be 300. You're out. 2753, fair warning. At 2753, last chance and final call. 75, sold it. 188, cut overlay, punties and flower lamp. 1752, 1752, 1752 on this one. At 175, 200, 175, 200, 175, 200, 200. Now I have it 25. At 50, then now. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50. Is that all? 25, 50, 25, 50, 25. And then 250, last chance and final call. At only 225 and 250 on you. 225 and then 250, 25 and then half. Sold it right there. 189 cut flower overlay punty and flower stand oil lamp. 250 2075. 250 2075. You're winning. 250 2075. You're out. At 250 2075. And then 250 now 2075. Fair warning. At 250 75. Last chance and final call. Sold it. And 190. 190 is the sandwich Moorish. Windows cut overlay lamp at only 175, 200, only on this. I think we're wrong. Yes, 225. That's better. 250 at 2550. At 2550, 2550, 2550. Yes, took it. 75. You're out. 75. You have to be 75. You're out. 75. 250, 75. You're out. 300 now at 275, 3. Rare lamp. 200, 753, 200, 753, 200, 753. At 200, 753. At 200, 753, 25 and then 300 now 25. 300 now 25. What do you say? Have to run. 325. Fair warning. 300 now 325 and then 25. <laughs> Sold it right there. And then 191 Sandwich Glass Ruby Reed font lamp there. Now there's a beauty only found in old collections like the Pitt collection. Pitt with two T's. 307, 25, 50. At 25, 50. At 25, and then 50 on you. 25, 50. At 25, 50, rare lamp. Ruby Reed font. At 325 and 350. At 25 and 50. And yes, now 75. Took it. 75, 400, 75, 4. At 75, 400, 75, 4. What do you say? In or out? 300, 75, 4. A buy and a bargain. I had 375, 4. Fair warning then. Hammer is in the air. 75, 400, 75. Now 4. Sold it. Gone. 192. That is the reeded opalescent swirl lamp. 300, 75, 400 on this one. Rare lamp. 75, 4. Rare, rare bear. At 25, 50, 25, 50. Yes, took it. 75, 500. Old collections have lamps like this. 550, 650, 700. You have to be 750 now, please. You're out again. 750, 800 now. Don't lose this deal. At 758, 758. Took it. 850 now. 850, 900. Nice lamp. 950, nice lamp. 950. Put it in the window. You won't regret it. 900, 950. And 1,000. It dances. It sings. At 1,000, 1,100. Put it in the window. At 1,000, 1,100. It will sparkle like a 
prism at 1,100 fair warning, 1,100 last chance and final call at 1,100. <laughs> Sold it right there, gone. And then 193, the snowy owl. McJennett, what do you say on this here? I have 125, 150, 175, two. two. Yes, took it 25 on the phone. 50 now, please, John. Two, two is FCC. And then 5th, 25. Yep. yep, 50. 25 on the phone, 50, please. 75, 25 on the phone, 50, please. 75, John. Yep. Yes, 300. Fair warning, I have it on the phone. Yes, 50 then. 25 is on the phone. 350. 25, 50. Yes, 75, John. Yep. Yes, 400, please. Exactly. Fair warning. 300, 75 on the telephone. 400, last chance. And 25. Fair warning. 50, please. 25 and then 50, please. Online. Fair warning. Hammers in the air. 425, 450, 25 and a half. On the phone, that's gone. Congratulations. 7370. There you are. Perfect. Beautiful. 194 is what we're moving on to now. The next lot is another silver hake here by Stephen Outhouse. Stephen Outhouse, of course, a big supporter of Maud Lewis, who we'll be featuring later in this sale. Great maritime folk artist here. What do you say here on Jake the Hake? 175, 200. 175, 225 at 225, a nice one, 25, a nice one, 225 from a nice collection, 225, purchased directly from the artist, 225 at 225 is all, Stephen Outhouse, 225 and 225 is all at 25 and 25, 225 and 225, 225 and 225, hammers up, bids in, 225 and 200, now 25, Sold it there. And then 195, Yellowtail Flounder and Gull by Stephen Outhouse here. Another great maritime work at 1752, 1752, 1752. Take a close look to appreciate this at 175, 200, 175, 225, and then 225, 225, at 225, 50. Stephen Outhouse, 225, and then 250. There's an investment, 225, 250, and 25, 50, 25, 50 is all. At 50 now, 75, at 50 now, 75. Makes a statement, better in person to be honest, at 753, 753, 753. Fair warning, 753, 753, and 325 on this one. Stephen Outhouse, 25 at 25 and 25. 325 and 325. What do you say? 25 and 25. 25 and 25. At 25 and 25. 25 and 25. 50. At 25, 50. 25, 50. 25, 50. And it's on you at 50. Fair warning. 25 and a half. And 75. And 75. Make it quick. Got to run. 350. 75. Last chance and final call. 350 now. And 375. Sold it right there, gone. 196, Welcome Sight by Stephen Outhouse here. This one, a fabulous crisply carved relief carving by Outhouse himself at 30754. 75, 400, 75, 425, and then 425, 25, 50. Of course, these were what he was known for. 575, 575. Fabulous scene there. Brighton Digby County at 575, 575. Buy and a bargain, an investment grade piece at 450, 475. 450, 400, 75. What do you say? The iconic lighthouse. 475, 5. 475, 500, 550. Iconic piece, 556. Iconic artist, 556. At 556, 100, 556, 100, 600, 650. Crisply carved, 650, 600 now, 650 where, and 700 where, 657. Crisply carved, well done. At 700, 750, and now 758. I like it too, 758. What do you say at 758? You get lost in this, 758, 150 now, 850. Don't lose this deal now, 850, and 859. Don't lose this deal, 850, 900 on you, 900, 950 now, at 900, nine and a half. What do you say, 950, and 900, nine and a half. Hammers in the air then, 900, 950, gotta run. 
at 951, 951, 951, 1,000. Yes, of course. Now 1,100, please. 1,100, crisply carved. The longer you look at 1,000, 1,100. Yes, now 1,200, the iconic image of the iconic artist. 11, 12, 1,300. At 1,300, worth every single drop of the 12 asking 1,300 that I'm bid at 1,200, 1,300, 12, 1,300, 12, 1,300. Fair warning, hammers up, bids in, and 1,400 now. At 14, don't lose this deal. You fought too hard. 13, 14, now 1,500. Don't lose this fight. At 14, 1,500. At 14, 1,500. It's a great one. 1,415. Fair warning, my hammer's in the air. At 1,400, 1,500. Last chance and final call. Are you sure? 1,400, you're thinking 15, 14, and 1,500, you're done. Thank you. 197, 197, Moody House. This was commissioned by the consigner. What do you say? Stephen Outhouse, a great example of his relief carving here. This one of the famous Moody House in Nova Scotia, Sable River. An unusual piece, a unique piece. I'm at 325, 357, 5. These are the images of our country, folks. These are the images of Nova Scotia. 425, 425. These are the images that represent Nova Scotia, 425. This is rare, 425. It's a one-off, 425, and then 425. Commissioned by the person selling it, by to Stephen Outhouse, 450, 475. 450, 475, 450, 475. Is that all, really? 450, 475, got to run at 450, 75. Are you sure? A buy and a bargain for sure at 75, 500. Stephen Outhouse, 75, 500. Stephen Outhouse, 75, 500. 75, 550 now. 500 where? 550 now. 500 and five and a half and then five, 550. 500, 550. 500, five and a half. Is that all? 550, 600. Worth the money, 556. 556, fair warning, 556, 556, 100 at five and a half, six, took it, 650 now. Don't lose the deal, 600, 650, 600, 650, took it, 700, thank you, Jen, 657, 657, 657, 650, 700, 657, fair warning, at 657, took it, 750 now, 750 now. 750 now at 700, 750, 700, 750, fair warning, 700, 750, last chance and final call, are you sure? 700 now, 750 where? Seven, seven and a half, <laughs> sold it right there. Thank you very much and Jen, thank you. Jen is the brains behind our shipping department. Pleasure to have you on board, Jen. 198 is Six Gulls by Joe Norris. Now we're getting into some of the meat and potatoes of the sale for sure. These iconic maritime artists are what makes Nova Scotia such a special place to celebrate. And here we are with Six Gulls by Joe Norris here in, done in fabulous living color. For sure, a great piece and certainly a well done piece along the lines of Maude Lewis and others. I have 3,000, I have 3,500, 3,750. It's not a good one, it's a great one. There's some great ones today for you here, folks, and they're served up on a silver platter. 4,500, 4,750, and 5,500, 6,000, coming from some of the most prestigious collections in our country. 5,500 in the hand and 6,000, 55, 6. Yes, it's a fabulous piece, and it is indeed a great investment as well at 5,500, 6,000, unlocked by some of the finest collections in our country. This one, totally, totally signed, Joe Norris, 5,500 and 6,000. There's something about the image. Take a look at the six gulls and tell me if you are not in love. 5,500, 6,000, truly, the way he executed those gulls, it's truly artistic at 55, 6. At 5,500, 6,000, 5,500, 6,000, one of those images, the longer you look, the more you appreciate what he's executed here. It's a great work from a great collection, 
and it's available at 5,500, 6,000. Perhaps you're still thinking 5,750, gents, and, and Jen, 5,500, 6, 5,500, 750, please. That's 5,750. If you're thinking, I'll give you one chance. At 5,750, are you on the fence? It just went down. 5,500, 5,750, fair warning, at 5,500. 5750 last chance and final call 5500 5750 took it now 6000 now you're out 5756 6250 what do you say 6000 6250 i have two individuals that are in love with the six gulls if there were five we might not be talking about it there's six 6000 6250 there's something about the, the scene he's created here, faced in opposing directions, almost as if to make some form of statement here at 6,062.50, 6, at 6,062.50, my hammer's in the air. Thank you, by the way, for your participation. You're out at 6,062.50, fair warning. 6,062.50, last chance and final call. 6,000 here and 62.50 where? Sold it at 6,000, 199, 199. Deer at the Saltwater Pond by Joe Norris here. This, of course, in the decorated frame, fully decorated with the flowers by Norris himself. There's always something about the Norris works that are in the Norris frames that are hand decorated, certainly bringing the beauty to a three-dimensional level here. I have 2750 on the board and 3000 is the ask and I have 3000 and now 3250 on this rare Joe Norris work. 32 and a half, 3500. 32 and a half, 3500. I have 3250, thank you very much, and 3500 is the ask. Decorated frame makes this piece at 3500, 3750, 4000. 4000. 3754, the famed maritime. 4000, thank you. 4250. It's Joe Norris. 4250, 4500, 4250, 45, 45, 4750. Have to love the decorated frame at 4755 4755 worth every nickel at that and then 55 worth every single nickel these works are rare deer at salt water pond and wow 556 has he done it well what a use of color 606500 what grand execution of color 606500 6,600, you have to love how this piece of art is packaged. 6,600, 6,600, it's those deer grazing at salt water, 7,700, could it be more Nova Scotia? 7,700, this was his tribute to the beauty of the province. 7,700, his salute done in bold color, a rare example of a Joe Norris work, 7,700 at 7,700 at 7,000 now, 7,500, are we in and done? Thank you, by the way, at 7,700, are we all in and finished? I have my hammer in the air, thank you very much, take one final look. Yes, 75, 8,000. You'd, you'd be hard pressed to find another Norris with this impact. 8,800, I have 8,085. With this level of impact, 8,800, I'm bid. Are you finished? Are you sure? Are you done? I have 8,000, thank you very much. And 8,500, fair warning, last chance and final call. Hammers in the air at 8,000. 8,500, 8,000, now 85 on you, 8,000, 85. Sold it right there, that's eight, gone. Thank you very much. This was the showcase of maritime folk art and we have another Joe Norris to follow this up. This one, the schooner taking shelter from the storm. It's a Joe Norris piece. Again, unlocked from the finest of collections, the finest of collections across this country and take a look at what this piece represents a schooner taking shelter from the storm it's the nova scotia master joe norris at 
his best. Take a look, please, at the size, at the size of this particular work. In fact, you can see it on video. This is, this is the finest of the Joe Norris, the master of maritime folk art. These pieces are only available in the exclusive collections, privately held collections. This one, of course, recently unlocked at five thousand and fifty five hundred. Five thousand fifty five hundred five thousand fifty five hundred. Take a look at the lighthouse and the birds in flight in the background and the breaching killer whales and gulls. Fifty five hundred six thousand. Does it get any nor more Nova Scotia than this? Six thousand. Thank you. And sixty five hundred. It's what I would consider to be and as Phil Ross mentioned as well, a masterpiece. 6,500, 7,000, easily considered a masterpiece of Joe Norris. That's why we saved it for the last. 7,000, 7,500. That's why we saved it for the end. 7,000, 7,500. Nova Scotia master Joe Norris. 7,000, 7,500. What, 8,000, what a tribute, by the way, to this wonderful country of ours. 7,500, 8,000, Lower Prospect, Nova Scotia, a masterpiece by Joe Norris. I have 7,500, 8,000. These pieces never come up, never come up. This, the jewel of the collection, 8,000, 8,500. This, the absolute apple in the eye of the collector, 859. This is not a piece you sell. This is a piece you hold for life. 8,500, 9,000. A masterpiece by Joe Norris. 85 here and 9,000. Not just another piece, it's a masterpiece by master artist. Joe Norris, Lower Prospect, Nova Scotia. 8,500 and 9,000 worth every single nickel at 85, 9. At 85, 9,000, you might well have the master work of Joe Norris. And I have my hammer in the air at 85, 9. I think you should take another look at those gulls and the two masted schooner taking shelter and take a look at what this master tried to execute here and did with brilliance. 85.9. Fair warning then. 8,500, 9,000. Thank you very much. At 85, 9,000, are you ready to let go? 85.9. 85, 9,000, 85, 9. Last chance and final call at 8,500, 9,000, 8,500, 9,000, 8,500 now, 9 on you. Sold it right there. And we move to 201. Finally, 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 we move along to the lighthouse and the three schooners by Joe Norris. Folks, we have a, an all star lineup here today, an all star lineup of maritime art. And for sure, we saved the best for last here, the final Joe Norris work offered today. It just so happened we've been working with collectors that have saved these for years. Take a look at the oversized gulls. Take a look at the lobster boats and the fishermen. Take a look at the brilliance of this particular piece, this masterwork by Joe Norris. Folks, they just don't turn up. 7,000, I took at 7,500 now. Took at 8,000 8, now. 75,800. I have your 7,500, 8,000. This is the best. Make no mistake, collectors of Norris will recognize instantly just how scarce these oversized pieces are. This is a masterpiece, 7,500, 8,000. 75, 8. 7,500, 8. I took it, 8,500. Do you want the best? 75, 85. 8,000, 85. Took it, 9,000. If you want the best, Joe Norris, just bid. 8,500, 9,000. There's nothing to think about. If you want the best, 85, 9, 8,500, 9,000. If you want the best, it's right on front of your eyes. 9,000, 9,500. If you want the finest, it's right there for you. 95, 10,000 for the taking. 
for the taking. It's the Joe Norris of Joe Norris's The Lighthouse and Three Schooners. It's, I would go as far as to say, breathtaking. 9,500, 10,000, if there was ever a piece to justify bidding to oblivion, 10,000, 11. It's this piece. It's this Joe Norris. At 10,000, 11,000, please. At 10,000, 11, if there was ever one to justify, it is this. 10,000, 11,000, coming from Linda and Lawrence Lang, quiet collectors who sought out nothing but the best. 10,000, 11,000, 10,000, 11,000, fair warning. At 11,000, 12,000 now. 11,000, 12,000. You can never, you can never miss buying the best. This, folks, is the best. 11,000, 12,000. It is the apex of Joe Norris. Everything else looks inferior when you see this Joe Norris. 12,000, 13,000. Everything else is a letdown. 12,000, 13,000. If you ever own just one, make it this one. 13,000, 14,000. Make it this grand work. 13,000, 14,000. You're buying the best, buy the best. 13,000, 14,000. Look at the color and look at the size. Need I say more? 14,000, 15,000. 14 and 15,000. It is difficult to communicate the importance of Canadian folk art. And up there on the apex is Joe Norris at 14,015. At 14,015. At 14,000, now 15,000. Up there on the mountain of greatness with Maude Lewis is Joe Norris. And here is one of, if not the masterwork at 14,000. 15,000. Are we done? Are we finished? Are we all in? Are we set? 14,000, 15,000, yes, he says it, a surprise bid on the telephone with John Finley at 15,000. 16,000, 15, 16. At 15,000, 16,000, John, that might have done it. I have you in at 15 on the telephone, 16,000, oh yes, 17 now. Yep. Yes, and 18,000, please. I have 17 with John on the phone. 18,000 online? <laughs> 17 on the telephone. 18, they're thinking, for this masterpiece by Joe Norris. I have 17 on the telephone. 18,000. Might have done it. What are they thinking? 17,000, 18,000. 17,000, 18,000. Thank you, 19,000. 19,000, took it, 20,000. 19, 20,000. At 19,000 on the telephone, 20,000, please. 19,000, 20,000. At a certain point, it's just about doing the right thing. At a certain point, it's just about duty. The recognition of importance is what we're talking about here. Everything else, forget it. 19,000 and 20,000, 19 and 20. I have 19 on the telephone. John, your bidder's in. 20,000, 19, 20,000. I have the 19,000. 20,000, are you sure? Does that do it? Is that it? 19,000, 20,000 on the Joe Norris masterpiece. My hammer is now in the air. I appreciate the participation. I also appreciate the recognition of great Canadian art and your recognition of that at 19, 20,000 going once. 19,000, 20,000 going twice. A third and final time at 19,000. 20,000, sold it right there. John Finley on the telephone, thank you. Well done, how exciting. Thank you, Ethan.
19,000 sold. Moving along, lot number 202. It's the Brown Duck by Charlie Tanner, and we're at 175 only from Nova Scotia here. Now 200 at 175, and then two. Got a bit 175 here. Now 200. Thank you. Then 225. And I got the bit 200, then 225, and 250. 225, and then two and a half. Right back to you. At 225, and then 250. Got 225, two and a half, and then 275. At 250, then 275. I got 250 here, then 275 on the Brown Duck decoy. At 250, then 275, 300. At 275, and then three. Got a bit 300, then 325. At 325, and then 350. 325, and then 350, 375. At 350, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75 on the Charlie Tanner. At 375, and 400. At 375, thank you, four, then 425. I've got a bit four here, then 425. At 425, I'd go for 450. At 450, 475. 450's bid, then 475, then right back to you at 475 and 500. 500, then 550. 500, then five and a half. Five and a half, thank you, 600. Five and a half here, yes, now 600. I'm at 550, then six, gotta go. At 550, then six, last chance. At 550, 600, fair warning, thank you, got it. Yes, now six and a half, you gotta be quick. At 600, then six and a half, thank you, 700. 650, then 700. 650, 700, any further bids? Last chance and final call at 650, 700 on the brown duck sold it at 650 well done lot 203 is up next it's the standing beaver or sorry the standing black bear by bradford nogler and we're currently at 225 this one's from Nunenberg county in nova scotia 225 asking 250 thank you now 75 at two and a half and then 275 i got the bit 250 the 275 at 250 then 275 i got a bit 250 here then 275 a bit 250 then 275 are we all done at 250 275 and fair warning all through thank you 275 took it now 300 275 and 300 gotta be quick at 275 on the standing black bear 275 300 then 325 at 300 bid 325 i got 300 here now 325 anybody else at 300 325 last chance and final call at 300 325 fair warning sold it at 300 moving along 204 is up next it's the jackrabbit by ewald rents sort of a humor in all of his works this one at 400 425 at 400 then 425 i got a bit 400 here then 425 and 400 then 425 and a bit 400 then 425 at 425 i'm asking 425 i got 400 here now 425 thank you 450 425 and then four and a half at a bit 400 then 25 then 450 i'm at 425 and then four and a half but are we all done at just 425 now 450 fair warning last chance final call at 425 450 all done sold at 425 moving along to lot 205 here's a fun one the bucktooth rabbit by ewald rents 275 300 275 and now three thank you 325 and then 50 at 325, now 350. 325 and then three and a half. I got the bit 325 here. You gotta be 350 if you'd like it. At 325 and then three and a half on the Bucktooth Rabbit. 375, 400. 375 and 400. At 375 and then four, gotta be 375 and then 400. Love this one. 375, 400, then 425, 450. 425 and 450. 450, 475 and then 500. 475 and then five, you got 500. I'm at 475 and then five. And 500 and 550. That's the left bid. You got to be 550. I'm at 500 then five and a half. At 500 then five and a half, if you'd like it. At five and a half, thank you. 600 at 550. Now six. Got the bid 550 here. And then six at a bid 550. Then six at a bid 550. Then 600. Are we all done? At 550, 600. Fair warning all through. Hammers up on the Bucktooth Rabbit by Ewald Rents sold at 550 moving along to lot number 206 it's the mouse with cheese by ewald rents an amusing proudly striding mouse 300 325 a great subject for rents 300 325 300 is bid yes now 325 i've got the bid 300 here now 325 if you'd like it at 300 then 325 thank you 350 back to you at 325 and then three and a half 325 three and a half 350 375 350 is bid now 75 at 50 75 and 50 75 i'm at 375 now 400 400 then 425 and i get the bid 400 then 425 on the mouse with cheese at 425 now 450 425 four and a half and 475 450 is bid sir 450 okay yes 75 
75 and 500, 475 and 500, at 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 500, at 475 and then 5, are we all done? At 475 and then 5, one more chance if you'd like it, 475 and 500 on the mouse with cheese, all through and done. Sold it there, 475, nice buy. Moving along, lot 207, The Standing Bird by Ewald Rents. Currently advanced to 225 in the pre bidding, asking 250. 225 on The Standing Bird, like this one too. Now 250, thank you, 75 and 300. At 275 and 300. 275 and then 3, got it at 275 and then 3, 275 and 300. At 275 and then 3, got it, yes, 325, 350. 325 and 3 and a half. I'm at 325 and then 350, got 325 and then 3 and a half. At 325 and then 350, 50, 50, 50, 325 and 3 and a half, thank you, 375. At 350, 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75 and 350, then 75. I'm at 350 here, now 375. And I've got to run at 350, now 75 and 50, 75 and 400. 375 and then 400. 375 and then 4, would you like it? At 375 and then 4, got to be 375 here, then 400. 375 and then 4 on the standing bird, now 425, back to you. At 400, then 425, I got to be 4. 400 than 425 and 400 than 425 and a bit 400 here than 425 anybody else last chance fair warning 400 now 425 sold it right there 400 lot 208 gotta love this one the look on its face the snowy owl by ewald rents 375 is bid yes sir you're in now 400 375 and a four. And 375 and then four. Got to be 375 and then 400. At 375 and then four. To 375 and then 400. Go 425 and then 450. 425 and then four and a half. At 425 and then 450. 50, 50, 425 and then four and a half. At 475 and 500. I'm at 475 and then five and 475 and then five and 475 and then 500. Go 550. 500 then 550. 500 then five and a half. I've been 500 here. Then 550. Anybody else? At 500 then 550. Get 500 then five and a half. I've been 500 then five and a half. At 500, 550. Thank you. 600. 500 550's bid now, six, I got 550 here, and then six and a half, and a bit anybody else, and a bit 500, then 550, 600, 550, then 600, anybody else, fair warning. Last chance, final call on the Snowy Owl by Ewald Rents at 550, 600, all, any further bidding? Sold it at 550, sold it at 550, well done. Moving along, lot 209, the Black Bear and Cub by Ewald Rents. Some great rents carvings in Today's sale, 225. This is 209, asking 250 on the sta or the black bear with the cub, and 250, 275. At 250, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 250, then 275. I've got the bid 275 now. 300, 275, 3, got it. Yes, 325 now. 300, then 325, it's back to you. At 300, 325, if you'd like it, 300, 325, at 300, then 325 on the Ewald rents go 350. 325, and the three and a half, and 75. 350, then 75, and 75, and 75, and 350 go 75. You got to be 75 if you'd like it at 350 here now 75 at a bit 350 375 at 350 then 375 and 75 and 75 and 350 go 75 you have it 350's bid here yes now 75 now 75 on the fabulous black bear and cub 400 okay then 425 400 is bid now 425 a baby cub and her mama at 25 and 450 425 and 450 450 now 75. I've got a bit four and a half and then 475. I got a bit 450 then 475. At 450 then 475. I got a bit 450 then 475 and 500. Now 500. Just 500 now. We're at 475 asking 500. Go 550. 500 then five and a half now. At 500 then five and a half. At a bit 500 then 550. 50, 50, 50, 500 then five and a half. I'm at 500 then five and a half on the Black Bear and Cub. Yes, 550, 600. 550 then 600 now. At 600, go six and a half. At 600, then six and a half. At 600, then six and a half. Ewald rents everybody. At 600, then six and a half. A nice one. At 600, go 650 all through and done. At 600, six and a half. Fair warning. Last chance. Final call at 600, six and a half on 209. Sold it at 600. Sold it at 600. Moving along to lot number 210. It's the painted woodpeckers on a branch. 225 is bid in the advance, asking 250 now. 
at 225 and 250. 225 and two and a half of the telephone, thank you, Candace. Now 275, the bid's on the phone. At 250, then 275, we go 300 right back to you. At 275 and the three, would you like it? Okay, yes, now 325. At 300, bid 325, the bid's on the phone. 325 and 350 right back to you. At 325 and 350, 50, 50, 50, 25 and three and a half. At 325 and 350, 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 75. At 350, then 75 and 50, 75 and 50, 75. Yep. The bid's on the phone, thank you, 75 with LA. Now 400 at 375 and then four. I'm a bit 375 and go 400 now. 375, 400 where? Yes, thank you. Now 425, the bid's on the phone. Oh, sorry, missed you there. We got 400 on the computer. You've got to be now 425 if you'd like to get in there. They just squeaked in right beneath you at 400 here. Now 425, we've got two active bidders. Okay, yes, now 450. Now the bid's on the phone asking 450. Bid 425 on the phone. We've got it right. Now 450 asking 450. 425 and then four and a half. Thank you, 475. Now you're out again. At four, you have it? Thank you. Now 475, 500, 475 and then five. Back to you, m and The bid's on the phone at 475 and then five on the painted wood packers at 475 and then 500 on the telephone. Are we all done there? 500, 550. 500, five and a half. 500, five and a half, thank you, 600. Five and a half and then 600. Five and a half on the telephone and now six, but we gotta run. At five and a half and then six, it's gonna be five and a half and then 600. Five and a half and then six, it's gonna be five and a half and then six, it's gonna be five and a half and then 600. Last chance at 550, 600. Fair warning all through and done. Fair warning. Sold it right there to the telephone bidder. Well done, moving along. Lot number 211 is coming up next. Just sold the painted woodpeckers for 550. Moving right along to lot number 211. Just getting that bidder number and moving right along to 211. The birds on a branch, another Ewald rents here, a fabulous one. This one at 650. What a great look. Look at that branch. 700, then seven and a half. 750, 800, 8 and a half, 900, 850, 900, birds on a branch. Got his inspiration from these natural forms he found in different branches and pieces of wood. A great example of his work. 950 and 1,000. A fabulous rents. 950 then 1,000. At 950 and 1,000. And I got the bid 950. It's all online right now. At 950 then 1,000. At 950 then one. At a bid 950 then one. A very well executed work by Ewald Rents. Kind of has all the features that you would expect in one of his works. At 950, now 1,000. Got a bid 950 then one. At a bid 950 then one. At a bid 950 then 1,000. I'm at 950 here. 1,000 now 1,100. Thank you. Then 12. And 11 then 12. At a bid 11 then 12. He's right there. At 11 then 12. At a bid 11 then 12. 1100, you're in, sir. Yes. 1200. I'm at 1100 with you. Now 1200. And a bit 11 here with 12 on the fabulous Birds on a Branch by Ewald Rents. 1100, 1200, 13, 1400. Right back to you. 13, 1400. Yes, you're in. At 13, 1400. I'm at 13 and then 14. It'd have been 13, then 1400. I've got 13 right here and asking 1400 on the Birds on a Branch. 13 and then 1400. Hat got 13 here and then 14, it's signed underneath. No questions on this one. 13 and 14, just a fabulous, fabulous work by Ewald Rents at 1300 asking 14. Consider it one more time. We've got to move along at 13 and 1400. We will sell it today. We're at 13, 14, thank you, 1500. Right back to you, 14 and 1500. At 14 and then 1500, shouldn't be much to think about. At 14 and then 15, you've come this far for a great, Great piece. If there's one to buy today, this is hands down the rents to own. 15, now 1600. 15, then 1600. At the 15 here, and then 16, at a bit 15, 1600. I've got 15, yes, now 1600, please. 15, then 16. The bid's at 15 here, asking 1600 on the Ewald rents. Birds on a branch, thank you, yes, now 17, and right back to you. At 16, now 17, it'd have been 16, then 1700, but we've got to run. I'm at 16, then 17, they got a bid 16, then 1700. Are we all done? On the fabulous Ewald rents, 17, now 1800. I'm at 17, and then 18, it'd have been 17, and then 18, but we've got to run. I'm at 17, and then 18, got a bid 17, and then 1800. Last chance and final call at 17, and now 1800. Fair warning, any further bids? Sold it right there, 1700, well done. 
great piece, nice buy. Two twelves up next, a cast iron piece, nice color on this one. It's the girl with a beanie. It's a doorstop, 150, 175. I've got the bid here, 150, thank you, 175, and a bid 175 and 200. Bids with LA at 200, got it here, now 225, you're out. At 200, then 225, I gotta be 225, I'd be 200 here, then 225. Mm -hmm. I'm at 225, at the 250, go 275, right back to you. At 250, then 275, and 250, go 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 250, go 75. At 250, then 75, and 250, then 75, and 300, got it here, now 325. The bids with M&M at 300, you're out. At 325, you've got to be. At 300, then 325, last chance. 300, 325, fair warning. Thank you, 325, 350. At 325 with LA, now 350, last chance. Fair warning, any further bids? 325 and 350. Sold it right there, 325. Moving right along to lot number 213. Lot number 213, the cast iron wood duck lawn sprinkler. Hands down the nicest looking lawn sprinkler I've ever seen. A beautiful figural piece here, the original surface here, circa 1920, cast iron and brass, currently advanced to 425, now 450. 425 yep. and 450, thank you, 475. At 450, then 475, the bid's on the telephone, thank you. Yes, 450, now 475, and 475 and 500. 475 and then 500. 475, 500, then 550, the bid's on the phone. Yep. 550, 600, right back to you. 550, now 600. I'm at five and a half, and then six, and a bid five and a half, and then six, and the telephone's out. At five and a half, and then six, again, a bid 550, then 600. At 550, six, we're all done. Last chance, fair warning, any further bids? Sold it right there, 550. Sold it at 550 LA Way. Moving along, lot number 214. It's the yellow whirligig man from southwestern Ontario. There's a fun one. 150 only, asking 175. And I got the bid one and a half, and now 175. Thank you, 200. 175 of the two. Got a bid 175 at the 200. Ready to display on a stand at 175 and 200. Got a bid 175 at the two. Are we all done? At just 175, 200. Fair warning. Last chance, and then final call at 175, 200. Sold it there, 175, well done. Moving along, lot number 215. It's the Great Western Railway, that's GWR, Lord Robert train model from 1945. Just 100, great piece here for that money. Now 125. At 100, then 125, I got the bid 100 here, then 125. And I got the bid 100, then 125, and 100 here, then 125. Are we all done? At just 100, now 125, fair warning. 100, 125, hammers up. Last chance, final call. Thank you, 125, 150, just under the gun. At 125, and now 150. Sold right there. Great strategy, nice buy. Moving on, lot number 216. It's the Child's Painted Snow Slider. It's a load of fun right here. Nice colors on it too. Nice to look at. 125, 150, 125, and then one and a half. At 125, and then 150 on the Child's Snow Slider. 125, and then 150, thank you. 175 and 200. 175 and 200, you're out. At 175 and then two, got a bit 175 here, then 200, anybody else? At just 175 and then two, are we all done? Last chance and fair warning. 175 and 200, last call. Sold it right there, 175. Lot number 217, it's a painted child's wagon, circa 1870. You see on this one, one and a half, now 175. Nice wagon, 150, 175. And 150 here, then 175, it'd be 150, then 175. The Red paint with the black trim, great look there. 150, 175. I've got the bid 150, 175, and then 150 here, and then 175. At 150, 175, and then 175, and then 175. Are we all done? Last chance, fair warning. At 150, 175, all through. Sold it right there at 150. Moving along, lot number 218, the Jeu de Course horse racing game. It's a gambling game, a trade stimulator, so to speak, by MJ and C. What do you say here? 
Currently advanced to 300. It's got a great look, I might add. At 300, then 325. At 300 on this horse betting game. 300, then 325. I get up at 325, and then 350. 325, and then three and a half. I get up at 325, and then 350, 50, 50, 325, and then three and a half. I'm at 325, and then 350. Go 350, 325, and then three and a half. Are we all done? At 325, and then 350. Last chance. Fair warning on the horse racing trade stimulator gambling game. Sold it right there, 325. Sold it at 325. Moving along, lot number 219, the folding painted yeah. games board. Nice surface here on this Canadian Pine Beauty at 150, 175. I got the bid 150 here, then 175, the bid 150, then 175. And I got the bid 150, then 175, then 175, then 175, 200. Yes, now 225. At 200, then 225, you got 225. And I got 200, then 225. I'd have 200 here, then 225. I'd have 200, then 225. Do you like it? At 250, thank you, 75. 250, then 275. I'd have 250, then 275. And then 275, I'd have 250 here, 275. Anybody else? Fair warning, 250, 275. Last chance. Final call at just 250, now 275 on the folding games board. Sold at 250, sold it at 250, lot number 220. It's the painted spinning wheel carnival game. And again, a great folky look to this at 425. Great colors asking 450, 425, and then four and a half. Ah, I got the bid 425 and then 450, go 450, 425 and then four and a half. At 425 and go 450 on the painted spinning wheel carnival game. 425 and 450. Last chance, final call, all through and done. Sold it right there, 425. Moving right along to lot number 221, it's the Carved Perched Owl. What do you say on this one? It's 225, now 250, thank you, 75 and 300. 275 and then three, you gotta be 275 and then 300. 275 is the bid and then three, you gotta be 275 and 300 now. 275 and then 300, gotta be 275 and then three. 275 and then three, got a bit 275 and then three, got a bit 275 and then 300. Are we all done? At 275 and then three, fair warning. Last chance, final call, 275 and 300. Sold it right there at 275. Moving along to lot number 222, moving into some of the great canes. This one actually a riding crop, but it's got the carved whippet handle. It's either English or American, but a great form nonetheless. At 50, just 50, 75, yes, now 100. At 75 and then 100. At 75 and then 1, at a bit 75 and then 1, at a bit 75 and then 100. At 75 and then 1, got a bit 75 here, then 100. Anybody else? At 75 here, then 100 where? Thank you, yes, now 125. Got a bit 100 here, then 125. Got a bit 1 and then 125. And 100 is bidden, then 125. I got 1, then 125. 100 is bidden, then 125. Are we all done? Thank you, 125, 150. 125, 150 on the whippet handled riding crop. 125 and then 150, last chance. Fair warning, 125, one and a half and then 75. One and a half and then 75, it'd have been one and a half here, then 75 where? At one and a half and then 75, it'd have been 175. Anybody else? I'm at 150 now, 175 and fair warning. Sold it at 150, lot 223. Here's a cool one. 1903, it's the Hamilton Summer Hamilton Summer Carnival, Kane, 1903, at 225, now 250, thank you, now 75. A rare cane, to say the least. 300, 325, thank you, 300, asking 325. I'm at 300, now 325, I got the bit of the year with m and I'm at 300, 325, and then 350. 350, 375. 350 is bid, now 375, I'm at 350, then 375, and then 375, then 350, then 375. Great look to that, sort of a, a sickle look. 350, now 375, I'm at 350, then 375. At 350, then 375, I got the bit here, 350, then 375. Are we all done? From the Hamilton Summer Carnival, 350, now 375, and it's dated too. Are we all done? Fair warning, at just 350, 75, last chance, last call. Sold at 350, well done. Moving right along to lot number 224, we've got the carved walking sticks. You're buying a pair, fully carved, 125 and then 150. 125 and then one and a half. 
Hi, we got the bid 125 and then 150. Thank you. Then 175. Right back to you. At 150, then 175. Lots of room on these ones. At 175 and 200. Make no mistakes here. 175 and then two. Thank you. 225. A great pair. One. Uh, sorry, 200, then 225. I've got 200 here, then 225. Go 250, 225, and then two and a half. At 225, and then 250, go 250, 225, and then two and a half. I'm at 225, and then 250. Anybody else? At just 225 and 250, a bargain here. You're talking about the price of one of these. 225, and then 250. At 225, and you're getting both. Now 250, last chance. Fair warning, 250, 275, right back to you. At 250, then 275, I'd have been 250 here, then 275, and 250, go 75. I'm at 250, then 275, I'd have been 250 here, then 275. Fair warning, last chance, final call, 250, 275. I'll take it, yes, now 300, but you've got to be quick now. At 275 and 3, 275 and 3, all through and done. Sold it right there, 275, well done. Lot 225's up next. Another pair of carved and painted walking sticks. Currently at 200, asking 225. Now 250, 225, and then two and a half. At 225 and then two and a half, these ones painted as well as carved. 225 and then 250, thank you, 275. At 250, then 75, and 250, go 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75. I'm at 250, now 275 and 300. 275 and 300. At just 275 and then three, get up at 275 and then 300. At 275 and then three, get up at 275, 300, go 325. At 300, then 325, I got a bit here, then 300, 325, go 350. 325 and then three and a half, at a bit three. 25 and then 350, 50, 50, 300, the 25 and the 350. Anybody else? At 325 and then 350, fair warning. Last chance, 325, 350. Any further bids? Sold them right there at 325. Well done. Lot 226. You're buying three. These are marquetry inlaid walking sticks. 225, 250, yes, now 275, and you're buying all three. 250 and 275. Got a bit 250 here, then 275, and a bit 250, then 275. On the trio, at 250, then 275. An instant collection. 250, then 275, and a bit 250. Go 275, and then 275, and then 275. I'm at 250, then 275. I go 275, and a bit 250 here, then 275. Yes, now 300. What a deal here. What a bargain. 300, then 325. I'm at 300, now 325. I got the bid yep. here. 325 and 350. 325 and 350. 50, 50, 50, 325 and the three and a half. Now 375. Three and a half and now 375. At 350, 375 and 350, 375 and 350, 375. All through, all done. Sold them right there at 350. Moving along, lot number 227. It's the seated lion by Gilbert Desrochers, and we're sitting at 225 only. This is from Perkinsfield, Ontario. 225, 250. 225 and then two and a half. I have 225, asking two and a half if you'd like it. Now 225, 250, yes, now 275. 250, then 75, and 50 here, 75 where? At 250, go 75, and a bit 250, then 75, and a bit 250, then 75, and a bit 250, then 75 on the seated lion. 75 and 300. At 75, and then three, got 275, and now 300, anybody else? At 275, and then three with the glass eyes and the white fangs. What a cool look. What a cool, folky look on this lion. At 275 and 300, are we all done? 275, 300, fair warning. Last chance and final call at 275, now 300. Sold them there, 275, well done. Lot number 228. It's Phaeton, as Gordon Law titled it, his carving here from Oshawa, Ontario. It's called Phaeton, and we're at 175, now 200. At 175 and then two, get a bit 175 and then 200. 175 and then two, get a bit 175. A horse-drawn chariot, more a Phaeton, I believe, has four wheels. Uh, this is a chariot, but that's what he titled it. That's fine. That's the name of the the name of the work. We're at 175 and now four, or sorry, 200. 175 and then two. Got a bit 175 and then 200. I'm at 175 and then two. Got a bit 175 and then two. But are we all done? Last chance and fair warning. At thank you. Yes, 225. Okay, then 250. At 225, you're out. You've got to be 250. We've got 7312 in. If you'd like to bid again, 7267, you may. At 2 
25, now 250 all through and done. Fair warning, last chance and final call. Care to try it one more time? Sold it at 225, well done. Moving along, lot number 229. It's the Inuit Seal Hunter by Jean-Claude Lebrec. And we're at 75, asking 100 from Beauce, Quebec. 100, yes, now 125, got it, then 150. 125, and then one and a half. It'd have been 125, and go 150, 50, 50, 125, and then one and a half. Thank you, 175, right back to you. At 150, 75, and 200. 175, and 200, get 175, and the two, get a bit 175, and the two. Anybody else? At just 175, 200, then 225, of course, on this great, descriptive, unusual carving, 200, 225. At 200, then 225. I get the bit 200 here, then 225. And I get the bit 200, then 225. At a bit 200, then 225. I get 200 here, then 225. And 250. 225, and then two and a half. 225, and then 250. Go 50, go 225, and then 250. All through and done. Fair warning. Last chance. Final call at 225, 250. Sold it there. 225, well done. 230 is up next. The Working Cobbler by Amy. De Mule, and we're at 425, now 450, from St. Paul de la Croix, Quebec, 475 and 500. 475 is bid, now 500, please. I'm at 475 and then 5, get a bit 475 here and then 500 where? At 475 and then 5 and 475 and then 5 and 475, you got it? 475 and then 5 and 475, thank you, 5 and then 550, 5 and then 550, at 550, 600, 550, 600, at 5 and a half and then 6, I got a bit 550, 600, then 6 and a half, and then right back there, at 600, then 6 and a half, I got a bit 600, then 650, now 700, 650, 700 and 750, 700, then 7 and a half, at 7 and a half and then 800, right back to you. At 750, go eight, at a bit 800, then eight and a half. Eight and a half and 900 now on the working cobbler, the seated working cobbler, 950, then 1,000, thank you, 1,100. 1,000, then 1,100. And 1,000, at a bit 11, at a bit 1,000, then 11, at a bit 1,000, then 11 on the fabulous carving by Amy Demule. At 1,000, now 1,100. We got there very quickly. I'll give you a short second to think here, but we've got to move along at just 1,000, now 1,100. Care to try it one more time. Hammers up at 1,000. Thank you, 1,100, then 1,200. Right back to you. 11, then 12, at a bit 11 here, then 12, at a bit 11, then 12, at a bit 11 here, then 1,200 where? Thank you, 13. Right back to you at 1,200, 13. I got 12 and then 13, at a bit 12 and then 13, at a bit 12 and then 13 at 704. Sorry, 7408, you're out at 1213. Last chance, 1213. Final call, all through and done. 1213 on the working cobbler by Amy de Mule. Sold it at 1200. Well done. <coughs> Excuse me, moving along to lot number 231. It's the fiddling cat by Andrew Melanson at 200, now 225. I'm bid 200, then 225. I got to bid 225, and then 250. 225 and the two and a half, and 250, 275, and 250, 275, and 275, and 300 now. 275 and 300 go 325. I'm at 300, then 325. I got 300 here, then 325. Where? At 300, then 325. I'd have been anyone else. I'd have been 320 here, then 325. Thank you. 350 asking. I'm at 325. I'm asking 350. 325 and then three and a half on this Nova Scotia fiddling cat by Andrew Melanson at 325, 350. 325 and now three and a half, yes, now 375. 350 then 75 and 50 go 75 and 50 go 75 and 50 then 75. Do you have 75? I've got 350 asking 375. Are we all done there on this great Nova Scotia carving by Andrew Melanson, 350 now 75. Fair warning all through and done. Sold at 350. Well done, moving along. Lot number 232. It's Counting Sheep by Karis Jeffrey and we're at 325, yes, thank you, now 350. 325, now 350, 375 from Alma, Prince Edward Island, 350, then 75. I got the bid 350, then 375. You gotta love these humorous folk carvings. 375, thank you, 400. Now, 375, and then 400, counting sheep. 400, got it, now 425. I'm at 400, then 425. I got a bit 400, then 425. At 400, then 425, and 425, 450. 425, and then 450, go 50, 425, and then 450, 50, 50, 50. I'm all through at 425, there 450. Now 475, and 500, 500, then 550. 
500 bid, yes, now 550. 500, then five and a half, and a bid 500 here, then five and a half. On counting sheep by Karis, Jeffrey, 500, five and a half. Are we all done? Last chance and fair warning at 500, 550 all through. Sold it at 500, well done. Lot 233, it's Bumblebee by Roger Raymond, a Quebec carving. Quebec artist, 225, yes, 250, then 75, back to you. At 250, then 75 on this whimsical bumblebee, 300, then 325, and 350, 325, and then three and a half. I'm at 325, 350, then 75, 75, and then 400, 375, and then four, you got to be 400 if you like it, and you got it there, yes, now 425, go 450, 425, and then four and a half. At 425, and then 450, go 475, at 450, then 75, and 50, 75, and 50, 75, and 450, now 475 on the bumblebee, 475, and then 500, 475, and then five, thank you, 550, 500, then 550, go 500, then 550, 500, then five and a half, at five and a half, and now 600, yes, I love it too, 550, 600, then six and a half. 600 is bid here, now 650. 600, then six and a half, at a bid 600 here, then six and a half. I'm at 600, then six and a half, at a bid 600, go 650. Anybody else? Fair warning. Last chance, final call at 600, 650 on Bumblebee by Roger Raymond. Last chance, final call. Sold at 600, moving along to lot number 234. It's the Seated Chaplain by Leo Fournier, and we're from La Prairie, Quebec. The artist is at 300, now 325. It's a, it could be a, a Chaplain or a Bishop. And we're at 325, or sorry, 350 now, thank you, 375. At 350, then 75. At 350, then 375, sitting on his Gothic throne. 350, you have 375 now? I have 350, yes, now 375. At 350, then 75, okay, 400 now. At 375, and then 400. 375, and then 400, but 375, and go 4. 375, and then 400, go 425. 400, now 425. At 400, then 425, and it'd be 400, then 425. At 400, then 425, are we all done? At 400, 425, fair warning. Last chance at 400, then 425, all through and done. Sold it at 400. Moving along to lot number 235, Le Petit Polisson by Bernardin Perrault. At 300, 325, and then 350 from Frampton, Quebec in Beauce region. At 325, 350, then 375. At 375 and 400. 375 and then 4, gotta be the 400, then 425. At 400, then 425, I go 425 and then 450. 425 and then 450, go 450, 450, 475. 475 and 500, 475 and then 5. 475 and then 500, go 550. Right back to you at 550, 600, 550, 600. Five and a half and now six, thank you, now six and a half. I'm at 600, then 650, go 700. Six and a half and then 700 on the. Petit Polisson at 650, 700. At 650, then seven, thank you, seven and a half. It's coming right back to you at 750, 700, then seven and a half. It'd be 700, go 750, then 800. 750, now 800. 750, then eight. It'd be 750, then eight. It'd be 750, then 800. 750, now eight. It'd be 750, then eight. It'd be 750, then eight. But are we all done? At 750, then eight, fair warning. Last chance, final call. At 750, 800, any further bidding? Sold it right there at seven and a half. Well done. Moving along, lot number 236. It's Priest at the Altar by Fenton Dukeshire from Wolfville, Nova Scotia. Another great carving here at 200. Thank you. Now 225. 225 and then 250. A great, beautifully constructed model. 225 and then two and a half. Thank you. 275. Right back to you. At 250, then 275. I got the 250 here, then 275. Where? At 250, then 275 and 300. 275 and then three. Got a bit 275 and then 300. 275 and go three. At 275 and then three. I got 275 and then 300. Anybody else? 300. Thank you. Now 325. At 300, then 325. I got a bit 325 and 350. 325 and then three and a half. I got a bit 325 and then 350. 50, 50, 50, 325 and then three and a half. I'm at 350. Then 75 at 50, then 75 at the 350, then 375 at the 350 here, then 375, 375 at the 400 on Priest at the Altar by Fenton Dukeshire, 375, 400, 375 and then 400, 
At 400, then 425, it shouldn't be much to think about. At 400, then 425, at 400, then 425, go 450 now. Back to you at 450, at 425, and then four and a half, and then 425, and then 450, 425, and then four and a half. Are we all done? At 425, and then 450, thank you, 475. 450, then 475, and then 75, and 475, and 500. 475, and then 500, would you like it? At 475, and then five, and 475, and then five, and 475, and then five, and fair warning. Thank you, 550 now. You got to be quick. 500, then 550. I'm at 500, then five and a half. I'd have been 500, then five and a half. I'd have been 500, then 550. All through and done. 550, just under the gun. 600. 600. Six and a half. Six and a half. 600, then six and a half. Thank you. 700. 700. Six and a half, and then seven if you'd like it. 650, then 700. Fair warning. All through and done. Sold it right there at 650. Well done. Lot number 237. It's Snake Charming by Scott Higgins, and we're currently advanced to 300, asking just 325. Love this one. From Harriet's Field, Nova Scotia. 300, 325. I got the bid 300 here, then 325. I got bid 300. Anybody else? At 300, now 320. Oh, sorry, 350. Yes, you've been matched. You've got to be 375 if you like it. 350, now 75. At 50, 75. Bid again if you'd like it. At 350, then 375. I got bid 350 here. I've got 7113 in. 7420, you're out. You'd like to bid again? 350, 375 if you'd like it. At 350, then 375. Fair warning. Last chance and final call. Are we all done? At 350, 375 hammers up, coming down. Sold it right there at 350, well done. Lot number 238, lots of attention on this great looking Western Ontario store display for Perrin's Biscuits. What a great store stand here. Of course, the base with the lettering advertising from Perrin's Biscuits, carved up. What a beauty. What do you say on this one? We've been advanced to 950. I'm asking 1,000. Yes, thank you on the telephone. 1,100 here, now 12 back to you. 1,100 on the computer, 1,200 back to you. At 11, then 12, we get 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 1,200. I'm at 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 12. 1,100 on the, on the computer here with 7527 at 11, then 1,200. I've got 1,100 asking 12, and we're at 11, then 12 on the Perrin's Biscuits store display. What a great stand to display your collection on. 11, now 1,200, but it's your last chance to bid on it. We're at 11, now 12, fair warning. All through and done. Hammers up at 11, 1,200. Sold it right there at 1,100, well done. Moving along to lot number 239, the Toronto Evening Telegram newspaper stand. At 200 only, now 225. 200's bid, yes sir, now 225. I've got 200, then 225, and now 250. I'm at 225, 250, go 275, and right back to you. At 250, then 275, and I've been 250, then 275, and 300. At 275, and then 3, got a 325. 300, then 325, and I've 300 here, then 325. Where? At 300, then 325, I go 350. How about 350, 375? 350, then 375, and I've been 375. Anybody else? At 350, then 75, and 57. 75 and 50, then 75. 75 and 400, then 400. I'm at 400, 425 now. At 400, then 425 on the Toronto Evening Telegram newspaper stand. At 400, then 425. I got the bid 400, then 425. I got the bid 400, then 425. I'm at 400, then 425. Are we all done? At just 400, 425. Fair warning. Last chance and final call. Wow, that was close. 425, 450. It's been a few of those today. Got to get your bids in if you'd like it. Now 75, right back to you. 450, then 475. At 450, 475, all through and done. Sold at 450, well done. Lot number 240, the painted barber pole trade sign. It's a two dimensional. That's why we got the barber pole in quotes, because it's not technically a pole. At 150, now 175. At 150, then 175, but a great painted trade sign at the very least. At 150, then 175, I got the bid here. 150, then 175. At 150, then 175, at a bit 150, then 175. At 175, and then 200. Anybody 200? I'm at 175 with you. Yes, now 200. 175 at the two, at a bit 175 at the two, get a bit 175 at the 200. Anybody else? 175 and then two, fair warning. Last chance, final call. All through and done at 175, 200. 
Sold at 175. Well done. 241s up next. Love this one. It's the Optometrist's Spectacles trade sign here featuring the brass uh, nose bridge and glass, stenciled glass lenses here. What a great, great advertising piece. We're calling this circa 1900. Just a fabulous early figural trade sign for an optometrist. And we're at 1,000. Eyes tested, glasses fitted. A thousand now eleven hundred. A thousand's bid here now eleven hundred. A bit thousand then eleven hundred. I've had a thousand here now eleven hundred. Thank you and then twelve hundred. Eleven here then twelve hundred. I've got eleven twelve. Thank you then thirteen hundred. At twelve hundred then thirteen. It a bit twelve hundred then thirteen hundred. I've got a bit twelve hundred then thirteen. It's with M and M at twelve and now thirteen hundred. Twelve and then thirteen. Got a bit twelve and then thirteen. It a bit twelve and thirteen hundred. Twelve and then thirteen. And twelve and thirteen hundred on the optimist or sorry optometrists spectacles trade sign. Twelve and then thirteen. But we got to run. Last chance on this one. This fabulous trade sign at twelve thirteen hundred. All through and done. Fair warning. Sold it right there, 1,200, well done, great buy. Moving along to lot number 242. A lot going on in this trade sign from Rigaud, Quebec. It's the cafe sign for, it's also got Allen's beverages on it as well from Rigaud, Quebec at 475 only, now 500. I have 475 and then five. I've got 475 and then five on this nice early 20th century trade sign at 475 and then 500. 475 and then five. I got 475 and then 500. Go 550. 500 then 550. 500 then five and a half. It'd be 500 then 550. Thank you. 600. 600 now. 550 here. 600 now. I'm at five and a half and then six. You want to be 600? I have 550 now. Six and a bit 550 then six on the Allen's Beverages Quebec Trade Cafe sign at. 550, 600, 550, then six. Are we all done? 550, 600, fair warning, all through. Last chance and final call. Sold it at 550, 243's up next. Cop Woolen Mills trade sign here from New Brunswick. Great early 20th century piece here. Painted pine at 375, 400. At 375, and then four. Wow, here's a bargain. Pay attention to this one. A massive trade sign. What a bargain. 375, 400. At 375 and then four. Got 375 and then 400 here. At 375, 400 there. Now 425. You've got to be. You're out at 425. I'm at 400 here. Then 425. 7263 in. 7373. You're out. At 400. Now 425. Try it one more time. At 400 then 425. Thank you. There it is. Now 450. Now you're in. At 425 and then four and a half. At 425 and then 450. Go 450. 425 and then four and a half on this massive cop woolen mills trade sign 450 475 at 450 then 75 and 50 75 and 50 then 75 at 50 then 75 on the new brunswick trade sign at 50 then 75 show the size of that massive massive sign at 450 then 475 this is an absolute steal the bargain of the day at 450 now 475 at 450 then 475 at a bit 450 then 475 but we got to move along at 450 then 475 last chance Fair warning, 450, 475 hammers up. Thank you, 500, 475 and 500. At 475 for an early trade sign like this, I would think so, uh, 500 then 550, 500 then five and a half. At 500 and 550, go 550, 500 and five and a half. At 500 and 550, go 550, 500 and five and a half. Are we all done? At 500 and 550, anybody else? 500 and 550, fair warning, final call. Sold it at 500 there. Sold it at 500. Lot number 244. A fabulous trade sign for the Jordan Automobile Company here. Frames single-sided painted wood with the applied gold-painted letters. Jordan Automobile Company was headquartered in Cleveland, Ohio. This must have been a very early sign. Circa 1920s. 450, 475, and 500. 475 and then 500. Thank you. Now 550. 500 then five and a half of the bids with LA. At 500 then five and a half, I get 500 here then 550. 500 then five and a half and 600. An automobile trade sign. 
from the 20s for this kind of money, 600, yes, now six and a half, I'll take it. 600, then six and a half, it'd have been 600 here, then six and a half, and 700. 700, now seven and a half. At 700, then seven and a half, it'd have been 700, then seven and a half on this early piece of automotive history. 750, 800, then eight and a half. At 800, then eight and a half, I got a bit 800 here, then 850. 800, then eight and a half, it'd have been 850, then 900. 850, then 900, go 950. You gotta be 950 now, I've got 900 here. 950, please. At 900, then nine and a half, thank you, a thousand. Nine and a half and a thousand, then eleven hundred. And a thousand, then eleven hundred. And I got the bit one thousand, then eleven, a thousand, then eleven, a thousand, then eleven, a thousand here, then eleven hundred. Where? I'm at a thousand here, eleven hundred, thank you, twelve hundred back to you. At eleven, twelve, thirteen hundred. Twelve and thirteen hundred. I'm at twelve hundred, yes, you're in, sir. You're in at twelve hundred, asking thirteen. At twelve hundred, then thirteen. Ha, I got the bit twelve hundred, then thirteen hundred. At twelve hundred, then thirteen, at a bit twelve hundred, then thirteen, go fourteen hundred. Thirteen, fourteen. 14 and then 1500. 14 and then 1500, of course. At 14 and then 15, it'd have been 14 and then 1500 on the fabulous large Jordan Automobile Company trade sign. 15, now 1600. At 15, then 16, got a bit 15, then 1600. Where do you find them? These aren't like the porcelain and metal signs from the era that survived. You left this thing outside for more than 10 years. It was rotted, it was gone. This one, tucked away obviously somewhere away from the elements. 15, 1600. 15, now 1,600. 16, now 1,700. 16, then 1,700. They just don't survive. 16, then 17. I got the bit 16 here, then 1,700. Now 1,800. 17, and then 1,800. Shouldn't be much to think about here. 17, and then 1,800. For the short-lived Jordan Automobile Company, look up the history, part of automotive history, American automotive history, 17, 1800, but we got to run at just 17 and now 1800. Are we all done selling today? 17, now 1800. Fair warning, last chance, final call, 17, 1800. Hammers up, coming down, all through and done. 1800, I'll take it. 19, I must give you a chance to answer back if you'd like. 18, now 1900. 18 and 1900, we can't can't do this all day. At 18 and 1900, fair warning. 19 and 2000, last chance and final call. At 19 now 2000, fair warning. All through and done. <laughs> Sold it right there. 1900, well done. Great buy. 245's up next. The one we've all been waiting for. The Easter eggs painted tin sign. What an unusual subject for a sign. An early one, circa 1875. Just absolutely love this piece. We're currently advanced to 1600. 17 has been bid. 18 now 1900. Asking 1900. 18 is bid. Now 19. Asking 2000 now. 19 and then 2000. Strong sign here, ladies and gentlemen. 19, now 2,000. And I got the bid 19, then 2, got a bid 19, then 2,000. At 19, then 2, got a bid 19, then 2, got a bid 19, then 2,000. I'm at 19, yes, you're in. Now 2,000, anybody else? 19 and then 2, an early trade sign, an early tin sign here for Easter eggs. What an unusual subject. There's got to be a big story there. 19, now 2,000. At 19 and then 2, it'd have been 19, then 2,000. Got the bid 19, then 2, got a bid 19, then 2, it'd have been 19, then 2, it'd have been 19, then 2. Are we all done? Last chance, fair warning, we'll sell it today at 19 or 2,000. We'll give you one final chance. Any further bids? 19, 2,000. Sold it right there, 1900. Well done, lot number 246. A massive, large, painted wood shoe trade sign here from Quebec, circa 1890. You see on this, it's a woman's buckled shoe that you're seeing there at 350, 375, three and a half, and then 375. 350, then 75, and a bit 50, then 75, and a bit 50, then 75, and a bit 50, then 75 on the large painted wood shoe trade sign. 350, now 375, and a bit 375. 350 here, then 375, and a bit 350, then 375. What a bargain here on this circa 1890s Victorian era trade sign. 350, now 375. Are we all done at just 350, now 375? And fair warning, last chance, final call. 350, 375, fair warning. Sold it right there, 350, sold it at 350. Moving along to one of the stars of the show in the trade sign category today. 
the well-known Thomas Stevenson shoe trade sign from Ilsa Craig, Ontario. 1900s, right around the turn of the century, is this double-sided painted wood figural trade sign in the form of a fine leather shoe. What a stunning, stunning trade sign. And included, of course, are two original trade cards and a hand-drawn sign from this merchant. It's got everything that you'd want to have with it as a trade sign from this era, which you typically just don't find with these signs. We know the merchant. We know where this came from. We know the town. We know the period. We know everything. And it's a fabulous figural colored trade sign. What more could you ask for? And of course, it's at 4,000 to start asking 42 and a half now at 4,000 then 42 and a half. I've got 4,000, yes, now 42 and a half. I'd have been 4,000 here, then 4,250 on the fabulous Ailsa Craig trade sign. 4,000, now 4,250. One of those pieces you'll just never regret stepping up on. 4,000, then 42 and a half. It's got the history. It's got everything you want. 4,000, then 4,250. I'm at 4,000, yes, now 42 and a half. I'd have been 4,000, then 42, 50, 50, 50, 4,000, then 42 and a half. At 4,000, then 42 and a half, at a bit 4,000, then 42, 50. How many signs are known? How many pieces are known to have come directly from Ailsa Craig, from a known merchant, a well known merchant, along with all the accoutrements here that we're giving along with it? At 4,000, now 42 and a half, we were advanced to 4,000 in the pre bid. Anybody else? We've got 4,000 already, but we've got to move along and we will sell it today. I'm asking 42 and a half, and I'll ask one more time on the Thomas Stevenson Ailsa Ailsa Craig Ontario shoe trade sign. Fair warning, 4,000, 42 and a half. Last chance, final call. Sold it for 4,000, well done. Great buy. And here's one that we've been waiting for. Lot number 248, the fabulous George Hess Huron County watchmaker trade sign. And very rarely again, as I mentioned before, do you find a sign where you know exactly where it came from. This is steeped in history from Huron County. The Hess name is well known, of course. Watchmaker, this one, an early sign to find in this form. Hard to believe it survived. Sheet iron, wood and iron. What do you say on this figural trade sign? Where should we start from Zurich and Huron County? the George Hess Watchmakers trade sign at 3,500. A three-dimensional trade sign, everybody. When do you find them? 35 and then 37 and a half. I have 35, yes, with you. Now 37 and a half, it'd have been 35 and then 37 and a half, it'd have been 35 and then 37.50 on the George Hess Huron County Watchmaker trade sign. 35 and then 37 and a half, it'd have been 35 and then 37.50. 35 and then 37 and a half. You see the old photographs and it just makes you cry when you see signs like this in those photographs from the Victorian period. You just know a lot of them ended up just rusting away or rotting away. This one, a survivor, 35, 37 and a half. 35, and you don't appreciate how rare they actually are until you start looking for them, especially Canadian ones, the elements that these endured. At 35 and 37 and a half, it'd have been 35 here, then 37.50. I've got 35 and then 37 and a half to care to bid 37.50. I'm at 35 here and then 37 and a half, but is that it? Is that all? We've got the original hanging bracket and the watch bow. What a fabulous sign at just 3,500 asking 37 and a half, and we will sell it today. Make no mistake. 35, 37 and a half, hammers up, last chance, fair warning, 3,537 and a half, it's coming down, we're selling it today. Sold it at 3,500, well done, great piece. Lot number 249, a fabulous Ontario painted pine glazed hanging cupboard, circa 1870, at 275, 300. 275 and 300. At 275 and then three, get up at 275 and then 300. Painted pine. At 275 and then three, get up at 275 and then three. At 275 and then three, get up at 275 and then 300. Skillfully made this one. 300 then 325. I've got the bid 300 then 325 and 300 325. At 300 325, is that it? Is that all? Now 300 325, fair warning. Last chance. 300 325. Final call. All through and done. 
sold it at 300. Well done, lot number 250. Coming up next, a stunning small decorated Manitoba hanging cupboard, early 20th century. It's basswood decorated pyrographically with maple leaves and a male and female native figures in full dress. What a fabulous piece here. Happy to have this in the sale today at six and a half. Thank you. Yes, now 700. Six and a half. I've got the bid here. Seven, then 750. Seven, then seven and a half. I've got a bid 700 here. You're in, sir. Yes, now 750, please. And 800. 750, then 800. At 750, then eight. At a bid 750, then eight. It's marked Mr. J.C. Baxter from Reston, Manitoba. If you ever doubted its origin. At 750, 800. 758, thank you. 800, yes, you're in, sir. Now eight and a half, please. At 800, then eight and a half. And I got a bit 800, then eight and a half. Now eight and a half, 900. Eight and a half here, yes. Now 900, please. 900, then nine and a half. I'm at 900, then nine and a half. And in the fabulous, small decorated Manitoba hanging cupboard. I don't think you could have done much more to decorate a piece like this. A fabulous, colorful, pyrographically decorated storage hanging cupboard 950 yes now a thousand please at 950 then a thousand 950 then 1000 at 950 1000 here ah, i got to be 950 then one it'll be 950 then one it'll be 950 then 1000 please at 950 then 1000 you've come this far at 950 then 1000 care to give it one more try i'm at 950 now 1000 i'll give you one final chance and fair warning at just 950 1,000, any further bidding, hammers up on the small decorated Manitoba hanging cupboard. Sold it right there at 950, well done. Moving along to lot number 251, the small Western Canadian painted wardrobe. Great colors on this one. Fabulous, narrow proportions, just a very unusual cupboard here at 400, then 425. Now 450, 475. I'm at 475 at the 500. 550, 4, 550, 600. 550, 600, then six and a half. At six and a half, and now 700. Six and a half, and then 700. I got six and a half, and then seven. Thank you. Now 750. 750, then 800. 750, then 800. Go 850. 850. 800, then eight and a half. I got a bit 800, then 850, 50, 50, 800, then eight and a half. Original green and red paint. Eight and a half, and then 900, then 950. 900, then nine and a half, and thank you, a thousand now, and 1100. A thousand, then 1100. I've got a thousand dollar bid, then 1100, a bit thousand, then one, and a bit thousand, then 1100. And a bit thousand, then 11, and a bit thousand, then 11, and a bit thousand, then 1100. I'm at 1000, now 1100. Are we all done? At 1000, then 1100, last chance. Fair warning, we've got to run at 1,000. Now 1,100 last chance and fair warning on the fabulous Western Canadian painted wardrobe. Is that it? Is that all? Thank you, 1,100. Now 12. 1,200, then 13, and they're right there. 12 and then 1,300. 12 and then 13, that was very close. 12 and then 13, got a bit 12 here, then 1,300. I'm at 1,200, then 13, and a bit 12 and then 13, and a bit 12 and then 13. Are we all done? 12 and then 13, fair warning. Last chance, final call. 1200, 1300, all through and done. Sold it at 1200, well done. Sold it at 1200, 252, a beautiful Renfrew County Germanic wardrobe. What do you say on this late 19th century? At six and a half, 750, 800, 850, 900, 950 and 1,000. At 950, then 1,000. At 950, then 1,000. Got to be 950 here and then 1,000 on the Renfrew County Germanic wardrobe. 11, thank you, 1,200. 11, then 1,200. And I got the bid 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 1,200. At 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 12, it'll be 11, then 12. The single piece wardrobe lapped and dovetailed drawer to the base at 11, then 1,200. 11 then 12, 11 then 12, 11 then 12, very attractive Renfrew County piece at 11, thank you, 1200. 1100 is bid, now 1200 I'm asking. Asking 1200, I've got 1100, now 12. And I got the bid 11 then 12, 11 then 12, 11 then 12 on this fabulous Renfrew County Germanic wardrobe. Is that it? Is that all? We are selling it today, so you can bid now if you'd like it at 11 or 1200. Fair warning. I've got the hammer up in the air to care for give it one more try. Maybe 11 and 1200. Give you one final chance. All through and done at 11, 1200. 
sold it right there at 1100 well done sold that at 1100 lot number 253 from markham township circa 1880 it's a beautiful fret cut corner whatnot stand circa 1880 in pine We've sold other very similar pieces known from the Markham, uh, Markham area. This one at just 650, 700, meticulously scrolled five tier corner, whatnot stand. 650, 700, 650, then 700. I've got the bid 650 here, then 700, the bid 650, then seven. I'm at 650, then seven, the bid 650, then seven, the bid 650, then 700. At six and a half, and then seven, got a bid six and a half, and then 700. At six and a half, and then seven, are we all done? At just six and a half, and then seven on this Markham County fret cut corner whatnot stand. Last chance, final call. Sold it at six and a half. Lot number 254, getting into some of the nice cabinet furniture in today's sale. A nice early painted pine glazed corner cupboard. Probably American, this piece. A gorgeous, gorgeous one-piece glazed cupboard at 650. Here's an absolute bargain if you're paying attention today. 700, please. Thank you. Now 750. 700, then seven and a half. At 700, then 750. Got a bit here. 750, then 800. 750 then 800 800 then eight and a half at eight and a half and then 900 on the painted pine glazed corner cupboard 900 then nine and a half thank you a thousand at nine and a half and a thousand thank you 1100 at 1000 then 1100 it's early we're calling this 1820s 1100 then 1200 12 and then 13. i'm at 1200 then 13 and got a bit 12 here and then 13 if you have a place for it what an absolute Steel, 1,213. I'm at 12 and then 13, got a bit 12 and then 1,300. 12 and then 13, got it, yes, now 1,400. 13 and then 14, got a bit 13, then 1,400. 14, now 1,500. 14 and then 1,500. At 14 and then 15, got a bit 14, then 1,500. At 15, now 16. 15, then 1,600. 15, now 1,600. Now 17, of course. 16, now 1,700. 16, now 17, got a bit 16 here, then 17. And I got a bit 16, then 17, got a bit 16, then 17. I just want to confirm, we've got a telephone bidder on the next law, correct? 16, 18, now 1900. 18 and then 1900, 18, then 19, got a bit 18, then 1900. And a bit 18, then 19, thank you, 2000. 19 and then 2000. And I got a bit 19, then 2, got a bit 19, then 2, got a bit 19, then 2, now 22 and a half. 2000's bid, now 22 and a half, and it's right back in your lap at 22 and a half, I'm asking. 22 and a half. I've got 2,000, then 2,250, go 2,250, go 2,000, then 22 and a half. At 2,000, then 22 and a half, are we all done? At just 2,000, then 2,250. Last chance, fair warning. Final call at 2,000, 22 and a half. Care to give it one more try? Sold it right there at 2,000. Sold it at 2,000. Moving right along to lot number 255. One of the stunning, stunning pieces from our area here. It's a Waterloo County painted pine corner cupboard with all of the features that you want to see. It's an early one. It's an early one. Raised mullions, half round arch profile. What a stunning example. It has literally every feature that you'd want to have in a great, great example. And it has the stamp from the Country Heritage Loan Exhibition in Montgomery Mills in 1974, where it was exhibited. Ex Alan Clareman Collection, a yep. fabulous history on this piece, and so happy to have it today. We've got the telephone bidder in at 7,500. Thank you, Ben. A stunning corner cupboard. If you're looking for one, this is exactly what you want. It's got all the features that anybody could want in a great Waterloo County corner cupboard. 7,500, thank you. Now 8,000. I've got 7,500 on the telephone and now 8,000. And I get the bid 75 here, the bid 75 here, the bid 75 here, the bid 75 here, then 8,000 where? At 75 on the telephone. Now 8,000, 75 and then 8,000. And I get the bid 75 and then 8, Andre, can you confirm that Ethan's coming up next? At 8,000 and 8,500, 8,500, 
you're out on the telephone now. I've got 8,000. Is that a bid, Ben? Yep. Thank you. Now 8,500 on the phone. Back to you online at 9,000. We've got 8,500 on the telephone. And the fabulous X Claremont Collection, Waterloo County Painted Pine Corner Cupboard. It's an early one. 1830s, everybody. 9,000. Now 9,500 right back in your lap. At 9,000, then 9,500. At 9,000, then yep. 95, of course. Now 10,000. 95 on the telephone. And then 10. A man with taste on the telephone has bid 9,500, but now we're asking 10,000. It's back Back to you at 9,500, then 10,000, got to bid 95, and then 10. Provenance, and it's got all the features that you'd want in a fabulous, fabulous corner cupboard, the finest I've ever seen. At 9,500, 10,000, 9,500 on the telephone, and now $10,000 we're asking. At just 95 and then 10, got to bid 95 and then 10,000. At 95 and then 10, got to bid 95 and then 10, and bid 95 and then 10,000. Thank you. Right back to you at 11,000. Yep. Of course. Very little thinking to be done when you have a piece that's this fabulous in your grasp. It's right there. It's $1,000 away. We're at 11 on the telephone. It's $1,000 away. And I'm going to put it back to you, if you'd like, at 12,000. I've never seen one this nice. I've seen literally hundreds and hundreds of Waterloo County Painted pine corner cupboards, and there's always the features that you check off the list. This one checks every single one of them. Originality, it's early, it's got all the features that you want to see. The surface is worth salivating over. 11,000 is bid on the phone. Now 12,000 we're asking. It's back to you, Eminem, if you'd care to try it one more time. We're at 11,000 on the phone. Asking 12,000 X Allen Clareman collection exhibited in the Country Heritage Loan, Montgomery Mills. A fabulous, fabulous example. So happy to have it here today, but we do have to run. Uh, put the hammer in the air. We've got 11,000 on the phone to a gentleman with exceptional taste. 11,000 asking 12,000 today for the Waterloo County Painted Pine Corner Cupboard. Care to give it one more try at 11, 12,000? I've got the hammer in the air in a threatening pose at 11, now 1,200, or sorry, 12,000. We'll give it one last try at 11, 12,000. Fair warning, all through and all done. Get it. Sold it right there at 11,000. Well done. Thank you, Ben. Very exciting. Thank you, Justin, very much. We're moving along here to the... Very exciting segment in the sale. Here's some fabulous maritime folk art coming up here. The neatest thing about what we do here at Miller & Miller Auctions is come across a state fresh material and we have an entire lineup of some fabulous work that I think will blow your mind. We received a call from this lady a number of years ago and she started the conversation by saying, I am the Maud Lewis of Ontario. And when I went to visit Barbara Clark Fleming, she indeed was. Bar Barbara Clark Fleming is a fabulous woman, and she has spent so much time doing these images of rural Ontario. Here's a great example of her work here. Uh, Barbara, uh, wonderful, wonderful artist here. 400 and 425 on this one. 425 and then 425. At 400, 425. At 400, now 425. And then 450. At 25 and a half. 25, 50, 25, 50, now 75. Everything you'd expect a folk artist to be humble, honest, and straight from the heart. 450, 475. 450, 475, now 5. 475, 5. 475, now 5. 500, 5 and a half now. Great one, by the way, too. At 500, 550, 600. Yes, took it. 650 now. Barbara Clark Fleming, 600, 650. Took it. 700 now. 657, 650, 700 now. On you, 650, 700. It's the Maud Lewis of Ontario. Barbara Clark Fleming, 750, 800. 750, 800. 750, 8. 7, 800, thank you, now 850, it's your turn. It's a great example of a Barbara Clark Fleming, by the way, 800 now, 850, 850, fair warning, are we all in and done? 800 now, 850, took it, 900, 900, 850, 900, 850, now 9, 900, 950 then, 900, 950, works are nowhere but on their way up. 1,000, 1,100, please. 1,000, 1,100, and just you watch, mark my words, 
more next year. 1,000, 1,100, 1,200 now. 1,100, 1,200, 1,100, 12. It's a great one, too. 1,200, 1,300 on this one. 1,200, 1,300. At 12, 1,300. At 12, 1,300. Fair warning. At 1,200, 13, 1,400. 13, 1,400. Nowhere but up. 13, 14, 1,500. At 14, 1,500. At 14, 1,500. One of the greats. At 1,400. 15 took it. 1,600 now. 15 and 16. 100, 15, 16, 100. What do you say? 15, 1600. Hammers in the air. Bids in. Are you sure? Took it. 1700, 1800. Now back to you. Thanks for the quick bidding. 17, 1800. Took it. 1900, 1900, 18, 1900. A great example. 1800, 1900, 18, 1900. Fair warning then. At 1800, 1900, last chance and final call, Barbara Clark Fleming took it. 19, 2000 now. 2000, yes, of course. And 22 and a half, 22 and a half. Don't let go now. At 2000, 2250, don't let go. 2000, 22 and a half. It's a great one. At 2000, 22 and a half, fair warning. 2000, 2250, last chance and final call then. If we don't have 2250, 2000, 22 and a half, and in 2000, 2250, Sold it at 2,000. Thank you very much, by the way. 257. We get into some of the fabulous maritime folk art. Of course, the run of mods to come. Lots of anticipation there. This one starting with Joe Sleep. Joseph Sleep, another fabulous maritime folk artist. This one, oil on a wood panel. Strongly graphic rendering of flowers, hearts, and birds. All the things that Sleep was known for. Here is one of the greats, certainly one of the greats of Nova Scotia, 1600, 1700, 16, 1700, fresh to the market, 15, 16, 17, 1800, 17, 1800. We're offering the best here today. 17, 1800 at 17, 1800, the finest in maritime folk art today. 18 took it, 1900. 18, 19 took it, 2000. 19, 2. Why not buy the best? The best is here for you. 1900, 2000. 1900, 2000 on the Joseph sleep. Everything asleep should be whimsical and fabulous and creative and Canadian. 1900, 2000. 1900, 2000. Fair warning, all in and done. Took it 22 and a half. 2000, you're in. 22 and a half, you're out. 2000, 2250, fair warning. 2250 at 2000, 2250 on the Joseph Sleep, fair warning. Hammer is in the air. 2000, 22 and a half, 25, you're out now. 25, you're out again. At 22 and a half, 2500, I think you should. 2500, it's a great one. At 22 and a half, 25, took it 2750. There's nothing greater than maritime folk art. This is Canada in its heart and in its soul. 2500, 2750. 2500, 2750. At 2500, 2750. Fair warning. Are we in or are we out? 25, 2750. Last chance and final call. At 25, 27 and a half, and then 25, 750. Took it. And then 3000. You're out again. You're out again. I think you should. 2753. 2753. It's a Joe sleep, for goodness sake. 2753. Took it. 32 and a half now, please. 3,000. 32 and a half. 32 and a half. Flowers and bees and birds and everything you want. 3,000. 32 and a half. At 3,000. 32 and a half. 3,000. 3250 on the Joseph sleep. 3,000, 3,250, you're in. At 32 and a half, you are out. 3,000, 3,250, fair warning. At 3,000, 3,250, last chance and final call. 3,000 here, 32 and a half where? 3,000, 3,250. Sold it right there, 3,000, yes. And then 258, we get better and better and better. Hey, check out this one, graphically strong for sure. Highly stylized and brightly painted everything that sleep was known for. Joseph Sleep, indeed. What do you say on this? A fabulous example, again, of a Joseph Sleep at 2022 and a half. At 2022 and a half. Coming from some of the finest collections in Canada, 202250. Look at how Sleep executes art. Look at how Sleep paints. What a composition of tulips and daisies 
the master, Joseph Sleep, at 2,000, 2250. At 2,000, 2250, it's big, it's beautiful, it's bold, it's colorful. It's 2,000, 2250. Are you sure? I'd go as far as to say it's a buy and a bargain. At 2,000, I'd go as far as to say it's an opportunity at 2,000, 2250. But you are the judge. 2250, 25. Thank you. 2250, 2500. Don't lose this deal. You were right then, you're right now. 2500, 2750. You're right. At 2500, 2750, you're right. 25, 2750. It's on you. Still a buy and still a bargain at the 2500, 2750, 3000. I should think so. In fact, it's an eyebrow raiser. 3000. 32 and a half. You see it in person, you go crazy. 3,000, 32 and a half. You appreciate it more in person. It's big, it's beautiful, and it's Joseph Sleep. It's Canadian, and it's Nova Scotia, and it's a masterpiece. 32 and a half. 3,500. Don't lose this deal. 32 and a half. 3,500. I think we're still in bargain territory, but you're the judge. 32 and a half here, 3,500 where, two very discerning bidders that know precisely what they're looking at. 32 and a half, 3,500, hammers in the air, bids in. Is that all? Are you ready to let go of this? At 32 and a half, 3,500, fair warning, last chance, final call, 32 and a half, 3,500. Sold it at 32.50. I appreciate your participation. Hey, how about this one? It's the Crazy Cat, Black Cat by Joseph Sleep. Crazy looking indeed, but the more you see it, the more you appreciate Sleep's ingeniousness. Ingenuity, we'll call it. Ingenious, that's not a word. Joseph Sleep was the Canadian folk artist from Nova Scotia that people look to. And here it is at 800 now, 850, unlocked from a collection. They bought it directly from sleep. 850, now 900. 850, now 900. What's not to love? 950, 1000. What's not to love at 950, 1000? 1100, 1200. How can you not smile? 1200, 13, 1400. How can you not smile? 14, 15, 16. That is well executed. 16, 17, 1800. Extremely well executed. 17 and 1800. How can you not grin looking at that cat? At 17, 1800, that's why they call him the master, Joseph Sleep. 1700 in the hand, 1800 on you. I think you should. I think the cat is worth it. 1700, 1800. It's the crazy cat. It's the Joseph Sleep cat. He had fun with this one. 1700, 1800. 1700, 1800. Well, then, fair warning on this intense rendering. 17. 18, took it, 1,900, you're out again. 18, 1,900, I wouldn't let go either. 19, 2,000, I wouldn't let go. It's intense. 1,900, 2,000. 1,900, 2,000. What is it about this image that you can't take your eyes off of it? 1,900, 2,000. 1,900, 2, hammers in the air, we have to run. 1,900, 2, are we all in and done? Can you resist, really? 1,900, 2, no, you can't, neither can I. 22 and a half, 2,500 on you again. Can you resist? 22 and a half, 2,500, it's irresistible. 22 and a half, 2,500, a great example of a Joseph sleep. 22 and a half, 2,500, I think you're safe and sound. I'll let you decide. 22 and a half, 2,500, 22 and 50, 2,500. At 22 and a half, my hammer's up, we have to run. 25 took it, 2750. 25, 2750. The, Joseph Sleep is a master. 2750, 3000. Take a look at the crazy cat and tell me if you can resist. 27 and a half, 3000. 2750, 3000. It's on you. Do it. 27 and a half, 
3,000, you're safe and sound, 2753. It's money well spent. It's money in the bank, 2753. Fair warning, hammers in the air at 2753, 2753,000, 2753, third and, oh, there it is, and 32 and a half. You're out again. You're out again. Don't give up now. You fought far too hard to give up now. Don't lose the deal. 3,000, 32 and a half. Don't lose this deal. I have 3,000 here, 32 and a half where? We have to run. Hammer's in the air. 3,000, 32.50. Fair warning. 3,000, 32 and a half. Last chance and final call. Are you sure? Can you really let this go? One last look. 3,000. 3250, last chance and final call. Sold it at 3,000. Hey, thank you very much. What a celebration of art we have today. A lot of people don't realize that Joseph Sleep had his start in the Bill Lynch Circus. In fact, that's where he worked for a lot of his life. So when you see this next image, you can appreciate what Joseph Sleep was trying to communicate, likely reminiscing about his years working for those Bill Lynch shows. A great composition. In fact, when you look at some of those figures on the Ferris wheel, you can't help but ask yourself, was he a genius? 42 and a half, 4,500 is all I'm bid. This is a large work. In fact, you can see it. John Finley is standing next to it. 4250, 4500. It is a great one. Like so many of the works we've offered today, these pieces have come from the most important collections across the country. And this is easily considered a Joseph Sleep masterpiece. I have a very lucky winning bidder at 4250. As it stands, 4,500 is the next increment. I will sell it for 4,250, asking 45. I will sell it at 4,250, 45. If no one else recognizes the beauty in this composition, 45, 4,750. Thank you. I do too. I like your taste. 45, 4,750. Don't lose the deal. 4,500, 4,750. At 45, 4,750. At 45, 4,750. Try finding another sleep of this size with this theme. Very difficult. 4,500 is in the hand. 4,750. I took it. You're out again at 5,000. You're out again at 5,000. A rare, a rare image. A Joseph Sleep in monumental proportions with the Bill Lynch Carnival. 4,750, 5,000. 4,750, 5. 4,750, 5,000. Certainly a genius and one of his masterpieces, most certainly. 4,750, 5,000. Thousand, my hammer is in the air. Can you resist? At 47.55,000, thank you. Works like this change hands once every so often. 5,500, 6,000. Once every so often, meaning once every decade or so, if you're lucky to have the opportunity to purchase it when it becomes available. You have the chance right now, right here, Monumental work of Joseph Sleep. I have 5,500 on the board, 6,000 now, and 6,500. One of his masterpieces, definitely. 6,500, 7,000. Unquestionably, one of his great pieces. In fact, if there was an exhibit, they'd be calling you up. Would you please lend us Joseph Sleep Carnival? And then you have to make the decision. Right now, it's available for purchase. You're the next curator, and I have a leading bid of 6,500, 7,000, 7,000, 65, 7,000. At 6,500, 7,000, I urge you to think because we have to move on. 6,500, 7,000 on the Joseph Sleep 
masterpiece. You see John Finley over there standing next to this piece. 6,500, 7,000. At 6,500, 7,000, my gavel is in the air. Are you sure? Have you come to peace with letting go? 6,500, 7,000, I'll give you one last chance. At 6,500, 7,000, fair warning, are you sure? 65, 7,000, last chance and final call, 6,500, 7,000 on you. <laughs> Sold it at 65. Thank you very much to discerning bidders. As we move along here to the Maud Lewis Harbor Scene painted, handwritten letter here. The handwritten letter. Now, this was a rare discovery. First of all, it's an early image. 1952 is very, very early in Maud's career. This came to us very recently. It's a fabulous piece. It belongs in a special collection. It has Maud Lewis communicating with a family member, Eva Gray. Gray was a teacher and a cousin and a good friend of Maud Lewis. Eva rented a room in Maud, Maud's grandmother's house on Lovett Street. So a very close connection to Maud. And of course, in this, Maud reflects on life in Nova Scotia, Marshalltown, the things that would have happened, the secret behind the scenes life of Maud Lewis, all encapsulated in a letter but the most magnificent part about this letter is what is painted as a tribute and as a form, a symbol of Maud's love for Eva Gray. It is the harbor scene on the front in bold color. 15,000 were bid and now 16,000. 15, 16,000. Any correspondence from Maud Lewis are extremely, extremely rare. This is an example of a rare correspondence between Maud Lewis and somebody that meant a lot to Maud. And the neatest thing about the artwork on this piece is that it was done as a tribute to somebody that we know about, and that is Eva Gray. A lot of Maud's paintings were painted, and they were well done, but seldom do we know who they were painted for. Here is an image. We know precisely who this was painted for. We know what was on Maud's mind when it was being painted with love. And only in her early works do we see the detail. Do we see this kind of detail? It's only in 1952 when Maud spent that painstaking detail. The color is lush. It's a fabulous piece. And it's an historical document. I have 16,000, 17,000, 16, 17,000. It belongs in one of the important collections, belongs in one of the important collections of Maud Lewis in this country. I congratulate who's ever at 16,000, 17,000, but now it's up to you, 16,000, 17,000. It's the Maud Lewis letter. You can read all about it. She talks about the old hard winter. She talks about how a $4 table was too expensive for Everett. He'd rather eat at a box, he said. 16,000, 17,000. You get to see the humor. You get to see the life she was living for a woman that lived such, in such advers adversary. She, she truly had an ability to see the best in every situation she found herself in. 16,000, 17,000. Gents, put 16,500 on the board, please. 16,000, 16,500. 16,000, 16,500. Is anyone thinking at 16,000, 16,500? You are in at 16,000, 16,500. At 16,000, 16,500. My hammer is in the air, and I congratulate whoever is the victor in this case. At 16,000, 16,500, are you certain? Are you finished? Are you done? At 16,000, 16,500, hammers in the air. 16,000, now 16,500. Sold it right there, thank you very much. 16,000, absolutely. 
And there we go with Sandy Cove Harbor scene here by Maud Lewis. Again, a nice example of Maud. Of course, Maud painted on found materials. This one, oil on beaver board, Sandy Cove Harbor scene. It's a great example and a rare example. What do you say on this one here? She seemed to capture nostalgia, and this was a lot of her early childhood memories. 20,000 on this one. It's the Sandy Cove Harbor scene by Maud Lewis. I have 20,000 asking 21,000. 20,000, 21,000. Multicolored houses, autumn tree colors, blue water, seagulls, everything that Maud was known for in this particular image. It's fresh to the market. Everything we sell is 100% guaranteed as authentic. 20,000, 21,000. 20,000, 21,000 is what I'm bid. 20,000 here and 21,000 is the ask. It's marked on the back, written Sandy Cove, Nova Scotia, January 1967. I have 20 thousand asking 21,000 right in the middle of our estimate here at 20,000, 21,000. And now I extend the opportunity to you at 20,000 on the Maud Lewis Sandy Cove Harbor scene at 20,000, 21,000. Your turn, fair warning. Is that all? Is that it? My hammer's in the air at 20,000. 21,000, are we all in and all done? It's the last chance, final call. Yes, 21,000, you almost had it. It was that close, 21,000, now 22,000. I have 21,000, now 22,000. Wow, that was close. You felt it too, 21,000, 22,000. Make no mistake, this is a Great Maud Lewis. The color is there, and everything is in perfect harmony. At 21,000, 22,000, all of the things we've known to expect from Maud, the multicolored houses, 21,000, 22,000. How did she do it? 21,000, 22,000. 22 and 23,000. 22,000, 23,000. Everyone has a lot in life. And there's an old saying, things work out best for those that make the best out of what turns out. And you take Maude Lewis, and she truly did make the best of her life. And she did it image by image, painting, colorfully, a reality that she remembered 22,000, 23,000. At 22,000, 23,000, you are buying an original, you're buying an authentic Sandy Cove harbor scene and a great example of an image that's seldom seen, 22,000, 23,000. Are we all in and done? I have my hammer in the air at 22,000, 23,000. Are we all in and all done? 22,000, thank you very much. 23,000, anybody else? Fair warning. 22,000, now 23,000. Sold it right there, and I thank you very much for that. That's lot 262. Lot 263 is preceded by a video. Julie, welcome to, to Miller & Miller. You've come a long way, a uh, plane ride from, from Nova Scotia. Tell us about these Maude Lewis paintings that are coming up in our February 11th sale. This is a long, long ways from fruition, but um, from my aunt's heart to her shelf to a plane ride, and here they are sitting in your auction house safe, thankfully. Um, they've made their trip all the way from Nova Scotia. I, I wonder if Maude ever got to be on a plane or anything special like that, but I, I'm sure my aunt and Maude both would be pleased that, uh, you know, they've received so much attention and love and 
and been in the spotlight like they should have always been. So, so tell us about, about this. You had the opportunity to speak with your aunt before she passed away, and she said a few words about these pieces uh, and her remembrance of getting them from Maud. Exactly, yeah. Um, back uh, in their 65 Ford, Lane, or Ford Fair Lane, they had uh, taken, a, taken a trip down to, to find her and in her tiny little house had quite a um, experience uh, meeting Maude and getting to sit with her at her own table and have a chat and she fell in love with her instantly. She, you know, quote unquote, was a dear soul and uh, had quite uh, an interaction with her husband who uh, decided that they were sitting there and at the very least he could offer them a raw hot dog and uh, they were a little taken aback and she refused to eat it but took it graciously and uh, he actually tried to get them to go out back and buy some of his paintings he said the good stuff but uh, they declined and uh, uh, were happy with the two purchases that they had made that day and, she, and five and seven dollars she re she recalls amazing and and so any idea why she chose the ones she chose? Oh, my uncle was a lover of horses, so that's an easy one. And I would imagine in, in my head, there was probably lots to choose from and nobody can discount her love for color and, uh, and, the, and the story that they told in her painting. So I would imagine they went back and forth a little bit before they settled on these two. Fabulous. That's Julie LeBlanc. Julie, hello, and thank you so much for everything that we've, uh, all the dialogue that we've had, and certainly by, for flying in from Nova Scotia. It was a pleasure to meet you in person, and a pleasure to hear the story, and a pleasure to, to know you and to work with you on these two pieces. Oxen and Winter is the first of these two, and then Horse Pulling Logs, purchased by her aunt, Marilyn Manser. And interestingly enough, they're both very exciting images. In fact, uh, both of these images are images that were favorites of mods. Oxen in Winter is the one we're selling first, Lot 263. It's a serial image that spans three decades, one of Maud Lewis's favorite images coming directly from the, the lineage that Julie LeBlanc has outlined there. Very exciting here. I have 19,000 19, on the board on this particular image. It is the Marilyn Manser Oxen in Winter, 19,000, 20,000. 19,000 on the board and 20,000 on this particular image. It's the two oxen by Maud Lewis. One of her favorite images for sure at 19,000, 20,000, 19 and now 20,000. Oil on Beaver board, Oxen in Winter by the famed folk artist Maud Lewis at 19,000, 20,000. This was subject to a national news story. In fact, CBC covered it, and we recently had CTV locally, and we had a, a number of newspapers that picked it up as well. It's thrilling when you find works that have been purchased directly from Maud Lewis herself. Those are the works that I get the most excited about because you hear these stories, the stories that come with the art, the encounter with Everett, 20,000, 21,000, 20,000 here, 21,000 where, a great serial image and a great example of oxen in winter for sure. I have 20,000, 21,000, it's entirely up to you. I have 20,000 here, 21,000 where. It's the first of two serial images offered today as a part of Julie LeBlanc's aunt, Marilyn Manser, who had purchased these in 1967 from Maude Lewis herself. The first of two is at 20,000, 21,000. It's oxen in winter, 20,000, 21,000. It is your turn. It's your decision. What do you say on this one? I have 20,000 in the hand, 21,000. I congratulate the 20,000. 
at 20,000, it certainly would be considered to be a great buy and a great bargain in today's Maud Lewis market and certainly Certainly one to pay attention to for anyone that's considering a mod. I have 20,000 and 21,000. At 20,000, 21,000, I'll throw it back to you. What do you think? The winning bidder is 20,000, folks. Try 25, 20,500. I'll extend it to the audience at 20,500 and see if you're considering making an investment or perhaps just celebrating Canadian history. 20,000, 20,005, my hammer is in the air. At 20,000, 20,005, it's going once. Oxen in Winter by Maud Lewis, 20,000, 20,005, going twice. And a third and final time for Oxen in Winter, it's at 20,000, and now 20,005. Sold it at 20,000. Thank you very much. 264. This is horse pulling logs. It's an unusual image in the sense that it's, it's scarcely seen. Now, horse pulling logs by Maud Lewis is, is a serial image. It is an image that is slightly larger than her usual works, which makes this example fantastic. It's slightly larger than her typical works on beaver board, 14 and a quarter by 16.5. It makes this image unusual. And it's a nice example, and it's part of the Marilyn Manser collection. 21. 1,000, 22,000 on horse pulling logs. Certainly makes a bold statement. There's no question about that. Maud's use of color in this particular case is fabulous. In fact, it's, there's a dazzling mane and some feathering, and it's all done in a pink that is absolutely radical. It is a great example of one of Maud's works. There's no question about it. Horse pulling logs, a lesser seen serial image, and this one, is so well executed. Fabulous, signed, lower right edge, Maud Lewis. Actually has Maud's fingerprint, apparently. That was something that uh, was also shared by Julie's aunt, and that was the way they were done. They were sold wet. Oftentimes these things went off in vehicles wet. 21,000, 22,000, 21,000, Try 21,500, 21,500, 21,000, 21,500. At 21,000, 21,500, it is your turn. You decide. It's the first of two mods offered by Julie LeBlanc and her aunt's estate. 21,000, 21,500, fair warning. At 21,000, 21,500, sold it right there. Thank you very much. Fabulous. 265 is the next up for grabs here. Now, Maud painted three black cats. It's one of her famous images. This is a serial image found only in the middle to late 1960s. And there are a varying level of quality of these images. Some were well done and some were very, very well done. This one is an example of a great one. Three black cats, it's a quality image. And based on the thickness of the signature, it looks like it was painted in circa 1965. There is something about this image. What was it about this particular Maud Lewis image in this sale that drew everybody to the showcase where it was? Yes, the cats are a crowd pleaser. There's a reason why Maud did this one over and over again. It's colorful, it's bright, it's bold, and I'll tell you, it is Maud Lewis through and through. Nova Scotian folk art here. You've seen it today. You've seen it from a variety of artists, and certainly Maud Lewis is the poster child. 37,500 on this fabulous example of the three black cats, 37,500, 40,000. 
37,540,000. Thousand. I have 37,500 on three black cats asking 40,000. Are you considering adding to the collection? Are you considering adding a fabulous example of three black cats? Here it is for you at 37,500, 40,000, I like it too. At 37,500, on three black cats, it's there for the taking, and it's done by Maud Lewis, 37,500, 40,000. What do you think? We've got to run. It's been a great day, by the way, of selling this Canadian folk art, and certainly the apex of the sale is converging on Maud Lewis here at 37,500 on three black cats asking 40,000. My hammer is in the air. That means the hammer's up. What do you say? At 37,500, 40,000. Fair warning, 37,500, 40,000. Last chance and final call at 37,500, 40,000 on you. Sold it right there. Thank you very much. You saw it right here. Covered Bridge in Winter by Maud Lewis. Covered Bridge in Winter by Maud Lewis. It's a serial image, late 1965. Late 1965. What's unusual about this particular image is the fact that normally you see these in blue. This, the tree loops and the shadowing is all done in pink. And what is it about the fact that this is just the right color of pink as well? It's one of the most popular images that Maud ever executed. This one extremely well done. We have the full lineage on this. Helen Perry, Stainer 1966, she was the one that purchased this painting. It's offered today, covered bridge in winter with the unusual pink. What do you say on this piece? Late 1965, I have 16,000, 17,000 please. 16,000, 17,000. I have 16,000 asking 17,000. 16,000 at 16, 17,000. 16, 17,000. Thank you. Now 18,000. I have the 17,000 on this most unusual covered bridge by Maud Lewis. Now I have 18,000. And let me tell you, you will never see another one in pink. In fact, my conversation recently with Alan Deacon confirmed the fact that throughout his entire lifespan, he has seen but two of these, and this one is the second. Very scarce in pink. And what is it about the pink? It's just the right color of pink. It's the covered bridge in winter. Of course, the scene selected as part of the Canada Post series of stamps. And why? Why? Because it is incredible. 20,000, 21,000, the way it's executed, the way it's plotted. 20,000, 21,000, one of the famous Maud Lewis images. 20,000 on the board, 21,000 where? It's a serial image found only in the 1960s. We have 20,000 and now 21,000 on covered bridge in winter. Highly unusual in pink at 20,000, 21,000. What do you say? At 20,000, 21,000, 20,000, and now it's on you at 21,000. Is that it? Is that all? At 20,000, covered bridge in winter, 21,000, it's your turn. We've got to keep moving. At 20,000, 21,000, my hammer's in the air. Are we all in and all done? Is that it? Thank you, 21,000, 22,000 now. 21,000, 22,000, I believe it's an opportunity. 22,000, 23,000. At 22 asking 23, it's an opportunity. 
at 22,000, 23,000, an unusual, an unusual image in pink. 22 and now 23,000. 22,000, 23,000. It's on the board at 22,000 asking 23,000, your turn. What do you think? 22,000, 23,000. Fair warning then. My hammer's in the air. I'll sell it at 22, 23,000. The only thing that's better than this image is the provenance that comes with it. At 22,000, 23,000. Fair warning, hammer's in the air at 22. Now 23,000, last chance, final call. <laughs> Sold it at 22, thank you very much. 267, Spring Scene by Maude Lewis. A great example, again, of an image that spans at least two decades, but very seldom seen. It's a rare serial image by Maude, featuring the cows, featuring the spring scene. 30,000 is on the board, 32,5. Featuring the cow, the spring flowers, flowering fruit trees, farm buildings. It's a great example of a Nova Scotia scene from the mind of Maud Lewis. 30,000, 32,5. That's 30,000 on the board, 32,005. It's a rare image at 30,000, 32,5. It's a great example at 30,000, 32,5. Perfectly balanced and brilliantly filled. It's just well done. It's a great piece by Maude Lewis, one of the stars of the show today at 30,000, 32,5. It's up to you, we've got to run. At 30,000, 32,5, what do you say? I'll put my hammer in the air and I'll say, it's going once at 30,000, 32,5, going twice at 30,000, 32,5, and a third and final time, 30,000, 32,5, Sold it right there. Thank you very much. Very exciting indeed. Maude Lewis, that's our lineup. 268, thank you very much. 268 is the painting of the schooner by Axel Johnson. 125, 150. At 125, 150. Anybody else? Fair warning. Yes, 225, 250, 25, 50. There's two of these. 225, 250. Now 275, 275, 57, 5, 57, 5, 57, 5. Fair warning. 75, 3, 75, 300, 75, 3. At 207, 5, 300. Anybody else? Fair warning. It's up to you. 207, 5, 300, 275. Now 3. Sold it right there. Next one is 269, Evening Tide by Axel Johnson. 125, 150, 125, 150. At 125, 150, fair warning, last chance, final call. 50 took it, 75, 75, 75, 150, 75. Fair warning, 150, 175, 175, 200, 175, 225. At 225, 225, last chance, final call, 225, 50. At 225, 250, took it, 75, took it, 75, 50 now, 75, 50 now, 75. Last chance, final call, 250, now 275. Sold it right there. And then 270, we move along to the end of the sale. Car Fisherman with a big catch by Walt Saper at 75, 100. 75, 100. At 75, 100, 125, 125. At 100, 125, 150. At 125, 150. At 125, 150. Last chance, final call at 125. And then 150. Sold it right there. 2071. Maritimes Fisherman by John Sharp. 5075. $50.75. 50 what do you say? At 5075, 5075. Half now 75. Fair warning. 5075. Last chance. Final call and 175, 50, 75. At 150, 175, 150, 175. Anybody else? You're out. At 150, 175, 150. Now 175, 150. Now 175. 
sold it right there. 272 Maritimes Fisherman's Wharf Scene Diorama. I only have 50, 75, 50, 75, 50, 75. Fair warning. Yep. And one. And 75, 100. I have 75, 100. Took it. 125 now. At 1, 125. 1, 125. Took it. 150. Thank you. 125, 150, 175. At 150, 175, 150. Now 100, 75, 2. 175, 200, 175, 2. Fair warning. At 175, 200, 175, 200, 175. Now 2. Sold it right there. 273. Scottish Lazy Mouth. Here we have the uh, Moravia Fishing Boat Diorama at 50, 75. 75, 50 now, 75, 50, 75, 50 now, 75. Last chance. What do you say at 50, 75? That's half. That's 50, 75. Fair warning. Sold it right there. 274. We move along to 274. On 274, we have the Mermaid Ships figurehead by Gary Brown. Gary Brown, known for his figureheads. This is a rare and expertly rendered large scale carving of a mermaid figurehead. And it's signed G. Brown, 325, 325, 325. Is that all? Is that it? It's great. It's large, 325, 350. At 25, 50 now, 75. 50 now, 75. 50 now, 75. Anyone else? At 50 now, 75, 400. 75, 400. 75, 400. 75, 4. Anyone else? Fair warning. At 75, 400. 300, 75, 400. 75, 425. Yep. At 425, at 425, and then 425, and then 425, and then 50. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 425, 450, and 25, 50, 25, now 50. Fair warning. At 25, 50, 25, 50, 425, 50, now 75. It's on you. 50, now 75. A lot of mermaid there at 57.5. What do you say? 57.5, 57.5. Fair warning. 57.5 and 575, 500. 75, 5. At 75, 500, 75, 500, 75, 500, 75, 5, 550 now. At 500, 550 now. At 500, 5 and a half and then 5, 550, 500, 5 and a half. Fair warning. At 500, 5 and a half and then 550, 500 now. 5 and a half and then 5, 550. <laughs> Sold it right there. 500. 275. We move along to the Prince Edward and Miniature Blue. Oil lamps, 150, 175, 150, 225, at 225, and then 225, at 200, now 225, 50, now 75, worth it all day long, 575. At 575 and 575, anybody else? At 575 and 575, and then 250, now 275, and then 50, now 75. <laughs> Sold it there. And then two. 176 is the Angela opalescent coin dot finger lamp here. 1752, 1752, 25 and then 250. At 25, 50 now, 75, 50 now, 75, 50 now, 75. What do you say? At 250, you're out at 275. You are out at 275. You have to be 50 now, 75, 300. At 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, 300. Gavels up, bids in, 75 now, 3. Sold it right there. 277 Hobbs Cranberry Opalescent Snowflake Lamps. There's two of them there. What do you say on this? The pedestal and the finger at 425, 450. It's on you. 425, 450 on the pair. 425 Snowflake 75, 5. At 75, 500, 75, 5. At 75, 500, 75, 5. At 75, 500, 75, 500, 75, 500, 75, 5. Fair warning. 75, 500, 75. Now 5. Sold it right there, 278. Moving along, Hobbs, clear and blue, opalescent, snowflake, 
finger lamp, pardon me, pedestal lamps, 250, 275, 250, 275, 300 took it, 25, at 325 and in 325 and in 300, now 325, anybody else? At 25 and now 50, at 25 and now 350, at 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25 and then 50 and 25, 50, my hammer's up, bids in, 25 and 350, 25 half, <laughs> sold it right there, very good. 279, Sheldon Blue Opalescent Swirl Lamp. Good looking piece there. 175, 200, 175, 2, right there. 25 there, 50 here. Yes, 75, 250 now, 75 on the phone, 250, 75 on the phone. At 250, 75, fair warning, 250, 75, last chance and final call. <laughs> Sold it right there. Moving along to lot 280, King Glass Co. Coin Dot Finger Lamp. I have 200, 225. At 200, 225, and then 200, 225, and then 200, 225. My hammer's up, bids in. At 200, 225, and then 225, took it 250 now. 225, and then 250. 25, and then half, and then 25, 50, 25, 50. Anybody else? 25, and then 50, and 25, now half. <laughs> Sold it right there. 281, moving along. Another King Glass Co. Melon Coin Dot Lamp here. 200 now, 225. Anybody else? At 225, are you sure? At took it, 25 and then 50 now. 25, half, 25 and then 50 and 25 and then and 25, 50. What do you say? At 25 and then 50, 25 and then 50, 25 and then 50. Fair warning, 225 now, two and a half. <laughs> Sold it right there. 282, coming along, King Glass Co., another coin dot melon lamp here at 200, now 225, and then 200, 225, and then 200, 225, and then 200, 25, and then 250, 25, and then 50, at 25, and then 50, fair warning, 25, and then 50, last chance, final call, at 225, and then 250, and 25, and then half, Sold it right there. Moving along to 283. Eason, the cranberry opalescent lamp. What do you say on this one? 275, 300 now, 275, 3. At 275, 300, 275, 300, 275, 3. At 275, 300, 275, 300, 275, 3. Then fair warning, 275, now 3. <laughs> Sold it right there. 284, Sheldon Swirl, opalescent. Swirl lamp at 225, 250, now 75, 50, now 75, 50, now 75. What do you say? I have 250, 275, and then 250, now 275. Fair warning. At 250, 275, and then 50, now 75, and then 50, 75. Took it 300. At 75, 3. At 75, 3. At 75, 300, 75, 300, 75, and now 300. <laughs> Sold it right there. 285, Hobbs Blue Opalescent Seaweed Lamp at 200, 75, 300, 75, 4. At 375, 400, 75, 400, 75, 4. Took it. 25, now you're out. You have to be 4, 20. Five at 425 and then 400, 425, you're out. At 425, you're out. At 425 and then 425, do you want 450? Fair warning, 25 and then 425, sold it right there. And then 486, it's the Diamond Glass Company Bullseye Finger Lamp. Ah, yes, it's a great example and it's a rare example. What do you say on this? The bullseye finger lamp. I have 600, and now how about 650? This is a rare lamp. It has the blue base and the applied handle, Diamond Glass Co., seldom seen. It's in Thoreau's book, page 270. 
We have 600, 650 on this particular lamp, two-tone. 600, 650. It's the age-old thing. Find me another one. 600 now, 650 where? I have 600 now, I have 700. 750, please. I have 700, 750. At 700, 750. How bad do you want it? 700, 750. I have 700 on the board. 750 where? 700, 7 half, 700, 7 half. At 700, 750, my hammer's in the air. At 700, 750, 800, 850. You're still out. 800, 850, 800 now, 850. Hammer's in the air. Is that it? Ready to let it go? 800 now at 850, please. Now 900, and now 950, please. At 900, 950. Bet you won't find another one anytime soon. 900, 950. This is an old collection, an old maritime collection this particular collection of lamps. 1,100 on the diamond glass bullseye finger lamp. Hits on all levels, really. Bullseye, actually. 1,100, 1,011, 12, 1,300, 1,200, 1,300. It's a bullseye as far as collectability goes. 12, 1,200, 1,300, please. I have 1,200, 1,300, we have to run, fair warning, at 1,200, 1,300, kiss it goodbye, 12. And now 1,300, fair warning, 1,400, 13, 14, and back to you, 1,500. Back to you, 1,500. 14, 15, that's a rare lamp. 1,400, 1,500, 1,400, 1,500. And there's no apologies for condition on this one. 1,400, 1,500. You'll be very thrilled with the condition and you'll be thrilled with the lamp. 14 and 1,500, fair warning. Final call at 1,400, 1,500, 14, 15. Hammer's going down at 1,400, 1,500, 14, now 15. 1,400, now 1,500. <laughs> Sold it right there, 14. Thank you very much, by the way. 287, carved bald eagle with prey here. 75 1, 75 100, 75 1, 75 100, 125, and then 1, 125, and then 1, 125. At 100, 125, and then 1, 125, and then 1, 125. At 100, 125, anyone else? 100, 125, and then 1, 125. <laughs> Sold it there. 288. Pig and Southdown Lamb by Gordon McCartney here. A run of Gordon McCartney. Wow, what, a, what an incredible talent, really. In fact, one of the best, a very lesser known folk artist here. 125, 150, 125, 150. At 125, 150, 125, 50 on the phone, 75, 75, 75. Took 150 on the phone, 75. Anyone else? 150 on the phone, 75. Final call, 150, 175, and then 150, 175. <laughs> Sold it there at 150. Folks, get your bids in. Get your bids in. 289, don't lose this deal. 289 is the horse carving by Gordon McCartney. This is the horse carving. 225, 200 now, 25, and then 225, 225. I have 225, fair warning. And 25, 50, 25, now half. 25, 50, 25, half. Anybody else? 50, 75, took it. 50, 75, that's 275. 50, 75, fair warning. 250, 75. Last chance and final call. 50 here, 75 where? Sold at 250. And then 290. The Red Fox by Gordon McCartney here. 275, 300. These all from the Jim Fleming collection. 275, 3. 275, 3. 275, 3. Took at 325. Took at 350. At 25, 50. 25, 50. 25, 50. So well done. 50, 75. So well done. 50, 75, 400. 400, 75, 400, 75, 4. At 75, 400, 75, 4. At 425 then. Took 400 there. 425. 
25 where at 425 425 425 fair warning at 25 and 25 425 and 400 now 25 sold it right there 291 as we move along to the crow by gordon mccartney here 225, 250, 25, 50, 75, 3, 275, 3, 25, 350, 75, 4, 75, 400, 75, 400, 75, 400, 75, 4, and 425, and then 425, 425, 425, and then 50, and 25, 50, thank you, 425, 450, one of the great ones, 25, 50, at 25, 50, fair warning now, 75, 75, 50, now 75 anybody else 475 450 475 yeah. yes on the phone 500 now 475 5 last chance and final call 475 500 on the telephone sold on the telephone with Ben 292 the flying Canada goose by Gordon McCartney there what do you say on this 300, 325, 3325, 3325, took it 350. At 25, 50, 25, and then 300, 50, 25, 50, 25, 50, 25, and then 350, your turn, took it 75. On the phone, 350, 75. Yes, and 425. I took the 400 on the phone, 425, 425, and then 425, fair warning, and 50, and now 75, and 75, 5. Yep. Yes, 550 now, 500, 550, 556. Yep. Yes, 600, 650 now at 6 on the telephone, 650 now at 600 on the telephone, 650 where? Hammers in the air, final call, 600 now, 657. Yep. Yes, and now 750. I have 7 on the phone, 750. My hammer is in the Air at 700, 750. Last chance and final call. 700 on the phone. 750 on you. Sold it. 7434. 293. Carved Rooster by Gordon McCartney. One of the great ones here. 325. 350. At 50 now, 75. 50 now, 75. 50 now, 75. 75, 400. At 75, 400. 75, 400. 75, 400. 75 now, 4. Took it. 25. Took it. 450 now. 425. 450 now, 75. 50 now, 75. What do you say? 50 now, 75. Up to you. 75, 500, 550, 600, 5 and a half now, 6. 550, 600. 550, 600. 5 and a half now, 6. It's on you. What do you say? 556. Are we all in and all done? My hammer is in the air. 550, 600. 5 and a half, 600. 556, 550, 600, and took it, 650 now, 650, fair warning, hammers in the air, 650, 700, 650, 700, 650, now 700 on the rooster, 650, 700, fair warning, are we all in and all done, 650, 700, last chance, final call at 650, 700, 650 now, 700, sold it there sold it there and we are finito thank you very much for joining us of course ramping up for our sales on the 25th and 26th of march canadiana and some folk art and some historic objects followed by the lighting collections of valerie lister we also have the keith dill collection and we also have the david broughton collection, the late David Broughton collection, all featured on the 26th, historic lamps and lighting. We can't wait for what's to come. And guess what? The best is yet to come here at Miller & Miller Auctions. Thank you so much for joining us today, and we'll see you next time.